SpongeBob, SpongeBob, Patrick, Patrick. <laughs> As you can see, there's a save file over there, you guys. We're getting rid of it. The <laughs> We're burying the memory because we tried to record this game probably close to three times before we got our audio set up good. Yeah, you could say that. Um, Lagu, Lagoon. The fucking goo lagoon. Um, in any event, I'm Addison. And I'm... <laughs> He's John. No, I'm John, by the way. <laughs> um... Fucking everyone give John a round of applause in the, in the chat. Yeah. Woo! He knows For why. What? You know why. Cause I because I fucked up the Cause, audio. No, because you edit and you 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 set shit up and you Oh shit. I like uh being risen up by a you're, friend. And you know what? You're Everyone, the responsible one. Three cheers to Addison for being like responsible to like drive an hour to my home also. That's kind yeah. of the Well, we have a good exchange. You know, I'm the funny one and you're the responsible <laughs> yeah, I'm one. The respons- yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're the one that everyone wants to meet and I'm just like kind of there and I keep the ship afloat and everything. You said it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All, All right, right come fair. on. Okay, Gary, I'll find the fucking thing. Like, I feel like he does like that type of dialogue. Oh, every for sure. Time. He, Fuck he, off. That's like SpongeBob's bit in this game, and he relies on it a little too hard, honestly. Um. Yeah, but I like it. Yeah, but I, yeah, but I yeah, but I like. Yeah, but 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 yeah, Porky Pig ass. God. Fuck, dude. Yeah, this guy hates signs, bro. Why'd you install them in your home if you don't I, like them so much? I'm just saying my home. SpongeBob, SpongeBob, Patrick, Patrick, Squidward, Squidward, Squidward. I'm gonna speed run this shit. Watch, you're gonna be impressed. You're gonna Th- be like, this actually well, is very impressive. I remember when I when I was playing, you were like, why are you just fucking walking into the wall? It's <laughs> no, like I was doing shit that I wasn't even realizing I was doing, and then you were like, why are you doing that? And I'm like, why am I doing that? <laughs> you're you're nice with it, bro. You're nice with it. Don't thanks, even man. Even if you don't mean it, I really I do. Appreciate that. I mean it. You're, Spun, Spun, Spun. you're better than me at most most fucking games we play on this shit. I did. I did. Period, just eat Tony Hawk's ass. You did. You did a good <laughs> job. I don't think you ate his ass. Today. That might be dramatic, but okay, fair enough. But you Fuck, gotta see like the later dude. games, bro. I will actually destroy Tony you Hawk's shred? Underground One and Two. Once we get to like kind of the more um, recognizable controls and everything once once tony hawk finds his footing so will i you know oh that's a good that's a good analogy yes. you and tony you're one bro yeah, yeah, yeah. you know you know what's weird? i stood up and then i sat back down and i was like i i'm full of energy now i was like really tired and then i stood up and sat down and i was like that's the exercise i needed to keep it going um i'm glad bro yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, again i'm we 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 feed off of one another yeah, yeah, yeah i think that's the thing too because sometimes i'll do like a solo video and i'm just like I stopped the recording because I'm like, I feel like I'm boring right now. Like, I feel... Yeah, well, you don't get the same chemistry when you're alone, right? Yeah, like, like you, I have to, like, really be in the mood to do, like, a solo thing like that. I hear um, that, brother. So, you know, totally understand. Trust me, I fucking hear that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I do hope to return to my solo No, content. bro, fuck. No, I fuck. think you still make You still make it. <laughs> By the time that... <laughs> bro, calm down. Um... Yeah, by the, by the time that this comes out, uh, I will have hopefully uploaded a couple videos on my main channel again. Oh, yeah? And uh, and you will have hopefully... Streamed, perhaps. Streamed, put out, put out what you're putting out. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Rebrand it. Yeah, like, like you know, let, let's talk about it. Because what I want to do, right, I want to... Um, I have a couple goals. I, I want to do kind of longer form content. I want to do that stuff that you see on the on the YouTube pages where you're like... Oh, that seems like an interesting video concept. Like yeah. fucking, I did. I recorded this thing a couple of months ago where it was. I did. I did Yakuza like a dragon, um, with only uh, Ichiban, who's like the the lead party member. Um, and I want to make like a little video, like can you beat the game with only? Um, oh, I didn't know you did that. Yeah, yeah, I did a couple of months ago, and I I recorded all the footage. I did I did a full playthrough, and you know there may or may not be an answer. I also got this really goofy mod that like gets rid of it, like literally just fucking warps the party members out of existence. Oh, are they forced upon you otherwise? Yeah, yeah, they're for yeah, you can't like swap you could swap there's like I think there's like seven in total. You could swap them out. Um you know, at will and stuff, but like you need to have four and then you actually need to keep uh, the main guy Ichiban because if he dies then you lose like you game over. Oh, interesting. So. so it's sort of it's sort of like an older Yeah. Um, older style in that regard, mm. right? Yep. And I also want to make, it? um, here's another idea. Uh, let me just think out loud. I, I wanted to make these bingo, you know how people do tier lists and everything? Yeah. I want to do like bingo cards because that's like a kind of underrated thing. People will do like a bingo card for like a movie coming up and okay. it's like a fun thing to do amongst friends. I want to do like a, like a Spider-Man, uh, two, uh, PS5 
bingo card. Of that like, would be cool. Will this thing happen? Will it not? I actually got to put that out soon if I'm putting it out. You yeah, know? like now. I got to make it like you know to for the for the algorithm that is. Well, more than that, just from from an actual like release standpoint, the game is coming out in a few weeks, October twentieth. Which by the time this set comes out, it will have already came out. And oh, um, dude, I'm telling you, bro, if certified we, ten if in we, my opinion. Eh, we'll see. What? You gotta hit the button again. Fuck. Are you yeah, for? Yeah, yeah. Oh, thanks for the reminder. I got you, bro. Oh, you're kidding. Because you were like waiting for something to come back that I wasn't was. wasn't there. Oh, you got it. You got it. So here's my beef with with Spider-Man Two. Not okay. to say that I have beef, mm -hmm. but I think the first Spider-Man. Oh, it's fine. Um, the first Spider-Man. Are you okay, is, bro? No. <laughs> the, the first Spider-Man is like kind of lackluster in my opinion. What? And what I mean by that? Hear me out. Is that it's a fantastic title, but okay, fuck off, bro. Go to Squidward House. Uh, yeah. Thank Sorry, you. I'm back seating. Uh, it's fine. I, I didn't do that when you were playing, but it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Also, I would like to point out that you were like, yeah, 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 you, you, you got this, you got this for the uh, opening section that you already played. Mm -hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then we lost all the fucking recording. Yeah. So, we recorded so now for like I'm two cleaning hours. up is what what is, what my goal is. It was like four hours wasted because. Maybe even more because you you drove here. It's like an hour drive. We recorded for like two two and a half hours. All the audio was fucked because yep. I was having some weird like recording glitch on my uh -huh. fucking software, which I thought was a problem with my fucking preamp that I use for like our our mic setup. But no, it was OBS. I literally ordered another preamp so that we could. Oh, I didn't know you did that. I, yeah, dude, I ordered another one and God then returned the the old one. Okay, you got your money back for that. I got my money back, but it. Like the preamp wasn't the problem, so that was just kind of like a you know a big ass waste. Well, uh, as long of time. as you as long as you got their money back, yeah, whatever. And then I reinstalled OBS, which we used to like um you know have the have the video on the screen and then record our voice at the same time. And now it works. And now it like yeah, just I just had to reinstall OBS for some reason, which makes no goddamn sense, but it is right. what it is. So um, where was I going with this? You were telling a story. Yeah. <laughs> and then, dude, the, the ability of Let's Players to, like, remember their point that they were making and then come back to it is actually insane. I don't know how they do that sometimes. I'm typically pretty good with it, and then I just... Out the window. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Spider-Man. Oh, okay, so he, thank you. You thought it was lackluster, and then I cut you off. So then, it wasn't the fact that it was lackluster, but, like, when we compare it to the other shit that came out this year, that year, which was RDR2 and God of War 2018... Um, for reference, mm -hmm. um, it lacked it. Its main story content was great outside of like the stealth missions. Mm -hmm. Um, but its its extra content was really unenjoyable in my opinion. Oh, like um, the DLC stuff? No, no, I haven't even played that yet. I'm working on that now. Okay, like, personally, but the um, the sort of like end game content, like the side the side quest and shit like that. Interesting. Yeah, that's. I mean, that's my opinion, but. I I thought that it was I just love the traversal in that game so much that it makes up for any other potential like issues I could have with the game. See, and I don't disagree, but as like a story person, um right. I and like someone that enjoys side content when it's good. Mm -hmm. I just found the 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 traversal to not be like it was it's Spider-Man, you know? Like I feel like web like good web swinging should be a minimum inside of Spider-Man. Yeah, but, like, it's just, to me, I think it's so good, it's so satisfying, and, like, I mean, you could tell, too, because people make those, like, uh, you know, TikTok edits of, like, the crazy, like, swinging around the city and stuff, and, like, it looks so cinematic and everything, like, I think, uh, I think it's probably the best swinging in a Spider-Man game. I know the Spider-Man 2 game on, like, GameCube and PS2 and stuff I'm going to fucking has it. some, um, you know, has some, like, physics-based swinging and everything. However, it doesn't look very cinematic. It looks kind of goofy, like just just from a how it looks. That's not really th that's not really how it looks when he swings in the actual movies and stuff, you know? Yeah. Because it's just the same like swing animation and stuff where you're holding onto the web and stuff. Like it, I don't know. It's it's I prefer kind of cinematic and flashy, but also functional over like purely functional. Mm kind of to a T where like there's like a barrier to entry and everything. Yeah. I, again, I don't disagree. It's more so just the aspect of like for me, mm -hmm. good web swinging is a minimum. And that's for not, sure. That's for not sure. enough to Sorry to get off the point, but yes, I, I entirely agree. 
that's not enough to really like salvage a um a fine story, you know, a good story, but but a you know mediocre side content, and not a great not a great DLC content if I remember correctly. I actually didn't play the DLC. I've heard um, I've heard I, fine uh, things. I yeah, I like I like the. Uh, uh, but I do like the base game a lot. I just remember when it came out, I was super excited for it, and I am again here because I feel like they're really just gonna improve on what's already there. You're gonna be able to play as fucking Peter and Miles and shit. Well, this is not an advertisement, but it might as well be the way that I am going to uh, love this game till it's dying breath. And so that goes into my next point. Mm -hmm. I enjoyed Miles Morales a lot more. I think so too. I agree. Like Miles Morales was debatably my my game of the year of 2020. Now, what do you think was different about it that you liked so much more? Um, its length was a lot more manageable, especially from a DLC pers or a side content perspective. A lot of people want more from from games. I, I think like a more bite-sized, enjoyable piece of content is better than a fucking buffet, in my yeah. opinion. Well, I don't think either game is particularly long, though, is the thing. It's not like... I don't think anyone's complaint about Spider-Man PS4 was that it was long. Um... No, and I, I wouldn't disagree, but it is not nearly as palatable in its length as Miles Morales, in my opinion. No, I agree with that. I think Miles Morales, but also like I, I think if that is what you want, then you're not going to be happy with two because two is definitely no. Gonna... Apparently, two is only. Well, can I talk about it? Sure. Apparently, two spoilers, is spoilers. By the way, I guess for not like, really spoilers because the game's not out. It's just for you know for dis like discussion about de details about that have length. been yeah details that have because I've seen this too. It's on Twitter and stuff like yeah news about. But go ahead. Uh, its main story is only like seventeen and a half hours. But like same with the first game. That, that's horseshit. If you read that tweet, it says about the same as the original game, which is you know about that length. But and even I, even a hundred percenting it, thirty hours. No, same with the first game. I I still call horseshit on uh, that. skill issue. I don't know what to tell you. I mean, you could call it skill issue. That just means I'm, that just means I'm playing on a harder difficulty than you. So. No, you're not. I'm. I, I think that game is too easy. I mean, I play on the hardest difficulty, but it's yeah. whatever. You know. I I don't think that the Spider-Man game should be hard. To be honest, he's like one of the most. I would agree. Recognizable, like like you know. Everyone in their mom is gonna play the the Spider-Man game. I don't think that it should be a necessarily hard game. I do like when games have like a hard mode, but that's something that I was gonna talk about with God of War 2018. What is that? I play a lot of games on the hardest difficulty. Um, that game on the hardest difficulty, is stupid. It's stupid, but I don't think it's fair. Yeah, but well, I that's, think that's the level. You but I th but no no. But I think Ragnarok is fair. Really? So my my rationale is that. Can't do that. And I, uh, maybe I'm maybe I'm too. E I mean, we've been recording for like three hours, so I, you know, pardon if I'm not very like you know well spoken in my point. But um, I th and this is spoilers, I guess too. Spoilers for God of War Ragnarok, which yeah, and God of War 2018 like this past year. 2018 yeah, yeah, yeah. is less of a concern. Um, but spoilers for both, regardless. Uh, so you have the blades and the axe for. All of God of War Ragnarok. There's never a point where you don't have those two weapons, right? Yep. Um, you get a third weapon and everything. That's whatever. It's true. Those two weapons, the the blade. So the blades are extremely good at medium range, mid range, right? Yep. The axe is really good at close range and at long range. When when you play most of the game and you only have like a close and long range, what I think that 2018 like. There's sections where you only have the axe, and then there's sections where you only have the blades. That's correct. When you go to hell, you only have the blades, because you can only damage the people in hell with the blades or whatever. Yes, because they're, they're ice people. But I think, I don't, correct me if I'm wrong, I'm pretty sure that, well, you go to hell as Atreus in Ragnarok, right? I don't think you go as Kratos. No, I think you go as both. I just don't remember. I, I don't remember, and if if so, then I don't remember. Because their, remember, Atreus you gets could, you, and then you go back and you fucking hunt down the wolf that he like freed. Oh, you might be right, but that's the thing is that I'm pretty sure you can damage the guys in hell with the um, axe. Also, you can once their like ice shield is broken. They have like yeah, a, yeah, yeah. they introduced in Ragnarok this sort of like elemental shield mm -hmm. where you have to use the the weapon the weapon opposite its element. So right. Like, Ice enemies, you use the blade. Fire enemies, you use the fucking mm -hmm. axe. Um, and then I don't think the other weapon has a fucking element attached to it. I could yeah. be wrong, but... But my, my roundabout point is that I feel like a lot of... The game is made 
2018 should be made with, you know, all levels of range in mind. Because, like, when you're playing, like, God of War, the original, the beat-em-up and everything, the Devil May Cry-esque mm -hmm. game, um, you're pretty much, like, long range with, with your blades always, and they can cover kind of all ranges. Nice. With the added, with the added kind of you know camera angle and everything, the range at which you can be effective at is much more important. I feel. Yeah. Um, and I feel that for yeah most of the game you don't have that option, and it's not much of a problem on lower difficulties. But when you play a game on a higher difficulty, you really see the cracks in like the design. Mm. You know, it's re it's really I, I like to play games on the hardest difficulty because it, it it's a testament to how how well the gameplay elements work in the game, you know? Okay. What they decided to tweak to make the game more difficult. I find that one, which this is kind of frustrating, and they they, they nerfed it in Ragnarok also. In 2018, um, if you are on the hardest difficulty, you either get one shot or you get two shot if you have... So fucking dumb. You know, if you picked up all the health and everything upgrades. They tweaked this a little bit in Ragnarok, so you get like three or four shot now, which I think is like just a huge yeah, that's a massive improvement. It, it seems like they put a lot of thought into it instead of just saying like, okay, you just you know you're just playing one shot mode, and then it's like very unforgiving. I'm um, also in 2018. You have like the stagger mechanic, which is like they have like the bar that builds and everything, or the stun mechanic. I think yeah, where it. you get the glory kill. Yeah, yeah. When you play on the hardest difficulty, you never get that. Oh. The only time you get it is when, like, the bar builds very, very slowly, but you always kill them beforehand, or the bar appears once they're, like, 1 HP. And that's just because they're, like, so low. The only way that I've gotten it, conceivably, is by cheesing with the axe, just constantly throwing it at fucking someone's head, and then eventually the, the bar grows enough and you're, you know, able to do it and everything like that. Gotcha. You're able to, like, kill them. So that was just, like, I feel like an oversight that they fixed in Ragnarok as well. Um, a lot of the combo moves, so, so God of War, by its very nature, he's the God of War. You should be rewarded for using a primarily offensive play style, yet cheesing with the axe is one of the best ways to play um, 2018, like cheesing with the axe throw mm -hmm. and everything. Um, so you're not really rewarded for a very offensive play style, but rather like a zoning one, which like, that's not, that's not Kratos, bro. No, and that's not fun for the player either. Yeah. Um, and uh, also, like, the close-range moves, like, I feel like they didn't, like, do any oversight on, like, the stun. Not the stun, but, like, the hit stun that enemies have and everything. Because mm -hmm. you'll be doing, like, a combo, and, like, many, many combos are unsafe after, like, the second hit of the combo, basically. Because they take too long to swing the axe, or it's just not, you know, it's just not worth for one reason or another. Which, there's a lot more moves that directly combo into like a fade away move in Ragnarok. There's a lot more moves that they've like expanded the kit of the blades and of the axe so that no matter what enemy you're fighting, you, you know, are like, okay, this is a good, um, this is a good fucking weapon to use. This is, these are good moves to use on the, on the enemy. And they also reward you in Ragnarok for using the different abilities. There's like a level up system on the skills themselves just from using them, which I feel like some people didn't realize. No, I, I recognize it that. It took me kind of late into the game to even notice it, really? to be honest. Because it wasn't in, in 2018, and I kind of played them back-to-back. -back. Oh, so okay. I kind of just wasn't looking. And only some of the moves like have that feature. So, you know, using the same move 50 times, you level it up, and then you get like an added like thing to it. And there's like customizability and stuff, mm -hmm. which I, I don't particularly remember the um, first game having. I don't think it did. For the skills? For the skills, yeah. Um, It did a little. It was like oh, a counter thing where like, it would be like, oh, you've used the skill X amount of times and then you can, in 2018, and then you can upgrade it. And there's Oh, up you know what? No, 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 yeah, no. Yeah. I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Don't listen to me. Yeah. Um, what I will say, though, is that the hardest difficulty is definitely balanced for Kratos and not Atreus because Atreus is, like, very strong in his sections no matter what. Like, he... Well, yeah. He does not... No, no, but I mean, like they—they they oh, made those fuck. sections like a lot easier, basically. I don't—I don't think you need to bring a. No, I don't. Yeah. yeah. You don't need to bring the Wawa melon all the way. The Wawa melon. Mm-hmm. All right. Yep. That's what um, I'm calling it these days. But uh, sorry, that's my long ass fucking rant to say that like, I and also like a lot of the enemies, the way that the AI works is they'll just kind of attack independently of each other, or they'll like go out of their way to like fucking time their attacks at the exact same time so you get like fucking comboed and it doesn't seem like it's in like the most deliberate way where like 
they're not doing because they're smart they're doing because they're like that's just the way the timing of their attacks work yeah i really feel like in ragnarok they coordinate a little bit better with their attacks and stuff in like a more fair way but also in like a smarter way yeah they probably made the um the ai a bit better yeah um but uh no I, you know but you know my, my point is I, I play games on the hardest difficulty because it it can show the cracks of the gameplay design that was a complaint i had i played uncharted 4 recently it was a very similar um yeah i can't imagine situation. the uncharted games are fun on hardest difficulty but they but two and three rock like two and three are really good on crushing difficulty i think it's the best way to play them i don't buy that it's true and i'll and we'll play it right here on the show uh i actually do need to play uncharted 4 funny enough it's uh pretty it's still per i i still i give it like a like a seven out of ten that's a really like well what's your average I mean, average for me would be like a five out of ten. Like I, like I really? do. I, I feel like I do ratings that many people would not like. You know, it, I don't, I don't do like the IGN ratings and everything. Like my average is a seven. Like this game, I'd give it like a six out of ten. You are so bugging, bro. <laughs> That's the worst opinion I've heard in a and long time. And I like time. this game a lot. No, you don't. Not a six out of ten. But no, like that's unless the you're th just judging it critically without like no, no. But that's the thing, right? Like people hear six out of ten, they think it's like a failing score. You know, they think it's like a fucking, they think it's like a failing score, but it's not. It's you know, it's all that to say that I, you know what? You don't need to bring the watermelon. You could ground pound in front of those guys and then throw them at the button. You remember? You did not do that. I didn't, but that's that's what like I'm here again, and because I was fucking up on the section for like. You know, days, Ten years, brother. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, like I was going back and forth with the goddamn. Okay, it didn't work, John Hub. Okay, you didn't throw him far enough, though. So, oh, oh, so it's my fault, huh? Yeah. I didn't. This guy I'm sucks. You. It will work, by the way. Yeah, um, sure. no, I guess that's you know, I guess that's that's I gotta come clean about my rating system and everything. I. I, I'm I'm very I feel like I'm one of those fucking unfair ass teachers that's very reluctant to give like a perfect score, you know? Yeah, I th I think you are. You're I wrong love in giving that. nine out of tens. That's what I'll say. What? I love giving nine out of tens. I love being like I want to give this game a ten, but I I just didn't like this one thing about you know. What's your what's your so what's your most recent nine out of ten? My most recent Fuck. 9 out of 10. Because that's the thing. Because a lot of my 9 out of 10s, I'll be like, it might be a 10, though, bro. I don't know. One one game I'm on the fence about okay. that just comes to mind immediately is um, Ghost of Tsushima. Um, 6 out of 10. What? <laughs> what? I won't back down from that opinion either. Why? I'm not a big fan of it. For what reasons? Um, I think the story is weak. No! I don't like Jin Sakai as a <laughs> protagonist. I cry in front I of don't, you. I don't like the side characters that much. They're they're fairly uninteresting to me. That's the side crazy. content is good, but That's only crazy. the theme side content, like the like the like the legendary <sighs> items or whatever, but all of it sort of follows the same the same method. Mm -hmm. Um the coolest part about the game is the fucking samurai one on one fights, and even then it's just they're pretty repetitive. Because there's so many of them. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's somewhere around like 18 in the game. I could be wrong. That might be high. Now, what difficulty did you play on? I did play on normal or the one above normal. Okay. But I wouldn't play that on the hardest difficulty anyways because I feel like the combat being how it is would be a level of unforgiving I don't want to interact with mm -hmm. on the hardest difficulty. So here's the thing. They make it in the hardest difficulty so that it's, I mean, it's called lethal difficulty. They make it so that you um, take more damage from everyone, obviously. Everyone's like, the, you know, the AI is smarter, but also you do more damage. Okay. You actually feel like you're wielding a katana because you can like fucking two or three shot people and it feels like really fucking good. I, I actually don't know what it feels like on lower difficulties because, you know, I haven't, I didn't play it on lower difficulties. Look, and that is cool to an extent. You yeah, know, yeah. Don't get me wrong. But, but I, th also, I think the game is literally, like, it feels like the definitive way to play the game, in my opinion. I don't know about that. It do. But it's hard, though, I will admit. But also, it's hard, but also you, you feel very justified, like, picking up every single collectible. Because some games, like, you have so much shit that you can pick up, you can do all the side quests and just, like, absolutely steamroll. I feel like I did, like, most, I did about... 50 to 60 percent of the side content leading up to the final battle and i still like kind of struggled a little bit really and i uh i appreciate that 
I, mean, I wish I had done that. more. I don't know. It just the game the game did not rub me the right way, frankly. I wasn't super excited about it before it came out. I bought it on launch. I played it fully. Mm. And like was it beautiful? Yes. Was it entertaining? Sure. Was it something I'm I've gone back to to play the Iki Island DLC since? No. And I see I see no reason why I would. See no reason why I would. Understandable. You know what? I'll I'll I'll, I'll give you an understandable. What the fuck? What? Oh, that's Bikini Bottom. Mm. There we go. Navig oh, we did this last time. Or we? Nah, nah. Just just like just keep moving. Yeah, I know. I'm pretty sure it's like up ahead. I don't think it is. No, no, because remember what, what what happened is that we went to King Jellyfish and then we oh, went through you know, the. We came back, yeah. Yeah, we went back. It's at the, the end of this. It's at the end of this. Yeah. Good reminder. Yep, yep, yep. <sighs> see, see, this is the this is the good thing about foresight. Could you imagine there's a Let's Play channel that would like practice every single game they played and the conversation topics before they they made practice it to record. the conversation topics? No, no. Wouldn't that be crazy if someone like did that like just painstakingly like like wrote dialogue for the fucking scripted events in their let's play and everything you like know what's fully. crazy people mm. do that they, i'm i'm almost sure that that's not as uncommon as you think it is i think that people will script like bits and stuff people will have like discussion points i'm saying like a full scripted you know 20 minute episode of a fucking spongebob let's play no i think they do that i, I don't think they script things like spongebob spongebob, SpongeBob, SpongeBob. you know that's which is why they don't do it Patrick, Patrick. And also, there's a level of us. Fuck. There's a level of our there's ad libbing. Of fuck. Uh -huh. That that can't be scripted, you know. That's true, but I think that's the case for a lot of other let's play. I I do think that some people do research before, and I think that some people who are doing like a more informative let's play where they're kind of giving uh, you know fun facts and stuff, they'll do that kind of stuff. But I I would say there are zero. Let's plays that don't include at least a, a hefty amount of improvisation, Bec just based on how, uh, you know, simple the formula is. You know, yeah. how uh, it's it's you know it's definitely lower effort than you know the videos that I was talking about at the at the top of this recording and stuff, making you know, M far far less editing. It's it's really just uh, two friends talking right. in front of a damn vi Fuck. video game. You know, which way do I go? Not this way. Oh, well, then I want to go this way because I want to get some shit. Well, how do you how do you feel now that you got some shit? I'm bad. <laughs> really? Yeah, I didn't get anything. Oh. So you got some shiny bits. Yeah, it doesn't do anything for me. Well, in any event. I hope um, you find what you what you want in you, life. I won't. Did you play the Fallen, <laughs> did you play Fallen Order? <laughs> yeah, bro. Same issue, bro. No, Fallen Order was great on the hardest difficulty. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Was, Fall, was Fallen Order the... um? The sequel? No, Survivor was the sequel. No, Fallen Order is the same. Remember, you remember that you are bogging. There was that. Um, that is actually no, no, no. I don't. I don't think it's fair. I. I think there's some very unfair enemies, like the fucking lizard frog guy, like at, on the very first planet. And also, what? so here's here's another aspect of hardest difficulty games. Okay. Sometimes the very beginning of the game will be the fucking hardest part because. I mean, for one, you're you're getting used to the mechanics and stuff. Number two, you don't have the same amount of upgrades. Number two, you don't have like yeah, you don't have the fucking upgrades. You don't you have like fucking two HP and everything. You can go around. Yeah. Um. Yeah, you have like fucking two HP, and then everything like you know chunks the shit out of you if you don't have any like side stuff. So yeah, I think in that game, the very first planet is like the hardest part of the entire game. You but Ogdo Bogdo is an optional encounter. But like, we all fought him, right? Yeah, but like you I don't think you can complain about the difficulty of the game for an optional encounter. Especially when the whole point of the game in its Metrovania style is to be able to leave and come back later. I think that's disingenuous to the game. Well, like what is the reason that Ogdo Bogdo is a hard boss optionally? Is it because he's poorly designed or is it because he's difficult? I think it's I think it's a mix of both. I don't think it's the best designed uh, enemy in any respect. I think the side content doesn't need as much polish as the main content, but you still need to be able to, like, you know, not get cheesed by, like, a really shitty hitbox that the, that the you know, the fucking frog guy rushes forward his entire body. If you, you know, if you touch his fucking pinky toe when he's dashing in the opposite direction from you, you still, you know, take damage. Like, uh, you know, I, I, I feel like that's... 
I don't know. I man. don't mind hard difficulty because I like the Souls. I love Elden Ring. I love the Souls games. I love, you know, again, Ghost of Tsushima on the hardest difficulty. But. But I feel like those games are all, you like know. fair. Yeah, as no, fa I, yeah, I, like I fair. That. Like Dark Souls is fucking hard. Don't, don't get me wrong. There's some enemies that have some crazy, like, Dark attack patterns. But that's very intentional. Dark Souls 1 borders unfair. Objectively, mm -hmm. um, as someone that's played, there's some recently. yeah, there's some pretty nonsense sections. Um, I think I think by by Dark Souls three, they really got their stride though. Oh, one hundred percent. Dark like, Souls three. When, yeah, when, I, when I say Dark Souls, I'm talking Sekiro, three. Um, did you play Lies of P? I did not play Lies of P yet. That's actually something we should probably play on. Here. I'd be I'd be down, bro. I have Game Pass, you'd you'd so have be to down. play because that's the thing. I again, I I like the Souls games a lot. I'm not very good at them to be honest. I like playing games on hardest difficulty. I I suck at the Souls games. No, I'm pretty litty at the Souls games, I think. Well, I'd, I'd like it is actually it. a franchise and games that I, I think I'm pretty good at. I think I would be down to see that. Um, In any event, no, uh, Fallen Order is not fucking unfair in terms of its difficulty on the hardest difficulty. Survivor, however, its sequel that came out this March, mm -hmm. that shit is unfair on the hardest difficulty. I that's think an, that, honestly, that, order, I think that's a that's a that, just, my review of order is that it just feels really jank at certain parts. I don't disagree with that, but jank and blatantly unfair are two different things. But I just there you go, and then now it's King Jelly. Yeah, I I just I really feel like like the jankness because the jankness it shows more when you're playing on the hardest difficulty because you need to rely on the. On the gameplay, you need you need to you need to rely on the things that make the game the game, you know. Yeah. And when you rely on them, and then fucking Ogdo Bogdo's pinky toe fucking kills you, then that's not good. That's not a well designed game. It's down. I think it's down there. Yeah. And then it, it'll force you the other way. And then you have to. Yeah. There you go. I'm nice with it. Yeah. You are, aren't you? And then you have to talk to Squ Squidward, right? And then that's the last. Uh, yeah. It'll send me back. Spatula. I'm pretty sure you can just... Or does this just send you back to Squidward? I forget. It sent me back. To Squidward? No, it sends you to Jellyfish Rock, bro. Oh, yeah, back to Squidward at Jellyfish Rock. I'm going to populate <laughs> there right now. All right, let's see Squidward right here then. Sorry, my fault. Uh, what am I just getting you? Uh, uh, what am I just... Uh, suck your one. SpongeBob, SpongeBob, <laughs> Patrick. Yeah, I know. Patrick, Come on, man. Squidward, Squidward, Sandy, Sandy. Mr. Krabs, Mr. Mr. Krabs. King Neptune, Plankton. All right. All right. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Randy Rollins ran down the baseball diamond ring. I don't know. <laughs> Randy Rollins ran around the baseball ring. I think you're, I think you're um, pretty good at that. Actually. Yeah, thank you. All right, start it up. Um, what are we doing? And continue. What's up? What's up, gamers? We back. We're at back. it. We're SpongeBob. Back at it ba again. <laughs> in this bitch again. Um. So we we did uh, Jellyfish Fields, right? And that's yeah, it. Yeah. Right? Or did we start? Day. Nope. We did not. We do didn't start anything else. Okay. We got bottom yet. Yeah. We got like the bikini bottom. Some of the some of the thingies. We got. No. We can, I don't want we can go to Patrick go. to get a, a to free Patrick. spatula. Um, in any event, I'm Addison. Oh, I'm John. He's John. By the way, uh, do you think that we're going to like do all spatulas? Or are we going to do just the enough to complete? I the game? All, okay. So or I said this during the last recording, which will make it to our B roll in about three years from now. Mm -hmm. Um, but we're we're hundred percenting this bitch. You know, we're getting the the mystery SpongeBob Theater <laughs> three thousand, where. We're doing it all. Okay. Okay, we're doing it all. Do you know where all the socks are? No. We're not doing it all, gang. We'll, we'll find no, we it. No, could, we could do it all. We could do You're it all. You're the walking walkthrough. I guess I'm the walking walkthrough. That, that's what I um, like. The that's, mysterious walking walkthrough is is actually my uh my my pseudonym that I write under. Exactly. Like you're that's if anyone sees like a fantasy book under that pseudonym, that's him. Mm hmm that's, the, Yep. The walking walkthrough. You guessed it. All right. I can't jump up here, right? No. You can do your little triangle move, can't you? You could do your little. Or no. Sorry, why it won't. It won't latch onto the. Uh, or will okay, it? You know what? Mm -hmm. Fuck me. I guess. Huh? Um, <laughs> I could go here first too. Like yeah, a, I watch the speed run sometimes. Yeah, I'm kind of a speed runner myself, you know. Yeah, there, dude. The the world record holder uh, shift. He is so incredibly far ahead of like anyone else's time. I, I think. 
We, we talked about this before. Also. We talked about this in the first. I can't remember if that was our scrapped episode or not. That's I think probably it's, our, our scrapped, our I, scrapped roll where the audio was all fucked up. I don't think it is. I feel like this is our actual. That was in our actual first episode. I'm well, kidding. if I didn't say it before, I'm saying it now. Uh, shift, uh, crazy speedrunner, like five minutes ahead of the damn world record time, maybe even more, and I'm just like not. Uh, you know, I'm not. Uh, oh shit. When we shell out in about uh, three years, we could do a react video to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I like to think. That least. sounds good. Yeah, yeah, we just start doing reaction videos and stuff. I think I think once we build out our, our business empire, then then we'll be good. Yeah, our business empire. <laughs> right, he's got he's got lofty goals. Yeah, yeah. For, I've got our yeah yeah for John Hub and friends. At, at a, <laughs> you took your name out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's when you leave. That's when you leave because uh, then you have to rebrand because yeah, I, yeah. I just disagree with the business decisions. I try to go solo, but it doesn't work. Mm -hmm. and, and then we reunite five years later, like Smosh, but no oh, one gives dude, a shit. exactly. Well, hold on. No, no, no one gives a shit about us. About us, not oh, about them. Okay. The, Calm, I was going to say, I thought Anthony we, coming back to Sposh was fucking huge. I'm, you told me to stop with that bit, you know? No, 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 no. no. I'm, <laughs> I'm saying no one would give a shit if we came. We oh, can make okay. fun of ourselves, but I don't, you know, I don't want to sit here and, and, and make fun, fun of Smosh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I would never either. Legends of the game. Yeah, yeah, truly. No, they're just fun. They're just, they're just like fun dudes. I would, I would, you know, I would hang out with them. Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's, uh, all right, guys. Uh, we're, we're of similar sizes. Um, Channel wise, let's let's yes. collab, you guys. I mean, now we are, right? Yeah, yeah. They're, oh, yeah, yeah. Because they're, they're starting from scratch. Yeah, I see what you mean. exactly. They're building back up the empire. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. So <laughs> <laughs> they're at about uh, twenty million subs, and we're uh, we're close. We're close. Um, we're so. Where, where did I want to go with this? I had like something I wanted to ask or tell you or something. Mm -hmm, like I can't mm -hmm. fucking remember what it was. But uh, um, it, it, is it is it is it that guy? Is that guy the no. cutest uh, enemy in all of video games? He's not the cutest, but he's definitely a good looking a good looking jabroni. I'll tell you he's that much. Hot, bro. He's I wouldn't hot. say he's hot. Like I wouldn't fuck a disc, but like I let him do that to me. <laughs> you know. If we did a if we did a Pokemon Smasher pass, if we did a SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom enemy Smasher pass, he's he's Smash. Uh, yeah, for sure. I'm fucking the disc. I'm fucking the tartar sauce guy. You're fucking the tartar sauce. <laughs> I'm fucking the guy with the big hammer. I think. Oh, that's a good dude. Yeah, the meat yeah. hammer. A hundred percent. You know what they bro. say? I'm fucking Mrs. Puff. You're, whoa. I'm is she an enemy? No, I'm she's not an enemy. I'm fucking the big Patrick robot. I'm fucking the, the, the SpongeBob robot. Okay. Not the Sandy one? Nah, dude. That's basic. <laughs> that's that's too basic. That's All too right. basic. Um, I'm going to remember this time to grab the wheels. So, by the way, if you see a wheel backseat as fuck and, like, sure, yell sure. at me. Because Very well. No, I got you every step of the way. I think you got it, though. Those sinks are going fucking bananas, by the yeah, way. Yeah, it's kind of ridiculous. Not a fan. Oh, is that a sofa? Uh, no, Ahsoka's not in this game. Oh, my fucking God. Is that <laughs> no. a couch? <laughs> Where? They, they were throwing out the thing. No, I think it's a fucking sink basin. But the red thing, like, it was red. It looked like a couch, but it made the sound of a sink. I did not see that. Well, I am the wandering walkthrough guy. You so are I, the wandering walkthrough, so... I would, I would know these things. No, 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 you bounce by yourself. I can just do it like that, though. Okay, you can do it like that. That's that. a... It's not a couch, it's a love it's seat. A, it's a little love seat. Yeah, but you, you, you are right. It is furniture, that's, like, what's important. Okay. Hmm, um, what other enemies do you think you'd fuck? <laughs> I'd probably fuck any of the blocks. Or, like, these little robo-dudes with oh, the those guys just put your pee, pee in their in their mouths. Yeah, why not? And dude. they go hang, 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 hang. I would hope they don't do that. <laughs> That's what they do though. That shit would go crazy. That's the only motion that they do. I probably wouldn't for that reason. I probably would for that reason. Okay. That shit would be awesome. Fair enough. The flying ones though, they don't seem to do it as much. No, no, they definitely wouldn't be doing that. All right, Bubble Buddy, Smash or Pass? Uh, he's not an enemy in this game, but Smash. Okay. He's soap though, wouldn't that burn? Um, you say it would burn, I say it would be a spicy experience. Okay. We're not the same. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> what about that pool of hot sauce on the ground? Did you like that? And then if I if I run over here, like I have to run up this jaw. I think I think Sandra is. Nice, over there. dude. Fuck yes. Uh I'm just trying to do as much as possible. Because I know there's like something over here. Well, we got a hundred percent of a game to do, so... I know, we have a lot of it, shit. Is this one of those games where it's like a hundred and seventeen percent? Like, no. you know how some games are, are, are extra like that? Hollow Knight did that. Okay. Um, I'm not sure if you played that fantastic game. I didn't finish it, surprisingly really? enough. I just didn't, like, sometimes I have a backlog of games and then I start something and I'm like, this is gonna take too long. I don't know why I said that about Hollow Knight, but... 
Um, we, we no, should, that's a fair evaluation. You say Hollow Knight or Shovel Knight? Um, ho- like in terms of what? Like what you a just said. Now. I said Hollow Knight. Oh, okay, okay. Shovel Knight, I've been meaning to play, but I haven't. I haven't gotten around to it yet. Because Doesn't of, it have a little two-player situation? Can't I we? I think uh, it does. I think that wouldn't be the worst idea. It's like very Mega Man-esque, and you seem like a classic Mega Man fan. I'm a fan, I would say. Like, you just gave off Mega Man vibes, you know? Have you been following that guy I'm retweeting, Jay Easy, all yes. the time? Where they, he, it's, it's, he has a song called Mega Man. I'm going to plug Jay Easy. Uh, I was uh, school smart, not book smart, yeah. or something like that. <laughs> I was never book smart. I'm money was, smart. Oh, it makes me go. more intelligent. Call me Mr. Rock Festival. I got hella bands. You're really good at that. Thank you. Thank Has you. anyone ever told you that? <laughs> well, uh, it's Jay Easy. It's not me. Um, <laughs> no, it's it's you. Like, you, but then they interpolate it to like different songs. In, and I'm sorry, what? They interpolate it to different. So like they they do the you know the song itself with the words, but mm-hmm. then they make it sound like a different song. Okay. So they made it sound like the fucking uh, Mario RPG song. Where he's oh, like, there we go. I was never book smart. I'm money smart. <laughs> it works. Yeah, and, that's yeah, the like main it, one it I've just, seen. It just, I don't know how like people do that because I've tried to do it with certain songs and it just doesn't like work. Like it doesn't work with every song combination. It's probably a BPM issue. Are you looking at the correct? Yeah, it's probably yeah, it's probably like a BPM. It's probably just like the key that it's in maybe too. Could be I that. Don't, I don't know. I don't know. Well, I gotta learn some music theory because I. I I've done, uh, I've done, I've done acapella. I've, I've taken I didn't know voice that. lessons. You didn't know that? No, you mentioned that you like before we were recording or right when we started. You mentioned you did like singing warm ups or whatever, and I was like, "What the fuck is this dude talking about?" Yeah, yeah. Oh, you didn't know the about my about my troubled past. I I'm, a, I'm a tortured uh, singer. No, I, no. I, I, uh, I did voice lessons in high school, and then uh, like for singing, and then mm. I did uh, acapella uh, in college. And really, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. For, I didn't know that about for you for two years, and then um, really? took voice lessons again, like right out of college for like a year or so. Really, yeah, yeah. So, I was unaware of this. Are you so, big? You're a big singing guy. Then? I'm a singing guy. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a bass for any for any singers out there. Okay, uh, which is like the lowest uh, male voice part. Um, so all the. All the deep shit is what I'm is what I'm up to. All the deep shit. And my acapella career was literally just like you know we'd do um, any song and then I'd just be in the back fucking boom 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 boom. You know like I'd be I'd gotcha. be hitting the I'd be hitting the bum bums. You, you were know? more of like a, a beat guy. I would I would be hitting the beat a little bit. We had a beatboxer, mm. uh, but I wasn't the beatboxer. Uh, mm. But yeah, I would be hitting kind of those lower things. And then uh, <laughs> she just got so fucked <laughs> she up. Got fucking destroyed. <laughs> um, oh my god. Uh, but yeah, uh, there there were you know occasional parts times where we do like lower songs and stuff. But yeah, m- most of what I did was kind of just like uh, background singing because a lot of, especially a lot of acapella songs like have that tent. Fuck, that killed you fast. I as know. Fuck. They wanted you to die. It did want me to die. That so, hand is your biggest op. So you'd be doing a lot of a uh, lot of acapella shit. A lot of acapella shit. A lot of background stuff uh, That's because cool. a lot of, a lot of. Acapella songs are just made for like tenors, which are which is like the high voice parts. And yeah, stuff. the ah, uh, yeah, 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 that shit. There you go, there you go. Yeah, I'm kind of a musical god. Um, and then you yeah, did lessons for a while. The kind of uh, my ultimate goal is I just want to like be able to pull it out at like a party or something. Like that'd be, be a to, good like, ass trick. And I want to learn um piano too, just like a little bit of piano to like play along and everything. Mm. Um. But the reason I stopped, like, I stopped actually pretty recently doing lessons because um, I wasn't sure what my goals were anymore. You know, gotcha. like, I, I feel like singing wise, I've gotten to a point where I can improve on my own. I know I have the tools and I know what I have to do to, like, you know, practice and keep up with it and then also improve a little bit. Mm-hmm. Um, and then kind of what's next for me is to, you know, uh, I don't know, flex that shit a little bit and uh, put it out there and maybe have some goals, you know, if I'm trying to. Uh, do like gigs or something. Maybe that's maybe that could be a thing. I don't one know. of my uh, one of my coworkers did that shit. He uh, he's like um, big song guy, and he's a uh, mm-hmm. creative. He's a creative writer. Okay. Um, but in any event, with his like song shit, he started performing at like local casinos, mm-hmm. um, and doing like you know open mic nights and shit there. I like that. Yeah, he was he's like pretty decent at it too. He posts on YouTube and shit. So I would be down to check that out after this. Or if, I mean I do is is it is it pluggable? Do you want to plug it I'll pl- or I'll plug him. I'll plug right. Well, I don't know. I'll, do I really want to Ask him do- first. Ask him first. I'll ask we'll... him. I'll shoot him a text. He's All right, right guys. Uh, we either are or aren't going to plug him. How about we plug just a random person if he says no? 
and then no one will know the difference. All right, deal. <laughs> well, <laughs> Who no we, one will know for sure if it's him or not. We already plugged, what's his name? Jay Easy? Is that what his yeah, name Jay is? Yeah, Jay Easy. There yeah, we yeah. go. Okay. I was never book, book smart. smart. I'm I was money smart. smart. Makes you know. me more intelligent. Mega Man out January 6th. 7th, 7th. January 7th, I'm sorry. <laughs> My bad. Okay, I just finally... don't worry. Mega I... Man out January 7th. <laughs> Listen, I just love the fucking run that he does, too. Yeah, the little, I'll, like, I'll put up trot. visuals of Jay-Z while we fucking do it, but he's literally just, like, hauling ass. His legs are, like, alternating, like, left and right. Like, he, he is kind of running, like, how I'd imagine Mega Man would run in, like, Look, a I wish live the... action adaptation or something. I wish the... Fuck me. You're I wish good. the best for him, you know. I do. No, he rocks. Like I'm, I'm not even being like ironic. I, I, I actually like his music a lot. I think he's a really good rapper. Like his, um, his internet famity right now mm -hmm. is is very beneficial, and I'm happy for him. I yeah, hope, it, I hope he takes off. Yeah, it seems like he's taking it well too, because like I, you know, I feel like he, he it's easy to misconstrue that as like people clowning on someone, right? Like yeah. it's easy to. To see the, you know, someone interpolate your song to, like, the fucking Mario RPG song and think people are making fun of you. But, like, no. Like, I genuinely, it's like, I this guy's really good. And yeah. And I don't know. I would think that. I would think I would be clowned on, frankly. Yeah. Like, that's my, it's I think that's jokes. my, we've, I think we've talked about content a lot before. Mm -hmm. But, like, that's my big thing with content is, like, it's just anxiety inducing from, like, a clowning perspective, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not trying to get clowned on ever. Yeah. No, I feel that. You can only, I feel, my, my thing nowadays is, like, I can only get so upset about it because, like, at the end of the day, like, I'm a guy talking about video games on the internet. That's true. Um, so if someone is clowning on me, it's like, well, I don't know, get something better to do, you know? Yeah, like, you know, they should have lives. If someone is if someone is wasting their time clowning on someone talking about video games on the internet, I don't know, maybe they don't got a lot going for themselves. They probably don't. They probably don't. We'll have to pull this, uh, pull this clip up in 10 years when some loser, like, can't believe, can't believe Addison and John split up after all this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they disagreed on, uh, I don't know, Mario 7. Mm-hmm. What do you think about Mario 7? I don't know. Can you tell me which game is Mario 7? <laughs> All right. So for if we're assuming like... We're you, assuming you that the Super first Mario three, Bros. Right? 1 is Mario 1. Right. And then Mario 3 would be 3, obviously. Like that. that's that's a no-brainer. That's, that's true. I think World is 4. I would agree. I think that... Uh, does that make 64... Five, no, or does we, that make World 2 Yoshi's Island Mario 5? I would say World 2 Yoshi's Island is Mario 5 because we can't count the 3D games. At, I would count them as a separate series. Really? So you're just going just 2D games? Yeah, that would. That's when I say Mario, that's what I'm talking about. If I want to talk about a 3D Mario platformer, I'm going to say a 3D pl like Mario platformer. Well, if you look at main series Mario games, quote unquote, that includes 2D and 3D. And man, I don't know. So, so let me do both metrics then, because if we're talking about, was there a 2D game that came out between? Yoshi's Island and New Super Mario Bros. for the DS. You would know more than I would, frankly. I, I am so like out of the Mario scape because was, I I don't care for Mario. Was there a two? That's crazy. Was there a two? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're the Sonic kid, and I'm the Mario kid. Yeah, exactly. That's like I don't. I I mean, to be frank, I don't even care for the like 2D Sonic games that much. That's you know? crazy. I'm 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 you really fucking bad at 2D platformers. Like, if you think I'm like half decent at this shit which i'm probably not i am like five times worse at 2d platformers i happen to think you're pretty good for one thanks for two um uh oh, lost my train of thought here. um i forget what you were saying no i i i'm just thinking what would be mario 7 it would be like so new super mario bros 2 or something did like anything that. come out yeah, I guess nothing came out on. Was there any GameCube exclusive 2D Mario platformers before the new so. games on the DS? Because the new game started on the DS, didn't they? Yeah, I, I, I don't think so. I, I motherfucker. I think Mario Seven would literally be like the second new Super Mario Bros. game, which was I think was for Wii. Um, did not play that shit. We should we should play that. I think it'd be. I think I think I, we'd have a good time. It's four, I, it's up to four player. Funny enough, I cool. just got. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? No, I don't no. think so. That's no, the, no. Yeah, yeah, that's the exit house. Um, my bad. 
I'd be, you know, we talked a, a little bit before stream about mm -hmm. how exhausted we are. We actually didn't even like talk that much before stream. No, we just, we literally just put up the yeah, recording and then said like, okay, let's talk. But I think that's how you're supposed to do it. Like, I, yeah. I get the sense that people that do this often, this is how they do it, where it's just like, okay, we've met up, uh, we'll catch up later, or we'll yeah. catch up during the fucking recording. It'll it'll make for good content or whatever, you Well, know? I would also say, like, you know, we can just, like, chat. We have so much time, you know? No, absolutely. And um, I think none of our chats are, are so are so raunchy or disgusting that... Uh, uh, what, our day-to-day -day chats? No, yeah, I don't think never. so. I don't think we talk... We don't really talk about many, like, personal things. Or if we do, it's, like, for two seconds, and then we're like, all right, let's fucking... Well, like, I, I you know, I try not to be, like, a... I don't want to say a downer in that regard, but, like, mm. if someone wants to... I, I used to not have this mentality, but if someone wants to tell me their business, they can go out of their way and tell me their business. I'm not going to fish it out of someone unless, like, I think something's really wrong, because if they, if they wanted me to know, they would tell me. And that's, that's just, true. That's just simply what it is. And I think I have enough, like, never shut up energy that I will tell you if something is, like, wrong. Exactly. Um, and namely, like, if, if some, you know, if I was ever upset at you about anything, you know, I'm, you're, you're, you'll definitely know. I'm not, I'm not the type to play the, the silent treatment game, you know, I'm, I'm not, I'm not playing the fucking guessing game. No, exactly. Like, you would, you would, I think you would be kind enough to go out of your way to be like, yo. Yo, X, you y, said Z. Mario 7 was ass, and I'm pissed. Uh, you. I would say, factually, New Super Mario Bros. 7 is... Dis or New Super Mario Bros. 2, Mar be, a.k.a. Mario 7, is probably ass. I think it's the Wii one. I, th I think the Wii one and the and the first DS one are pretty good. Those are the good ones, and then they got a little ridiculous with it. But now there's kind of a revisionist thing going on where I'm hearing with people... With Wonder, yes. I'm hearing people... No, 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 not with Wonder. I think Wonder's going to be good no matter what. Oh, okay. I love Mario World, and Wonder is reminding me a lot of Mario World, and... Like, I... I forget if I said it to you, but Mario World is my favorite Mario game, period. Uh, I I feel like I definitely remember you saying that. Yeah. Um, Forget if I said it on here, you know. It but, might have uh, been during the, the botched recording of this, to be frank. Right, right, right. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, that's that's my favorite game, and, and Wonder is giving me those vibes in a way that, like, the new Super Mario Brothers games did not give me those vibes. Mm. So, um, yeah, I think I think we're in for for a good one. Gamers. I think I think Wonder's going to be good. Again, I'm not going to buy it because I'm I just don't. Again, I don't. There's care like for a lot Wonder of stuff series. coming out of this. I mean, there's you got, like, so Baldur's much Gate shit stuff coming too. out. Like, we don't. I really feel like I. This is the first year I don't have the money to be buying every game that I want this it's, year. It's not even that I don't have the money. I just simply don't have the time at this point. Like, mm -hmm. and I, you know me. Like, I play a ton of shit, but yeah. like. I'm replaying Cyberpunk right now for the DLC because they suggest replaying it for the DLC. Um, like, that was the, something I really don't like that they did, but, like, mm. when the DLC came out, they were like, hey, we really suggest, like, starting a fresh playthrough because, number one, all of you guys definitely have the time to do that, and number two, um, it'll make the experience, like, way more immersive right? Um, for the DLC. And you can see, like, the changes they made because then they do kind exactly. of a big, a big patch that, like, fixed a lot of issues with the game. Yes, they did. So they released version 2.0, and I started playing that. Um, and it's, it's, I mean, it's really like got its hooks in me right now and full transparency. I wasn't the biggest fan of the first cyberpunk or I'm sorry. I shouldn't even say the first cyberpunk, the, I guess 1.0 the 1.0 right? version. Yeah. My first playthrough of it. I really felt, I felt like I was in the wrong because like, I've got buddies who are cyberpunk, like mania heads, cyberpunk heads. And I'm yeah. like, I'm like, I think this game's kind of ass. Like, I don't know what you guys are on about. It's not to say it's ass per se, but like it just the gameplay style at the time didn't work for me, and now yeah. it's now it's really working for me. I'm only like three hours in. Okay. Um, but did you play Cyberpunk? I didn't. I, I was gonna say Cyberpunk and games like that are not really the types of games that I gravitate towards. Like yeah. I was never really even like a big like Skyrim fan. Get never that, a big get like, out Fallout of fan. Like I acknowledge those games for what they are. I feel like they are a huge time sink and. My biggest thing with games, like in general, is that I like a sense of direction. I like that. I, l I just like games where, like, I know what I'm doing, you know? Like, yeah. I know where I'm supposed to be going, that have a goal set out for me. I actually couldn't even get into Minecraft, like, as much as I feel like I should have, because the game kind of lets you do what you want to do. Like, I've played so much Minecraft, I've really only gotten to the end, like, a handful of times, you know? Like, Mm. For the amount of like, and and that's a, again, that's, a, that's not a game like I'm I'm as huge on as I, I don't know, as I'd like to be, if that makes sense. Yeah. Hot, 
hot take don't like minecraft either really yeah what so what don't you like about it um well i don't i don't like building in games period I'm, I'm just i'm not a builder i don't like base building mechanics i don't like resource collecting it's yeah. a very boring overdone mechanic for me um i think it was like new and fresh at that time though 100 the, the one thing i would say 100 percent. but now for for me personally like i just find it redundant and like actively mind-numbing yeah um in a, in a negative way i think um, that very few games have been able to do like resource collection and management in like a good way like like take like one thousand percent take like no man's sky for example you kind of just get resources so that you can like get more of that resource and it's like wash rinse repeat basically yep. like yeah like like get like i don't know if that makes sense like getting the resource is the point is the goal but also getting the resources lets you get more resources it's just, it's just additive and and in a way the resources have no value because of that that is correct so that is my beef with it. And then more than that, like, how do I say this? Um, I'm trying to think. In the example of his No Man's Sky, out, huh? like in the example of No Man's <laughs> Sky, it's, it's yeah, his booty cheeks are like out. Yeah. Just Yo, looking. SpongeBob farting? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. That's what, that's, what, that's what we've gotten. Cut, the, cut this shit. Word. In the context <laughs> of No Man's Sky, you know, it's really just like not... It's not an entertaining resource collection either. Like at least with um, Cult of the Lamb, which I know you were a big fan of. I fucking of. love Cult of the Lamb. Um, and I, you know, I felt ways about it. Mm -hmm. um, we'll it at talk least, about that later. I won't let you get away with that. It, well, it, <laughs> it at least made the resource collection entertaining, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Because you you had to like strategically plan your run. Fuck, dude. There we I go. I think you got it. I think you got it. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Yeah, there it is. You heard it? Yeah, yeah that fucking... Okay. He is far. Uh, my, huh? my fucking no. controller. My controller. No. <laughs> oh, God, dude. It's fucking over, dude. He stopped it. He stopped it. Okay. All right. Oh, hold fuck. on. We might have to change the controller out. We might point. have to. Yeah, I don't know why it's not... It was perfectly fine when we played Sagas the other day. I have no clue. There we go. Uh, it it's now? blinking. It's blinking. Open up settings. Oh. I hope it's not dead. Like that would be the problem. It doesn't look like it. No, it doesn't look like it. All right, it's good. It's good. It's good. Okay. I'm gonna, <sighs> I'm gonna hit no, and then you're gonna jump immediately. All right, hit no, hit no. Jump, oh fuck! Did fucking, we have to redo the fucking? Bungees? I think we do. We had this problem last time. Remember? I'm gonna but talk it, to Krabs. It made the sound. I think Mr. Krabs will be lenient on us. Nope. Motherfucker. It's fine. We opened up all the doors, so this will be easy. Um, I just have to run in and out and in and out. Um, so Cult of the Lamb, like at least made resource collection and base building to the same extent entertaining, yeah. but, um, yeah, I don't like Minecraft cause that's my least favorite mechanic in games. Okay. Um, I don't mind the looseness of it that, that really, that, I mean, that's, it's something that I can give or take at, at this point in my life, but, Do you think um, SpongeBob has looseness in this, in this particular in case? This tight, oh, in this particular case, yeah, if you yeah. look at that booty hole, not quite, yeah, not yeah. quite. Wait, you say he's farted? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> Let's, come on Does now. Does any of this make it? Does any of this make it to the fucking it'll make final it. cut? Um, it'll make it. Okay. We'll do some weird th thumbnail that people will find in ten years and be like, "John yeah, has yeah. a fart fetish?" Yeah, question yeah. mark. True. I got all of them right. I definitely got all of them. You got all of them there, but you have to get. All I know. Of them I gotta again, go back. Um. That's so yeah, like Starfield, I've been trying to play and. uh Mm -hmm. And oh, it's it's enjoyable, don't get me wrong, but mm -hmm. my beef with it is like it's so massive right now, and the looseness of it is just not something I'm looking for. Like okay. at least Cyberpunk is it's 20 hours for the main story. Like it's it's not a long game if you just do the main story. Yeah. Um, are you gonna really feel connected to the characters? No, and I didn't my first playthrough. Mm -hmm. But we'll but see you, if it, you do feel connected if you play the side content. Um, apparently my friend is uh, again the big Cyberpunk head. In my friend group, who's one of my who who's one of my best buddies, I'd say, okay. he loves that game. But he has like 120 hours in that shit, mm -hmm. which like more power to him, you know. Mm -hmm. Um, I couldn't do it, but he likes it a lot, and uh, and so with that, um, it's a it's a short game. But mm -hmm. Starfield, 
back to that. You know, the resource collection, the length of it, it's too big for me right now. Like, I wasn't a big fan of uh, Tears of the Kingdom, which came out earlier this year. Just because it was... It's too massive. It's too massive. Well, that's the thing, bro. And everyone's going to fucking hate us. I think we should be a little bit more specific. I think we like those games, but we just don't have time to play them right now. They're just too... I feel like I'm too old now yep. to, like, thoroughly sit down and, like, enjoy it. I just don't have the time to when I really want to. Yeah. And and it's making me old and resentful. No, for real. Like, I don't want to have... <laughs> but, like, that's just what it is. I don't want to have to go through a game with a fine tooth comb just mm. because that's the way that it was designed. You know, that's not fun for me. Right. Um, did you get all the wheels? Um, I've got to get three more wheels. I did this last time where I forgot where they were. They're in the, they're in the, the main kind of... Uh, they're definitely in the main area. Yeah, the main time. area. Um, I think I got all the sandy ones for sure because there's like five there, and I and before the sandy area, I only had two. So like, there's, okay, one, there's one up there. on top of the boat. Yep, and then maybe you can yeah, do a little platform situation. And I kinda definitely get it. can. I just have to sort of go around. I'm thinking I'm gonna change to sandy though. Yeah, I feel like sandy can get everything that SpongeBob can get. You know. Ah, uh, for sure. I feel like she's just got the mobility on that shit. Um, the only thing she can't do is be a ball, and that's and that's just a damn shame. Is it a damn shame? Do yeah. I really need to see Sandy curled up as a ball? Yeah. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. No. Um, you know what's fucked up too is you could touch the you could touch the ball power up. It does nothing. I don't think that's fucked up. I think that's just part of the game. It's just fucked up. Well, download a mod, fix it. I, I don't know. I think Sandy Ball mod. Sandy Ball mod. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Let this. Sandy become ball. There we go. Here's the little other one. You saw the other one somewhere. Um, Fucking. Sock How do you get to there. that sock? I got it. Watch. Oh, oh, you gotta, mm -hmm. you gotta rope on the Texases. Not even. No. No. No shot. I'm crazy. You are crazy. Thanks. All right, so go. It's to the right. It's to the right. Yeah, yeah I think I saw it in the distance. You can swing on that little thingy. Yeah, yeah. And then it's down the street that way. Straight. Yeah, straight. I don't know if you can. Where? I think you'll be good. I swear to you, I saw it somewhere. Oh, God. I have a horrible sense of direction, by the way, so just uh, be patient with me. It's over that way somewhere. I swear straight? to you. Yeah, straight. Okay. Oh, my God. Where was it? Oh. I think you're bugging. I think I might be bugging. I think I know where you're talking about, though. Let me try I hope this. you do. I, ho I hope that I can, I can look uh, rational. I hope I can look like a normal human being here. Yep, see, told you that's the sock, sock was right there. Yeah, no, you mentioned the wheel, actually. <laughs> um, but that's good. I, I really the think one? the wheel is the other way. You like, just... <laughs> no, no, I'm not going to say All right, that. all right. This is like the non-helpful backseating. No, it's fine, it's fine. It's not. What the fuck, dude? Brother, it's not. All right, well, that's not. She, does, she jumps like three inches high mm -hmm. on that shit. It's All still right. higher than Spongebob. You know what's fucked up? It's still higher than Spongebob. Yeah, it is. It's still more than he could ever manage. Mm. I saw it at the corner of my damn eye. I should have just, like, pointed you it out You should have just yelled at me, it. yeah. Uh, it's here, though. It's here, though. I swear to you. It's here? Like, in like in this hub, I mean. In this hub, okay. John Hubberton. Mm-hmm. Exactly. On, and I know a thing or two about hubs is all I'm yeah, saying. You, okay. I have the controller, by the way. Yeah, John Hub has taken over, so now I get a little bit of a of a gamer break. You yeah. Know? When you do a double jump and then the lasso thing, do you have to do like a triple jump situation? Um, in a sense, I don't think the lasso gives you any height. I think it gives you like no, I mean like the actual input I'm talking about. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't so remember it's... that. I thought you could just hold the double jump and no. then. No, it's got to be double, double, press one again. Interesting. Okay, now I swear to you. I saw this damn wheel somewhere around here. Okay. Maybe I just saw this. Maybe I just... That's a that's a sponge... That's a sponge ball. That's a sponge ball, isn't it? I think so. It'd be funny as shit if that was the wheel. No, it's a... Wait. That's the wheel. I knew it. I mean, did you know it? <laughs> no. That is what I saw, though, that uh, I thought was remember, the Remember, just teleport back to Puff and she'll You're train right. you to the Puff ball. port, they call it. Here's what the speedrun is called, the Puff port. Mm. You can go back to Mrs. Puff. Is it Miss Puff or Mrs. Puff? It's Mrs. Puff. Okay, but her husband uh, died, right? I think so. Yeah. 
She's like a she's weird like, criminal. Like, have you seen that lore? Did we talk about this? <laughs> there's, there's the, the, is it just the one episode where she goes to jail? No, dude. There's like uh, other, like you can, if you spot it out in the fucking episode, you can see like newspaper clippings of like her with like a black ski mask. Really? You know, there's an episode where she has one and she's breaking into like the boats at boating school uh -huh. and you know, she like blows a balloon animal or some shit and she's like, I never thought she I would have what? to do this again. She does what? No, no, not my that. Fault, my fault, my fault. Come on now. Get the my fault. I know. So if you <laughs> if you talk to Patrick and you get the fucking sock. Yeah. Um now we have twenty, so we can skip Gulagoon if you want for now. But we're hundred percent in the game. I know, but last time you were very upset with Gulagoon. No, no, no. I was and I was gonna make a uh a, a uh a reference to that. You know, we, we recorded last time and got to Gulagoon. I was like, fuck Gulagoon. It's like one of my least favorite levels. What's your least favorite level in this whole game, though? In this game? Mm -hmm. I think this game has really good levels. I think so, too, but I think there's like one or two standouts. Like, even Gulagoon has like good parts. Like, you have the carnival part with Patrick and stuff. I'm pulling it up now. Is it Kelp Forest? Tell me why it's Kelp Forest. I'm not going to tell you it's Kelp Forest. Actually, it might be Kelp Forest. Kelp Forest is kind of shit. Here's the thing is that level gets so much better in the remake. It's, the, it's one of the only levels that's better in the remake really why because it's well lit oh it's not well lit in the in the original like it's like i can't see a, a goddamn thing goddamn thing a goddamn thing even <laughs> oh i just lost my cell service um is this is this umbrella is this umbrella floating guy a smash or a pass he's a he's a pass he's he a just pass. seems like a general like party pooper like this not someone right i would really want to fuck to be honest Easy to kill too. Doesn't have a lot. Like, kind of would would bitch out if he started fucking. He definitely would bitch out. Like, he yeah. would be afraid of me after like five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and what reason would they have to be afraid of you? You know, just you know, dominance. Okay. Yeah, they get scared by that shit. I can just tell. I see. So I don't know what the fuck I did wrong on this part before. Did like, you fix it this time? Um, no, I'm not. I didn't get to the part where I was able to fix it. I'm saying, like, there was this part here, and then I kept hitting the buttons, and then it, it was to no avail. Yeah, well, I think... Hold on. There we go. Okay, so far, so good, right? So, I think, I think so far, so good. All the way down here, though, is the thing. I gotta get over Yeah, there. eventually. Yeah. Um, I'm still trying to find the levels. Excuse me. Don't you know what? Push, 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 push. <laughs> Thoughts? Um, Great spot. Oh, okay. So here are the levels. Oh, okay. dude, it's not even a question. What's that? I think my least favorite level has to be SpongeBob's Dream. Really? I think that level's crap for most of it. That's what the mask and, is. And the Flying Dutchman's Graveyard. I don't think I don't think I like that level very much. This is the part where it starts fucking up. It goes. Meh. If I look at Industrial Park, that's Robot Sandy, so that doesn't count. Yeah, so this has to be. It has to be either SpongeBob. SpongeBob's Dream or the Flying Dutchman's Graveyard? Sp SpongeBob. Sp SpongeBob. <laughs> SpongeBob. 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 Patrick. Patrick. Squid. This is totally unrelated. Do you have a Keurig? Uh, no. We have like a shit coffee maker. It's a pot coffee, right? Or is I think it so. pour I guess over it's not French that press? Shit. I don't wanna. Yeah, I don't wanna talk shit. I think we do. Yes. So if you, yeah, if all right, you I might I make make some some coffee before make some I leave. Make coffee before you depart. SpongeBob, Sponge. That's the real reason I started taking voice lessons. Patrick, really? Patrick, Just so you could sing that better? Squid. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> plankton, um, pl hear this part. Plankton, plankton. Okay, that's pretty good, right? That was actually really good. <laughs> Thanks. Man. Um. Okay, so <laughs> I need to ask you about a few games, and I'm trying to think of the games that I need to ask you about that we need to play on channel. Sure. Um, Batman Rise of Sinsu. That's already like a like a like a we're playing it like okay. it's a it's a, it's a co-op game. It's from the GameCube era. Like it's it fulfills all the conditions so far of games that we've played now, on this channel. It's been I know it's been like probably like a few weeks since you've had this conversation. Yep. But I saw you having a conversation with uh, some people in our friend group, mm -hmm. and um, in that conversation you mentioned something about a little guy named Sonic Adventure Two. I mean, yeah, that's, I mean, I'm down. All right, fantastic. I'm in. Um, What else is there? There's, oh, uh, we should probably, I mean, I wouldn't mind working our way through Shredder's Revenge. 
which okay. is the new TMNT um, beat em up. That's the player one, right? It is. It is up to six players. That's I think crazy to me. Playing with six players kind of diminutizes the experience because mm. there's so much happening on screen. Right. Um, but I think it's cool if you have like a lot of friends and like you guys are all not sober and things are dope. Okay. Um, I would say so three we'll get is fucked the up. yeah, and then invite. You know, that's when we start John Hub and friends. That's the launch. okay. Okay. But why is it not Addison, jo Addison and John and friends? That see, you know that that was just a mouthful. <laughs> that was like too so many. John Hub and friends. Isn't that what we've 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 coined it before? No, I don't think it is. I think I think we said Addison and John and for oh fuck my life these kids man these kids. Maybe that's when we'll have to adopt like a proper channel name like uh like the Rugrats or something. Yeah, like yeah. That, you know. <laughs> the Rugrats. <laughs> I don't know what a good like channel name would be. You're. You were off don't the mark say it, a don't say bit. it. I'm not gonna I'm not saying shit. This channel this challenge fucking sucks. Oh my god. I hate these kids, man. Yeah. <sighs> Asshole. So in any event, mm. um Has your day been good? My day's been pretty good, yeah. Pretty good. Uneventful, you know? Uneventful's and good. That's, and that's all and that's all we can really ask for. This one little fucking rug rat, bro. Today is um can I talk about the date? Uh sure. So this the the actual let's play isn't coming out until November first. So yes. I just wanted to let you know that. But motherfucker but I, I was gonna say today is Indigenous Peoples Day. Remember you can't do that? Yeah. Today is Indigenous Peoples Day. Mm -hmm. Um so at my work we we went and uh I was just sort of stuck there. Okay. Didn't get any actual work done. I mean, some actual work, but but mm -hmm. hardly any. I have to do a lot of work when I get Well, not a lot. Yes. I have to do a more work than I would like to do when I get home this evening. Okay. So, Wait, is this is this let's play conversation or is this? Yeah, this is this is like I mean, this is both. Yeah, I think yeah, it could yeah. just be general combo shit. You know. Okay, understand. I think if we drone on about hating resource management in games, and yeah, we're, yeah, yeah. We're, we're, you know, people and then are we talk turn about off. a little bit of life. We we let the people in a little bit. I, I you know I peel back the veil, if you will. Okay, let them let them know that behind this this rough, tough game critic. Hater exterior. We're just regular guys. We're just regular guys who who do silly things, you know. Mm -mm -mm. And uh, not many people can get that. Do you think you're going to be silly into your thirties? Do you think you're going to be for silly sure. for life? I, I think I think at this point silly in my for life, life, like I at this point in my life, the only goal I have is to be make silly. more money, maybe shift careers, and um, and be more silly and be, be be as silly as I've been. Okay, okay. Like I want. I don't, I don't want. You don't tons want silly deterioration, but you don't want to be sillier, is what you're saying. Uh, yeah, I think if I'm any sillier, people will, will people will begin to question, like <laughs> your like, sanity. Not my sanity, no. but like if I if I really deserve to be where I'm at in life. <laughs> and uh, I'm not trying to have that that interaction. I all think the time. you could be. You forgot one. No, I know. I'm not trying to talk to her. She just she talked to me, bro. I don't give a fuck about her. Now Whoa. I do. Hello, Miss Puff. She's negligent. Can we be honest for a second? She's negligent. She, she is. She, she's she a negligent teacher. She lost. She lost. The, why is she bringing? Why? Why is she with children? First of all, she's mm -hmm. a boating school teacher. She draw. She teaches teenagers, and older. Maybe she was just babysitting them for a side hustle because teachers are unfairly paid. Okay, fair enough. Okay, hot. I mean, that's not a hot take. No, not. A hot, I, I said fair enough. I think that's a freezing. I mean, I'm saying this for our audience. Yeah, you yeah, know, this is a freezing, cold freezing cold take. No, for sure. I mean, I'm, I've always been of the mind, why are we paying uh, sports players $20 million a year? Uh, Honestly, facts. Whereas we're paying teachers $0. I mean, because, because sports people do something that no one ever could, mm -hmm. you know, which teachers definitely don't do. That's true. Te pff, teachers doing, doing shit that people never could? What? Everyone can be a teacher? What? It's true. It's true. You know, it true is not shit. true. Oh, let me go on the record. Say, I agree with what Addison's saying, and we mean this wholeheartedly. No, no, I'm joking. <laughs> All right. Back to, back, to, back to reality. Oh, God. Back oh. to... Oh, there goes gravity. Oh, there goes rabbit. You ever see 8 Mile? Uh, I haven't watched 8 Mile. Despite being an Eminem fan, I've, I've avoided watching 8 Mile at this okay. point in my life. No, because I'm, no, no. I, you know, I haven't... I mean, I haven't heard... Sponge Jump. Too much about... <laughs> It is definitely not called a sponge jump. <laughs> sponge jump. Um, I haven't heard too much about sponge it. Sponge job. From the... <laughs> oh, shut the fuck up. Thanks. 
No, it's cool. It's cool. <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. Sponge okay. job, dude. Sponge job. Sponge job. job. Sponge slob. Uh huh. Uh -huh. What's a <laughs> sponge bounce? You just ask me a question and I got to an answer. Sponge you ride. You yeah, I do that sometimes. <laughs> we're all, I'll be talking about something and just completely derail the conversation on uh, on nothing. What happens? You know, that's life. What the fuck? Yikes! I get dude. one and done. I'd be embarrassed if I were you. Sometimes in life, you just get one and done, and that's it. You get the one Check and done -er. Checkpoint? No. no, you got the checkpoint. It's just, you know, it's probably a glitch or some shit. Embarrassing. Sponge job. Sponge. Super monster sponge job. Oh, oh, you just reminded me. I downloaded uh, Monster Hunter Now today. Okay. Dude, I, I love that game. I know. That's why I brought it up just now. I'm plugging it. I'm plugging it, everyone. Play Monster Hunter Now. It's like Pokemon Go, but good, bro. It really is. Yeah, it's like Pokemon Go, but you don't have to deal with like some twelve-year-old's like insane Charizard at the local park when you yeah, just want to yeah. enjoy the game. There's no, there's not much of a competitive aspect. It's mostly collaborative. Uh, it's fully collaborative, really. You just fight the monsters. But here's the thing. Here's what I hated about monster, or not monster. Here's what I hate about Pokemon Go. You play Pokemon Go. There's nothing to do in 2016. Whenever it came out, it came out in 2016. 2015. Mm. 2014? Let me think. Um, I was... It was freshman year for me, so it must have been 2016. Because 2016. I was I was running at the time. Okay. Um, I, yeah, so you're playing 2016. There's barely anything to do. The combat sucks. The There's no trading with other players. Yep. Like there, there's there's just only major, like five Gen 1 Pokemon. Yeah, there's like major features missing is what I'm trying to say. Um, my biggest issue with Pokemon Go in general is oh that... God. You build up this collection of Pokemon. There's so many goddamn Pokemon that, like, you, you can't care about all of them. In fact, you care about almost none of them. Yep. You, you know, you you, you try your darndest to collect all of them. You ignore some of them. You don't ignore other ones. You need Pokestops. You need to live near Pokestops. That's to, correct. If you to, live in a rural area, the game is not for you. Yeah, if you, if, you, if you live, you know, miles and miles away from a damn Pokestop, you're just fucked. Yep. Monster Hunter, now, you pick up those things also. Sometimes you do need the... Can I just pick up the spatula down there, you think? Oh, dude, you should try it. Do you think it's possible? I think it's possible. You think I'm going to get, like, pull, pulled away from the fucking hand? There's a likelihood. Oh! Wait, did that not work? It didn't work because oh, it was under it's the water. Like, yeah, it's like under, yeah, it's like submerged. That's good game. That's good game design. I thought, yeah, I thought it was, like, above water or whatever. I'm sure there's a glitched way to get it, though. I'm sure To be is. honest with you. Um, yeah, you, you need Pokestops. Monster Hunter now, you get those materials just from walking around. They show up on the map and everything. Obviously, the, the use for the stops, which are the same as the Pokestops, um, like, in terms of where they are on the map and stuff. Mm -hmm. the, the biggest use for them is they give you a bunch of the resources that you need. Wait, like, you're going to go and do the thing, right? You can't grab it. You I need already... to be Patrick. Oh, do you? Yeah. I'll do it later. Okay. Um, yeah, you, you, uh, yeah, so, so yeah, the, the Pokestops, you, you need them shits. You, you need them in Pokemon Go, you don't need them in Monster Hunter now, but they do help, obviously. They give you a bunch of the resources that you need for basically any upgrades and everything like yeah, that. The process yeah, Yeah. So it definitely helps us still have them. Definitely helps us still travel to places where there are a lot of stops. The other thing that I really enjoy about uh, Monster Hunter now is that your progression directly impacts, like, your character and everything. So, like, Pokemon Go, you're finding a bunch of these Pokemon, you're finding your 300th Weedle and then funneling it into your, you know, into your Beedrill or whatever. You don't even care about those Pokemon. Yeah. Um, oh, fuck. But, like, for Monster Hunter so, now, for, for you're, you're, Hunter fin now, yeah, you're finding, I'll, like, a Super Pukumiku or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your Pukumiku armor, it, it funnels directly into your character. It feels like you're improving. It feels like your character is getting stronger. I will say that's pretty cool. So it, it it feels like the progression that you're doing is going directly towards you as a as a player, um, and also the combat is good. Like that's that's the kind of the biggest thing. What was your game plan there? <laughs> hey man, <laughs> it was um, try my hardest. Fair. Um, I was gonna. I didn't know you were a big monster hunter head. I am, man. We should play Rise on the on the. We should play Rise because I actually have that on both Steam and Xbox. There you go. I wish I have to again. I have to, I think maybe we talked about this. Maybe I talked about it with someone else. Mm -hmm. um, I I want to play it on Steam because I enjoy the game. Mm -hmm. But I already played through it all on Xbox, and there's no cross progression. And like, really? it's, apparently they wanted to like try and figure out a way to integrate it, but I don't think they could without like making. 
everyone sign up for like a Capcom account, uh, like account, yeah. Which I don't think they really want to do from like as a as a business. Like That's I think kind of annoying. It is annoying. Like it's annoying to have fifteen different accounts and you have an account, you know, with fucking EA and with you know Xbox and with PlayStation and with. You know, oh, Nether there. Realm Studios and all that shit, just yeah, yeah, yeah. To, just to carry your data over. Like that's not that's not fun for anyone. That's not feasible. No, it's not. It's annoying. I think you have to go a different way. Yeah, you're probably um, right. There's probably another one that's a similar situation. I'm sure there is. I'd be very surprised if you had to. Let me try one more time. Maybe. Um, but yeah, so I got it on the on the fucking okay, up, humble bundle it was on, and uh, so I've been meaning okay. to play it because I really enjoy Monster Hunter Rise, and it's not a long game. Yeah. Like, Fundamentally, it's probably one third to half the size of world, and that's a good thing. Yeah, no, exactly. Um, because it, you Awkward. you have the the wolf, and you have the fucking string, and you don't have to like yeah, slowly man. meander around this entire like map that, that was... you do in world. Like world, world's a, a great step forward, but mm. it, it really had some serious flaws. That yeah, that that's my me. world critique is that it's it's uh, really hard to like navigate like certain weapon types it just feels like you're punished for using them yeah like i use uh dual blades and some of the best things you can do with the dual blades is like sliding combos so you have to have like a hill that you're sliding down and only that this platforming sucks yeah that's not i could do best. it though but just don't miss this last one please it's Thank definitely you. a little crash bandicoot-esque right like it's yeah Small. In like an annoying, yeah, in like an annoying small way where like you have to look at your shadow, but for some reason like I can't see SpongeBob's shadow that well in this fucking situation. Because it's you know probably a pain in the ass to see normally. Yeah, and it's a dark cave, you know. And it's a dark thing. cave. Um, what yeah, no world, world. I mean, what did I use in world? I think I used like the heavy bow gun or some shit like that. But that's so a gun like that is kind of conducive to like I feel like the game. Like I, I feel like some weapons just don't work because you. Fight the flying monster on the map where there's 20 different exactly. floors, exactly. and then you hit it twice, and then it runs away. With Rise, they thought of that, and they like got rid of that shit. And I yeah. and I love them for it. They They're, made it where you can just fucking catapult yourself across the map. Your attack on and, Titan, yeah, literally, and it's a good thing. Yeah, it's a really good thing. Ooh. I know, I know, Rise was critiqued for having like a lack of like launch content. I think with its monsters, like I feel like it's. Okay. A little shallow in that regard, and I would agree with it. You know, like I don't think it had nearly as much launch content as World, but like also. I didn't play Sunbreak yet. You play Sunbreak? I have not yet. Um, but also, good things. Rise did come out for um, the Switch initially. It was a Switch exclusive, yep. so yep, yep. it's gonna come with less content to fit on a smaller console, mm -hmm. um, which is I fine. Like... You think the next Monster Hunter game is gonna be World Two? No, I think they'll. I think their rise was World Two, and that's what they they changed the formula off of. I think the next Monster Hunter game is probably going to come within the next. What Rise came out last year? Two They've years announced ago? it already. I think. I don't know if they no, released it. No, yeah, no way. Yeah, Monster Hunter games come out like every like three or four years. There's no way they announced it though. They, they probably it. talked that they, they no. They talked. They that, said they said it's on the way. They, like, they didn't say the name. Yes. Yeah, that's an announcement. Eh. Where I'm from, that's an announcement. Where I'm from, that's that's <laughs> not. Because you don't live anywhere that I because know or that I care where'd they about announce even. that? They announced it on some like Twitter blog post that the average consumer is not going to read. The average consumer is going to you know look at their well, E3 I'm extraordinary, shit. buddy. Oh, yeah, I That's know what you, you are. Know about me. I'm extraordinary. You are really extraordinary. <laughs> I'm, I'm extraordinary. <laughs> um, yeah, you know, I think it'll it'll be like I don't think they'll call it Rise Two. I think they'll call it like Rise Ultimate X. They'll call it World Two. Um, and I do think it'll it'll be multi platform, mm -hmm. uh, day one for sure. Like, without uh, a doubt in my mind. What do you think of that? That was actually really good. Thank you, thank you. you have you ever thought about professional voice acting? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I just did it now. I was going to say, thank God you're at the pier because of how much of a clown you're being. God damn. Got him. It's like that? No, it's not like that. Okay. Come on. That's cool. It's all love. That's good. That's always nice. It's nice to be loved, you know? Yeah, you love. You are loved. We live, we laugh, we um, lie. Where was I? Um, we were talking about some bullshit. I don't know. We were talking about some bullshit. <laughs> we were always talking about some bullshit. You were hating. No, I'm joking. I wasn't hating. Uh, I'm... where do I go from here? What do I do? You gotta throw the John. Oh. Forward. The jo forward? Forward. Other forward. Here? Nope. Uh, here? Nope. Uh, this way? I don't know where you go, actually. Did you go the wrong way? There's one way to go, and it's this way. Can you go down? 
Now, why in the in the hoot and holler and heck would I want to go down there? All right, let's relax, Hank Hill. Get rid of the robot in the ticket booth, and I'll give you a reward. So maybe you have to throw some shit at him. Crusty Cray, yeah, 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 yeah. Get rid of the robot in the ticket booth. How do you do yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, there we go. Pizza. You're awesome, dude. Is the pizza, yeah, you win. Does he give you a, a spatula now because of that? Um, he gives you a spatula for... He did say he'd give me a reward if I did that. Yeah, I wonder right? if he just, like, if he used his god powers to break the yeah, boardwalk yeah, what if, is yeah, what yeah. happened. That's a good-ass reward, though. Yeah. He, he brings hell down. Oh, um, yeah, now I remember. We should play fucking Hollow Knight. That's what we should do. I'd be down That's... to watch you play Hollow Knight. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I mean, I'd, I'd, well. I'd, I'd go um boss, boss, you know, every... Every boss interaction we swap because okay. I've played the, I've played through the game a substantial amount. It's okay. like one of my favorites. Um, I've played through that shit a lot. What the fuck is this? I for? have. Uh, you're supposed to be down there because you're supposed to like freeze it or some shit. Yeah, but I need the freeze fruit over there. Yeah, you don't. I think it, you have to go at a different point and the then freeze fruits over down there. I know. The freeze freeze fruit. I mean, <laughs> all right, let's relax. I know I'm a piece. cold guy. All right. You got that far, right? Uh. What in, in to the freeze freeze fruit? I did. What's that guy's name? It's um Al Kiji. No, Kizaru Kizaru is uh the, the fucking um he's the light dude. He's the light admiral. Oh, you're right. The yellow one, and then uh Al Kiji, I'm pretty sure, is the ice did one, and then Akainu is the volcano one. Okay, no one cares about this shit. Who doesn't care no about one piece? One piece is true, awesome, actually. bro. I mean, no one cares about it during a SpongeBob Let's Play, is what I'm Why? trying to say. Cause, Why can't uh, we just be authentic, you know? Why can't we just talk about... <laughs> we can just talk about anything. I mean, that's that's sort of my my thing, right? Yeah. I mean, unless you want to talk about, like, like you know, pop culture. Okay, yeah. Did you hear what Timothy Chalamet did? No, what did he do? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, did you hear about Travis Kelsey and, and Taylor Swift? Yeah, yeah, that's going to be old. That's already like kind of old news. That's going to be old, old news by that the time is gonna this be, comes They're going to be broken up by the time this comes out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want to put money down on when they break up? I don't even think they're dating. No, they're, they're, they're fucking, at least. No. You don't think so? I don't think so. Travis Kelsey or Taylor Swift respond and uh, confirm <laughs> or Please cop on the show to defend yourselves. <laughs> It's not defend. If they want to, you know, they're adults. They could do what they want. Or I'll deplatform both of you. Whoa! I don't think I don't. All right, I won't you know. do that. I won't do that. Come on. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> they are both multi-millionaire celebrities. We do not need that shit. All right, all right. Can y'all give us some money? Yeah, for real. <laughs> oh, you could swap. You could swap. You could swap. You could swap. I can, but I don't have the bubble bowl. I need that the isn't, bubble. Don't bowl. you get that now? No, you gotta beat. Patrick, robot Patrick. Oh, we should have done that first, bro. I didn't. I for, I foregore that you even needed it for something. You did foregore. I foregore. Is this something that I? Oh yeah, I go over here. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Stop. Yeah. Embarrassing. Doesn't matter. I doesn't, still got a nice jingle. Does it not? No, I'm pretty sure it matters, dog. Nope. Oh, you are right. Unless the draw distance is No, I think is the draw small. distance just got fucked up, and I, uh, and I fucked no, up. No, you're good. Sock. I am good. There's a sock over there. I owe you an apology, big man. Uh, I'm waiting. I'm sorry. Okay. That's what I would say if I was actually sorry. What about this part? What, did I fuck up here, though? Yes. Nope. You don't think so? I've never fucked up in my whole life. All right, let's, uh... Let's Are you switching to SpongeBob, SpongeBob? SpongeBob, Patrick, Patrick. Squidward, Squidward. Sandy, what are you trying to do Sandy. at that, like, little John? What? Like, the little the little planks. You keep, like, trying to stomp it. Like It looks happen. stompable, doesn't it? It, it? I think it it is not. I think it's just a design I thing. know it, it. it's not now, but it looked stompable. IMO. IMO. Also, good switch. Mm. I know. Kind of awesome. Yeah, I, I remember this part. Really? Me personally, I remember this shit. Oh, okay. You personally. SpongeBob, SpongeBob. Patrick. Dude, this is this game so good. Patrick. I'm this okay. game is so fucking unbelievable. Did you ever play the movie game? I have. I have, I have not. It's uh pretty good, man. It's pretty good. Do you get a, a sock from destroying these? Yeah. No, you already picked up the sock. No, that was a spatula, sir. That was not... Uh, was it a spatula? That was a spatula, sir. Oh, 
Okay, I thought it was a sock. Maybe, or I'm sorry. Yeah, I thought it was a sock. And that's on. And that's on. Tried, and that's on Sponge Pussy. Hello. Um, try to destroy them and see what happens. Get them. That didn't do shit. But I did get the spatula. That is a spatula. <laughs> I can't, bro. <laughs> I can't. In a quiet room, he throws out the uh, oh. the patented SpongeBob laugh. The I said, I said quiet. I said quiet room, and you mm -hmm. turned on the light. <laughs> well, it was. Yeah, I know what you meant. It was. It, it was. It was quiet. dark too. It was quiet by uh, light standards. That yeah, was yeah, embarrassing. Yeah. Come on, bro. I'm trying my fucking best. They don't die like this. Uh, I don't need them. Aren't you? Isn't that the wrong end? No. Nope. No. Nope, I'll show you the wrong end. Hello. Especially with that big ass tongue, SpongeBob. Yep. Yep. A SpongeBob could get it. <laughs> you think SpongeBob's on your? On your list? Is he on your hall pass list? No, he's on my, he's on my, you know. I'm going down his hall list, you know? Okay. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Interesting. Mmm, indeed. You know what I mean? What the fuck did that do? He got you some sparklies. Ah, there. motherfucker. There's a, there's a sock up here. Well, redo it. No. Weak. All right, I'm whatever, dude. I'm doing shit my way, fucker. What? <laughs> All right, sorry. <laughs> Wow, God unnecessary, damn. Unnecessary. That was that was definitely unnecessary. That was aggressive <laughs> as fuck. The fuck? My fault. <sighs> I think I fucked this up a little bit. Yeah, I don't know what you're trying to do at this point. Because I gotta get down there. I gotta get like over over down here. Do you see the the path? I gotta get over down here. Yeah, there it is. You gotta be Patrick. And I gotta be Patrick. 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 It's Plankton. Plankton. Alright. I gotta be Patrick, but here's what I gotta do first, okay? Okay, hit me up. There's an there's an angle by which I need to jump down to get to that ice thing down there. You see that? I don't I don't think you need to do that. I do. That's not how you're supposed to do it, but okay. So life's often about things you're not supposed to do. I would disagree. I think typically maybe life is. Life's all about making mistakes. But and doing in this game, it might do, be brother. more convenient for you to just do it the intended way. Ah, uh, nah. He's trying to be a speedrunner. Everyone pointing him left. No, no, I can do it. I can do it. <laughs> All right, let's see it. Let's see it. Okay. I don't know where you're supposed to do it. I think it was around here. Okay. Well, I'll tell you the truth. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Through through the map. And the hand grabbed me because I fucked up extra bad. You drowned, and the hand grabbed you. Awkward. That. <laughs> All right. You said it, not me. Hello. I just got to see how to get down here. How the fuck are you supposed to get down there? Pretty sure you're supposed to just take the. Well, you know what? I'll shut the fuck up. I've tried see? to. I've tried to backseat. Does nothing for me. Man, look where it got you, buddy. Yeah, in the in player two seat. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Exactly. For everyone wondering, despite my name being first, I'm typically player two. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I think we should change that. I think I think you should be player one in games. You you started while saying that. I'm not sure if you believe that. Yeah, I th I think that we should make. <laughs> He's a poser. He's a fucking poser. Oh, that was clean. <laughs> that wasn't the right fucking platform. No, it fucking was not. Uh, Did you soft lock it? I really hope you didn't soft. No, lock I didn't it. soft lock. You could you could just teleport places. That is true. You can tell just teleport places. You can. It unsoft lockable IMO. It, it would be awesome if it wasn't a mechanic though, and then you could just soft lock yourself places. That could be kind of cool. Just to like really. That would be cool at all, actually. What am I talking about? No, it would be cool to like hone in the like old game feeling, you know. Okay. Well, this is an old game. It is. It's like twenty years old. Yeah. Isn't that insane? That is pretty insane. Like, like think about how much tech. Like changed no! between the twenty years from, you know, whatever, like Pong, I guess, right? Like, oh my god! Like, Wait, I'll try about, one more time. Sorry, think, I'll try this one more time. Think about the time, but in between Pong and this game, and like how revolutionary that was, and then between this game and now, mm -hmm. and how like relatively speaking, not mm -hmm. that much has changed. Uh. I guess it was a bigger jump, but that's like technology too. That know? is part of the technology that's, that's, basis. It's, it's uh. That's how that's how it be. It is how it be. I mean, I'm not complaining. It's just it's interesting. I did it. All right, where the fuck are you supposed to go off of this? I think uh, whatever. Is there like an island somewhere? All right, I'll run in a direction, yeah, and then if 17 it's 17 seconds. Yeah, I'll run in a direction. If I get down to like 10 seconds and I don't see where I'm supposed to go, 
I think you're just supposed to see a spatula or some shit. There's another ice ice fruit there. There's another ice ice fruit. Ooh. Hey, it's the correct way you're supposed to get down. <laughs> wow. Well, that's how you do it. You know what? I think you're supposed to do something, and then the the spatula shows up down here. That would be funny as fuck. Actually, I think that's how I think that's how it's. Supposed so you to just go. you did it the wrong order. Yes, 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 precisely. Nice. <laughs> Why would you go this way? I'm just gonna die actually, because it's gonna yeah, be closer to where say. I need to go anyway. No, but I've just picked up the checkpoint over here, motherfucker. All right. It's fine. Just walk backwards. Nope. What do you mean, nope? <laughs> what do you like? What? No. <laughs> Just disagree, alright. I don't know. Yeah, I guess I just disagree. You gotta destroy these bumper cars or some shit. You like when Patrick jumps, he goes... You let me good. know, big man. Oh, thanks, big man. Big man, big man, big man. Yep, yep. Yep, 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 big man, big man, big man, big man, big man, Yep, 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 yep. Christ. I don't know. Slight issue. Um, I don't think the fucking spatula spawned. I don't think it did either. How do you make that spatula show? There's a way to make it show up, though, I know. Um, is it connected to the SpongeBob, like, like bowling ship? I don't think it's the bowling ship, but I think it might be the lights on the pier, mate. No, it's not the lights on the pier. Can you open up the, um, the menu and see? Connect the towers. Slip and slide under the pier. Oh. Slip and slide under the pier. What does that mean? Let's see. Slipping. Let us see you. Let us see. Okay. Okay. So I guess it's got to be under there somewhere, right? Maybe it doesn't need to spawn. Maybe you just got to find it. Yeah, maybe the actual spatula is not over here. Maybe it's not this shit right here. It might be, like, far. Like, it might be straight ahead. Yeah, maybe that platform? Yeah, maybe, the, yeah, maybe the spatula is over there. I just don't want to... Yeah, you don't want to get caught out. Caught with your wanna, dick out. I don't want to throw like to away say. my shot. I am not throwing away my shot. You know Hamilton? Yeah. Are you a big Hamilton I am guy? a Hamilton head. Yeah. I love Hamilton. Really? Yeah. Who would yeah. funk it? I, I, you know, I really like the lyrical music. He's a lyrical, spiritual mirror. I do too. I are you will, a Broadway fan? I am. Yeah. I saw okay. uh, Book of Mormon on Broadway. I love Book of Mormon as well. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen it too. I think I talked to you about some other Broadway shit I've seen. Mm -hmm. I think you got to walk back. I mean, unless you just want... No, teleport back to the fucking slip and slide. Dude, you know what that is, right? <laughs> He's fucking memeing. You know what that is? What? That's the fucking shit you didn't buy for Patrick. The fucking uh, bouncy shit outside the sandcastle. The bouncy shit outside the sandcastle. Yeah, remember when I said, hey, you have oh, to do Oh, you're that, right, you're right. And then you yelled that. at me yeah, and you yeah, were like, you, you were like, that's for Patrick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's for Pat. You don't get to see that. That's for Patrick. Leave yeah, me alone. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember doing that. <laughs> um... <laughs> So I'm a big Broadway guy, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I will say Lin-Manuel Miranda's music is is too identifiable. Mm -hmm. um, I agree. Like, stylistically, it's nice that it's consistent, but um, me and me and my partner walked in to go watch um, Encanto. Mm -hmm. And when we went to go see... In you broke it, dude. You shit the bed. <laughs> He's so mad. What the fuck do I do? Do I need the do I need the rocket thingy to hit that guy up there? No. No, it should shine and then he blows up. Oh, you're right. So what so You didn't do it right, I guess. So fuck me? Like what yeah, do I do? Yeah, fuck right. you. You didn't oh. do it right. Um What's your favorite line from Hamilton? Uh Oh, I like line in general? Yeah, yeah it's your favorite line. Um, you know, my son Pride is not the word I'm looking for. Okay. There is so much more inside me now. Okay. Oh, Philip, you outshine the morning sun. Okay. My son. I like the part where he goes like, Eliza. Oh yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> I like uh, that's a good part when his um wife and sister-in-law are trying to convince him to do like a threesome, and he's, yeah. he's just not having it for whatever reason. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
Wait, does that happen? Yeah, that does happen. That's like that's exactly that song. Like you know. Yeah. You know, go away with us to the mm. beach or whatever, and he's and like, he's like, I'm gonna cheat on you instead. He's like, No, I have to figure <laughs> out this federal debt. I'm gonna Eliza. And then he goes over there. He's like, oh, I'm gonna fuck this bitch instead. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> fuck <laughs> a random woman. I, exactly. That's how he's on the lyrics. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. Eliza. Um, <laughs> Eliza. So I, <laughs> you know, it's what he says when he's fucking. <laughs> exactly in that tone. Um, me and my partner go to see. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> you broke it. What did I do? Um, me and my partner. Wait, par- no, this is good, isn't it? No. <laughs> Come on. You got a shooting Just into the to mountain, bro. Um, me and well, my partner went to go fun. watch Encanto, and we walk into Encanto, and the you know the opening song like about like uh. Her family's playing, mm-hmm. and I look at her. I look at my partner, and I'm like, I'm like, is this Lin Manuel Miranda? Like, yeah, did he compose song, this those music? Songs are so Lin coded. Sh- they are. They <laughs> They're really so are. Incredibly Lin coded. Yeah. He makes such blatant, what the fuck is like blatantly him music. Try the other one. Yeah. yeah. Um, this has got to be the right one, right? It's it got to right be. at that guy over there. There it is. Boom, baby, there boom. There we go. Now I got to get the fuck over there. All right, all right. Here's what we do. Go back to yep, slip yep. and slide under the pier. There we go. Are we Patrick now? Do we get to be Patrick? No, it should keep you a SpongeBob. No, when you go over there, it gives you the character they want you to be, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, you're right. My bad. But in the remake is where they keep you as whatever character. So you could just be like Sandy inside of SpongeBob's house if you wanted to be. Which is like super inconvenient. It's weird. Like, I don't know why they let you do that. It's an interesting programming decision. I think it was just an oversight more than anything. Probably, but I can't believe they didn't patch it. Yeah. I mean, maybe they did at this point. I feel like you haven't played the game in a while. Yeah. Oh, yeah, maybe they have. Um, I played it at launch, and I played it, like, maybe a couple months later. But they didn't fix it a couple months later, so... IDK. Doubt it. Um. Now you gotta go back to Larry the Lobster. Mm-hmm. So he just fucking dies, and then what? And then, like, yeah, there it is. It okay. bounces you back to Larry, and Larry's like, Thanks for cleaning up the beach, SpongeBob. Good shit, brother. That what he says. It sounds exactly like me, dude. <laughs> it does sound exactly like you. <gasps> Why would you? Okay. That's kind of cool that you can do that, though. Yeah, that's a cool little trick. It's a cool little trick if you ever want to do exactly what I just did. Uh, everyone take notes. <laughs> good shit, SpongeBob. He said, "Good shit, SpongeBob. Thanks for cleaning up my beach." Mm-hmm. Do you think it's Larry's beach? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's factually, factually Larry's Beach. Actually, factually. Yeah. You remember the episode where, um, save the children. <laughs> you remember the episode where, uh, no. you know, he rips his pants and shit? Yeah, rips pants. Yeah, that's a good Called. episode. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I agree. We should watch SpongeBob just as, like, reaction content. Yeah, I'd be down. Would then, you ever do reaction content? No. I feel like Let's Playing is honestly like a just a little bit below reaction co- or a little bit above reaction content. Oh, uh, 100%. In I would argue that like that stuff. Let's Playing is just reaction content to something that you're playing. To something that you're playing. Mm-hmm. And because of that interactivity, it makes it a little bit better. Yeah, yeah. But it's uh it's not it's not much better. It is not it is not much better, I will say that much. Lies, but I like, lies. I mean, I like it. I just think reaction content. Like, I just don't have interesting enough reactions, which is why I'm not reacting to the gameplay, per se. That's true. We just kind of talk, you know? And which that's, is good. That's what I like. I, li- I like those types of Let's Plays, too, because it's like, I kind of don't... I like the game as the backdrop. I like every once in a while someone makes a snarky remark about the game that, like, I, you know, hadn't thought about myself and mm-hmm. stuff. But uh, where the fuck am I? <laughs> you fucked up. <laughs> That doesn't make any sense, by the way. I thought the box goes up. You want to just teleport back to, um... I can. Okay. You know why? Why? Because when you do the fast travel, it gives you the character that they want you to be. Yeah. And it's SpongeBob for 90% of the game. Well, so... Okay. Never mind. I was going to say you just... You go out of your way to teleport back, to be SpongeBob, to jump down, to buy the thing, to teleport to the thing from as SpongeBob, and then it'll just give you Patrick. Nah, I gotta be Pat Dick for this. Okay. You know what? You're smarter than I am. No. Nah, nah. I don't know what the goal is here. Jump. Jump. <laughs> <laughs> he just looked at me while he said that, by the way. Get oh me the fuck out God, of here, bro. Dude. Just teleport back. I can't teleport. Yes, you <laughs> You literally can. Where? Which which spatula do I teleport Go to? Go up, teleport back to fucking I'm not through doing the it. sea caves. 
There is a character switch thing in there, isn't there? There is. It'll switch you to SpongeBob. But I gotta get the sock anyway. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. My fault. It's it's fine. I'm it's only fine. really No, I'm not even mad. It. Yeah, I'm not even mad. I'm like moderately angry. Guys, he's pissed. This is the end of Addison. This and is Donald. the end of Addison and Sean. So is this is that going to be the, like the bit joke for like the entirety of this? this yeah, yeah, yeah. And then one day we actually will end it all, you know. I don't think so. How do we? Also, that sounded a lot more depressing than it meant to be. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think you fucked up, big man. Nah, that's fine. You didn't wait long enough. I didn't know how high it went. I think we could just cheese it, to be honest. I want to get to the fucking. I think SpongeBob can get that shit too, to be honest with you. How? He can bounce off a thingy and then go under it. Oh, true. Bounce off the thingy and go under it. I think he can do the bounce play. off the thingy and go under it strategy that we always talk about. You also don't have to, like, run, like, jump over those. I'm pretty sure you can run through them. I'm just afraid of them is all. Oh, okay. I hear that. Why'd I do that? Bro. Why'd I do that? Bro. What's wrong with me? Okay, no, that's cool. Check one's right there. We're chilling. We're chilling. He's so scared of him, guys. Look at that. <laughs> He jumps even after he already fell. But why? Him. Like this should be a hazard, though. No. No. Why but would? Why it be? are they there? Just to scare you. Like, why are there fence things there if they're not supposed to be a hazard? Because it just wants to scare you. Like, you know, that's it. Is that why they put little spiky thingies on castles? I guess it is, right? Yeah. Like it's just to be like <sighs> we're crazy. we're castle and we're threatening. I guess you're right. You a big um. <laughs> you a stupid hoe. You, you just reminded me. You a big uh, Lord of the Rings guy. I'm not. Really? I'm not, I'm not. Okay, so I can kind say I am I am not. Okay. But I really like the Middle Earth games. I think that's a hot take. No, uh, Shadow of Mordor? Uh, I like sh both of them. I had a friend that played Shadow of War. I only played Shadow of Mordor. I liked it a lot. Okay. I have a friend that played Shadow of War and said that it felt like cheaper. Oh. Uh, I played Shadow of War and I really liked it because mm -hmm. I liked the siege mechanics in it. Okay. And we, we could give it a try. Uh, no, it's a story-based it, game. It's not a, it's not a let's play type title. I don't, it's, it's not for us. Okay. Um. Come back with the cruise, god damn it. That's, oh, no, that's, that's downtown. downtown. Sorry, sorry. That's all of them. We got all of them. We and just need this sock if we really care that much, but we can come back and clean it up later. There's two more socks. One of them is here. I don't know where the other one is, though. Well, let's just grab the one and get out. Yeah. Um. I think we're chilling. Yeah, then we chill. We bang chilling. Mm-hmm. Um. We're doing good on spatulas too, man. We're doing we're, great, dude. We might be able to it. jump to like the end of the game early at this point. Let's do it. I said, dude, fuck the last batch of levels, genuinely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So are we not a hundred percent in the game? Uh, no, we we, I don't know. We'll find out. Yeah. It depends if we think of like a game to to stream because I don't think we talked much about playing this earlier before today. To stream or to play? To 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 stream to stream. To play. <laughs> to play. Why'd you bring up to stream? Did I say that? You said to stream a couple times. I'm sorry. That's yeah, my yeah. bad. It's just a it's a force of habit. Yeah, you're good. Because you'd be streaming. Because I'd be, I be liking streaming. Mm. It's enjoyable for yeah, me. Yeah. Oh, dude, you're so close. Nice, yeah, dude. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. My life is going fine because sock <laughs> is in it. Sock. I look into your eyes and... The Sky's the limit. Oh, yeah. Favorite musical. Uh, hmm. See, I like Book of Mormon a lot. Book of Mormon's good as fuck. I like uh, I like Hamilton. Those are like the two that I like a lot, to be honest. Hamilton's good. You didn't say Be More Chilled. Be More Chill? Be More Chill, yeah. I don't... I know it, but I'm not I'm not too... I, I, I haven't seen it, I don't think. A lot of theater kids that are around my age fucking hate that, that musical. Do you know uh, something... Is Be More Chill like Dear Evan Hansen? No, Dear Evan Hansen is like Dear Evan Hansen. Okay, okay. Yeah. No, Be More Chill is not like that. It's about like some prepubescent kid that's like, I want to be more cool, and I jizz in my pants and shit like that. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, like, straight up, listen to the first song, and he's like... You know, trying to like beat off to like yeah. porn before he goes to school. Mm -hmm. um, and I think a lot of people don't like it because it's a it's a cringe thirty year old takes on what what being a teenager is yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. when it's not like that yeah, at all. Yeah, yeah. When I was in middle school, I was just beating my meat all the time. Yeah. You know, they're like, let's go to a teenage <laughs> party, and it's like yeah. we're slamming back beers and shit, mm -hmm. and like, you know, no. 
I don't think any theater kids were really doing that. Theater at, kids that were definitely either, not you know? doing that. And yeah. more than, I could say seldomly high school kids were doing that at my school. Right, right, right. Like there would be parties, but it was, it was seldomly at yeah. someone's house. Yeah, yeah, you weren't going to them, but yeah. I went to a few. Yeah. I went to a few. Yeah. <laughs> you fucked up. Um, no, I seldom, I seldom went to them because uh, I was on the outskirts of the of the social groups. Okay. Of of all the social groups, really. But and then it, with this boss, out. you have to fucking run you, over. Yeah, and like knock it into the fucking grab thing. the grab the dome, throw the fucking dome into the thingy. It's this is this up. is a really good design boss fight, though. I think it is. It's just really long. We've talked about this game multiple times at this point. This game's fire. I agree. Um, we need to hit Pro Skater 2 up. I'm surprised That's you didn't true. suggest that, actually. Now that I'm... Um, I don't know if I want to do it too soon. I kind of want it to be like a long-standing gotcha. thing, like the Tony Hawk game. Like a little warm-up thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, by the time we finish the last Tony Hawk game, we're in our, we're in our fucking, uh, elder years, you know? I mean, we might... Dude, we might blow up faster than you anticipate. That algo is going to be on our side, you know? The algo... People are going to be like, man, I've been missing for like an early, early to mid... You know, 2000s Let's Play vibe, where mm -hmm. the vibe is between the years of like 2012 and 2016 Let's Plays. Right, and right, like that's right. us. It's that vibe, and then the era of games we do is like like childhood classics, which everyone will associate with, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and then like, you know, we'll, maybe we'll play a modern wonder every now and again. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, what's a modern wonder you'd want? Spider Man play? Two. I don't, dude. I really don't know about that one. No, I don't. I I'm don't gonna think enjoy so. that shit so much myself. I'm gonna, I'm gonna love it every second of it. It's one of my most anticipated games of this year, despite the fact that so many great games came out. However, I'm, I'm probably just gonna play it to myself and not on the, on the show. I agree. I might stream it. To yeah, be honest. yeah, yeah. Um, it's, it's more of like a stream game. It might be one I, I want to start doing reviews now. So, oh, we maybe, should, maybe we should collab reviews like, um. We could. Like fucking what's what's the moist meter? That's a collab review between him and uh Is it? Yeah, between him and um one of his friends. His what's his, what's his name? Oh, fuck. It's I don't know. Moist Critical's name is Charlie, and then there's another one. There's oh what the fuck is his name? He's like Australian or you, Charlie you know, Bucket from um I've gotta look it up. Hold on. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Yeah, um yeah. no, no, it's actually really cool because they, they make the review together and then Charlie just does the, the read over for it. Yeah, the the commentary. But I'm pretty sure it's like a duo review. Um I would be down. I feel like we also have polar opposite opinions on Yeah, I don't I don't know if we'd be very good at, at yeah, like kind of I'm I'm more of like a solo act when it comes to that kind of stuff. I'm, oh, come on. I, I no but I, like I, I really do think that we have like opposite opinions. I don't know if we can come up with like a um unified opinion on things. That would be the fun part. Fog. Like I could help you with, with things, like in terms of you were trying to put something up, if you need help editing something, if you need yeah. help, you know, doing whatever. I can help with that, but in terms of like the actual takes and everything, I think that's that's for you to, uh, motherfucker. I think those, those takes are for you to have, you know? Okay, that's fair. Mm -hmm. But also, it'd be kind of dope. Um, I, I can't do. find his friend's name, and now, now I feel bad because I remember I was listening to their they're on like a podcast together, like what the fuck, dude? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's fine. <sighs> no, I'm it's sure not. he doesn't want to be remembered anyway. I just, I, I'm not going to feel good until I like quote <laughs> who sure the person is. Forgotten the time, I'm sure, bro. I'm joking. Oh, oh my God. 30 spatulas. Can you fathom that many? We have 30 spatulas? We do. What is the minimum to finish this game? I think 80. Okay, that's not too bad. We need 80. We fucking did it. Jackson. It's Jackson, Jackson okay. and Moist Critical. And, okay. Um, yeah. A I rem spatula. I remember his name now. We're good. Oh, yeah. I don't remember it. I found it on Spotify under their podcast title. Okay. Which is, I'll plug it as well because, you know, we're so massive. We're helping out the little guy. Yeah, yeah. We got to help out the little guys. <laughs> uh, it's called The Official Podcast, which is actually channel. a good-ass name. Yeah. That's a good ass name. It's the only one you need, I guess. That's what that's what I like about and I mentioned this before. That's what I like about like kind of the moist critical stuff is that he mm -hmm. just he just curates the news for you. Like I could get off of Twitter if I wanted to. I could get off of uh you know, all my platform. I could get off of YouTube and then just watch him or whatever. Yeah, it's nice. Do you want to get the next level or you want me to take over? You wanna you wanna you wanna Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how you're feeling. You're I'm feeling it. I just know it? you love the Sandy Street Dome level. I do like it. Where he, he also, loses. I wouldn't define this as a level. I define it as like a mini game. 
fair enough. But the mini game is just more of the game. You're just fighting. It's just a little boss rush situation, or like a little not a boss rush, eh? an enemy rush. Dude, I hate, I hate the PS3 form factor. Really? Yeah, I'm not a big fan of it. I know you like it. I just like, like it. It just feels so uncomfortable. I like that it's a little too small. It is a little small. Like it's, dude, fuck Don't off. Die. Don't die. I'm so dead. There's underwears. There's underwears. You don't need to do this. There's oh, underwears. Oh, I see him. I see him. You don't have need to, to be a hero. I have to kill all the enemies, though, right? Yeah, but you. there's more underwears. You don't need to be a hero. The motherfucker's about to do it. No! <gasps> Did I do it? No. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm so clean Holy with it, dude. I'm shit. so and nice you, and with you it, fast bro. Fast traveled, and you fast traveled to the damn. That's actually part of the speed hideous. run. He's 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 horrifying. He looks by like the way. me right now, for yeah, real. Yeah, yeah. What? He do. <laughs> That's you, fucked you, up. You you said it. All right, I'll keep I'm that in mind. I'm just fucking agreeing. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I'm just no, I'm fucking. Joking. I'm just being. All, yeah, your ass does look big in that outfit. <gasps> yeah, yeah, dude. That. Dude, Chilium tentacles. Who? Fucking Chilium tentacles. Krillium. Wow. Kr you. We're gonna see. You're gonna you're gonna be like, holy shit. This Who? is. You remember? Squillium Fancy Son? No, fucking Chillium Tentacles, dude. <laughs> Cillian Murphy? No, Chillium. <laughs> Did you watch Oppenheimer, by the way? Uh, no, I was sick when when uh, when the Barbenheimer watch together was happening. That's a shame. Yeah, I wanted to see Barbie. I didn't really care about Oppenheimer. I'm gonna be honest. That's mm, hot take, I guess. <laughs> it's a good ass movie. Um, no, dude, Chillium Tentacles. Okay, so you don't remember because we were, it was from our first. It's from our botched recording. If he can salvage it, maybe he can find it. Okay. We talked about this level because I like this level a lot, number mm -hmm. one. Number two, the enemy at the end of this level, I couldn't remember his name, but he's like a krill and he plays like like ice music notes on like a fucking trumpet or some shit. Okay. And I called him Chillium Tentacles and you were like, that's good. You have to remember that for when we get to that level. Oh, and now you remembered it. And, and I remembered like, and it. Now it's weeks later and I'm like, who the fuck are you? Yeah. What are you doing in my house? Yeah, yeah. And now, now I'm embarrassed. Well, sorry for making you feel bad for just something that you were supposed to do. Yeah, I went out of my way to be like a like a yeah, hashtag yeah. good guy. Did you hold that? Did you remember oh, that? Dude, throughout we didn't the get week the too? bubble, did we? Oh, we did. Guess what, buddy? We did. Cool. Guess what, buddy? You need it to do the mermelade. What are you crazy? Yeah, I actually had it saved in my phone, to be honest. The the bubble bowl? No, Chilean tentacles. Oh, okay. Were you thinking about it throughout the week? Um, no, I didn't even realize we would get this far this soon, to you be just, frank. You just got there, and then you were like, Chilean Tent, it was there, it was... Exactly. You had it queued. I had it, I had it queued up in the memory banks, and, uh, so, okay, well... Damn, you just tanked that shit, huh? I did, I guess I, I think I messed up the fucking, in, like, uh, excuse me, <laughs> I messed up the, um, animation. It's all good. We're this, all friends here. We're all friends here. Yo, they just fucked up the sponge on the hook. I would say that this is the best level batch, by the way. Mermaid Lair, fucking Rock Bottom. And there's then, one uh, other one, right? There's this, this, this sand, like the snow place. Is that this? Yeah, that's this Dude, batch of levels. So yeah. you're playing, you're playing Rock Bottom, straight up. I don't like Rock Bottom. I, I, okay, well, good luck. I don't know. I want to do the sand one. No, I want to do the sand one. I feel like, fucker. feel like you don't understand. I'm You're not... going to make me do fucking SpongeBob's Dream? No. I'll do SpongeBob's Dream if you do Kelp Forest. Deal. Okay. But but I need to do the, the sand one. Or at okay. least we can alternate like the... No, uh, you can do the sand no, one. You better no, not embarrass yourself. Stop. Go we'll, ahead. We'll alternate the... Nah, you uh, can do the whole thing. All right, fuck you. I'm really... This is uh, the the controller feels so much like slidier than my controller. Well, I have beef. I don't know what to tell you. Fix it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there ain't no way I'm getting all the uh, spatulas on this level. By the way. Oh, you are. No. Oh, buddy, you are. Because the, there's one hard ass spatula on this level. You know I'm the one I'm talking to, about? The one where you have to, to like guide the ball. Yep. I could do that one. Fuck off. Get that not, shit over right I'm now. Nah, nah, yeah. Whoa, whoa, come on. Not I, right now. I got time. I got time. I think it's easier than you're giving yourself credit for. It's actually not that hard. I don't know. I remember, like, even as an adult, like, last time I played this, I was like, oh, this shit sucks. The Marmalade. There's only four uh, socks on this level? I didn't, I didn't look. 
I didn't I did. see it. Only four socks. It, I mean, lore wise, it makes sense. Because when is Merman Patrick Barnacle Boy? Well, when is Patrick going to go lose his socks in Mermaid Lair? Oh, wait, no, you had a perfect alley. I gave you a perfect alley oop. What was the alley oop? This is Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy's lair. There's two of them. They have four feet combined. They wear that, four socks. That is a stretch, brother. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> that, that is, <laughs> Are you fucking serious? <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking serious. That's they wear four socks between the two of them. They have four feet. Look, I recognize. There's two of them. I recognize what you're saying. No one else should be in the room. And I'm layer. not saying that it's invalid. But you can't say that considering Krillium Tentacles is in the fucking Mermelair. Yeah, he invaded it. He doesn't belong here. You say he invaded it. I say they invaded him. They're colonizers. No, they're not, not in this situation. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. Okay. If we want to have a conversation about that, yes, Merman and Bronco <laughs> Boy kind of are, in a way, yes, colonizers, right? You tell me. Well, no, they don't. I don't know. Like, are, are they? I mean, they saved the fish, though. You say they saved the fish. I say they invaded the oceans. They fight evil. They're like, they're like a uh, Black Manta from Aquaman, dude. No one watches that shit. No, <laughs> go fuck <laughs> off, dude. That's really mean. I'm sorry. But no one watches that shit. Fuck I'm you. I'm still mad at you. I'm still mad at you for saying that <laughs> it's a stretch that in the fucking Merma layer, the layer that Mermaid Man and Bonk Boy live in, that they wouldn't have four socks between the two of them. Fuck, dude. I'm emailing a damn dev of this game and asking them, did you put four socks in the Mermelair because Mermaid and Barnacle Boy are, are, are... They have four feet total. No, they're going to say, when does Patrick take his ass down to fucking the Mermelair? And then you're going to feel like... You're going to feel fucked up. You're going to be like, that makes me feel some type of way and I'm sad. Okay, he goes to the Mermelair more than he would go to Rock Bottom. Oh, well, we don't know how many are in Rock Bottom, do we? There's going to be like fucking eight or nine because it's a big level. Maybe this is actually this is like a small level, relatively. And you know why it's so small? Because only two people live in the damn Mermelayer. Oh my and it's Mermaid god! And, Boy. and guess how many feet they each have? Two, <laughs> right? And then how many socks go on a foot? One sock per foot. They have four feet, therefore four socks. Four socks in the Mermelayer. Thoughts? No, uh, you know what? The logic is there. Oh, really? Yeah, the logic <laughs> makes sense. Because you said it, you told me it was a stretch before. Uh, look, hear me out. <laughs> hear me out. Uh -huh. The socks are probably like they're not wearing socks. Look how old they are. You know why? Why? Because they're lost in the mermelayer and you have to find them. Oh, true. You know what? You got me there. There you go. Okay, pick it up and throw it into each of the funnel machines. They actually are all Patrick socks, apparently. But maybe they're not Patrick socks. Maybe you're just finding random socks. No, I'm. I, okay. You know what? You got me. They're Patrick's lost socks. You're right. Okay. Oh my god. That was cake. Beast mode. Cake, baby, cake. Holy shit. I don't, there's not a time limit on these, right? Uh, no. I think you just need to do them one by one. What you know about? Oh fuck! That's how they get you. I forgot that was even a thing. Yeah, me too. My ass was not paying attention. That's cool. Which is, I guess, part of the game design, right? I can't be mad about that. I'm so focused, bro. Nice. Why is um, it still? It's still binging, bro. It's just, it's like a happy bang, you know? Okay. Holy shit. No, no, don't, don't panic. That's what they want you to, they wanted you to panic. Well, it worked. There, I don't know. I don't know what the goal was. I think you gotta just throw them at the platforms. And then pick them up as and I go. Pick, yeah, pick them up when you're like less, less heavy. Let's see. Of it. But you can kind of just keep running. I think you can just gun it. Oh, no, that's better. That's definitely better. Damn! I'm kind of clean with it. That motherfucker Patrick has got a, got a fucking cannon, bro. He was a D1, dude. A cannon for for an arm, bro. D1, D1 football. Okay. Alabama State. Okay. You don't watch college football. I don't watch college football. What position did he play? A quarterback. That's why he's got a gun of an arm. Okay. Hello. Okay. You got me. Oh, yeah. Fucking You got me. You. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah. Shit, bro. Shit. All right, I would I would have said he was a wide receiver, even though the wide receiver <laughs> receives widely. He doesn't throw widely. Receives widely. <laughs>
Let me te let me teach you how to do this one. I know how. I know how. Watch. You know you know how you're supposed to do it. Watch, watch, watch. You know, you know how learn. you're supposed to do it. Yeah, dude. You ready? I hope you're right. That resets it, right? I'm pretty sure about that. That yeah. resets it. Okay. Watch, watch. You, you and know you learn, know how to brother. do it. Yep. Okay. Okay, those three are turned inwards. We're gonna flip around. Boom. That's those three. Okay. I'm waiting. I'm working on it. Okay. Hold on. All right. <clears throat> Got that shot. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm literally just clearing my throat, man. Uh huh. Oh god. All right. Hold on. So it flips around the three, right? Mm hmm. Hold on. I, I that wasn't my laugh. Was all I'm saying. I'm I'm dead serious right now. I could do it. I gotta I gotta restart. Hold on. I gotta restart. No Just Say the word. I'm. I got you. I know the order. Look, it's fine. I know. By I, heart, I know I, the order. I know the order, bro. It's fine, bro. Look, one. Okay. Boom. Okay. Okay. All right. Hold on. Now if I. <clears throat> if I, <laughs> I'm, I'm just, just clear my throat. Nothing if serious. I do that, okay. Mm -hmm. And then I do this. I'm pretty sure. No, this one. There we go. Yes, that's six of them now. Mm -hmm. Nope, that is not six. Hold on, one, two, three, four. That's seven. Hold up, hold up. Hold and they up. have to face the other way. Huh? You need the the tips inward. I right. Oh, thank you. I recognize that. Yeah. Um. Now, now it should be six. Cause okay. it's two, three, 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 three. Yep. Boom. Okay. I got it. I got it. I know you wanted to uh, show off your stuff, but uh, unfortunately, buddy boy, kind of nice with it. <laughs> Did it work? Boom! I knew. Wow. It. Okay. I knew. I knew it. Did you know if you just do every single one in a circle, it works? Why would I? That sounds like too much work. <laughs> you just do every single one. I could have definitely done that faster than you did that, is all I'm saying. I mean, now we have no way of proving it. Reset the fucking thing. We're nope. Restart. Save the game. Save the game. Restart the, hit the reset towers thing. Does it nope. reset the towers? That, uh, that, right. that button doesn't work. He doesn't even, he's too scared to even see if it works. It's not that I'm scared. It's that mm. I don't want to embarrass you live on our mm. recording, you know? Mm. Because I'll cut it out, and then everyone will be like, why is there a <laughs> three-minute chunk missing? And it was the time where I... Where you just... You know, I, I tried there. to bludgeon you to death after you embarrassed me on the show. <laughs> bludgeoned me to death? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I picked up a, a stapler and tried to beat you over the head with it. Jesus almighty, that's I'm just grisly, saying, I'm dude. just saying. God. Just like that. Yep. <sighs> I'm <Yep>. so angry. <laughs> just got See, a lot of pent-up rage. You got a lot of rage, you got to... You gotta get out. Yeah, you know, I'm working on it. It's okay. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Yeah, it's okay. I'll be patient with you. Don't worry. Thanks, man. That, Someone's got That be. means a lot. Some, you know, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't deal with a lot of patience as a you, as a you, you know? Okay. Fuck, dude, please, bro. Were you an angry kid? What, 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 do you, what uh, you? do you want the lore on that? I mean, if you're comfortable giving it. I, I have, I'm comfortable giving it yeah. at this point. Yeah, I had some anger issues growing up. Okay. Yeah, I was in therapy for like... I don't know, eight years or so. I got you. I'm in therapy right now. Yeah. There you go. It's good. It's good. Like, I'm not angry anymore. I can fucking harm a fly out of anger, realistically. Let's go. There's seldom times where I get so angry compared to how I used to. Were you, like, getting in fights and stuff? Uh, no, I wasn't getting... Well, yes and no. So I did almost get into a fight with this one kid. Okay. So this kid was... Bull Here's the lore. This mm. kid was bullying me. I think it was fourth grade fourth or fifth grade mm. and so this kid that lived on my block was bullying me and he was a year younger than me he just like was picking beef with some like for some reason like yeah, he yeah. just wouldn't leave me the fuck alone and so i'm we're about to encounter chilium tentacles by the way and so okay. i'm um it's a snowy day it was snowing mm. i got off the bus i was walking home and when i was walking home um he was just like following me, like throwing snowballs at me and shit. And this mm -hmm. is when I was still going through like my anger management phase. Okay. And so um, I got home and I walked with my my younger step, uh, or I'm sorry, my younger sister and my stepbrother, who was he's six months younger than me. Mm -hmm. And uh, I was like, go inside. And I grabbed a fucking plastic shovel and almost beat his ass. 
Okay. But my neighbor came out and stopped me. Mm-hmm. My neighbor came, who I like, I wasn't like close with my neighbor at all, and I wasn't yeah. close after this. I think they just saw like two, two youth youths about to go at it. Mm-hmm. This kid was about to get a fucking plastic shovel in the mouth, deservedly so. By okay. the way, I might add. Um. So was I an angry kid? Yes. Okay. I, I, yeah, I had some, I had some anger management problems. So it got broken up. What did you do after that? After it got broken up? Uh, I cried. And okay. Like, I called my mom. No, that's fine. I cry when I get like real fucking mad. Like, mm-hmm. I, it's not, it's not like a, an enjoyable euphoric feeling for me. It's like, ugh, I'm so upset that I'm mad. You know? Yeah. I was a really anxious kid. Oh. Okay. Um, believe it or not, didn't didn't go to any sort of therapy, but. Definitely would have benefited from it. Mm. Um, but no, I just have a memory of uh, I was in school. We were singing the um, we were doing the Pledge of Allegiance and then we were singing the national anthem in school. OK. And I didn't know the words. And I was so embarrassed in like kindergarten because I was like, bro, everyone knows the words but me. Like I was like I fucked up. Like I like I I went to the school thing. I tried to give it a fair chance. Mm-hmm. I'm meeting these brand new people. I've already fucked up in front of them. It's ruined. Okay. Um. And this was like first first couple days of kindergarten. Um. Couple days go by. We're watching a movie in class, and I just fucking Ralph in the middle of class. You throw up? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh okay. Yeah. yeah I've never up. heard of that term. You never heard Ralph? No, I've never must, heard of that. Must be an old head. Uh, term for it but yeah I, I threw up uh had to throw up was like please don't throw up please don't throw up and then and then god damn dude hit, hit the throw up on him hit the throw up <laughs> on him <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah horse maybe that's that's a that's a term you might understand yeah i just no, hit, I get the, that. hit the throw up on him <laughs> um <laughs> apologies for anyone sensitive to <laughs> sensitive to sounds gag of, noises dude. sounds of fucking throwing up i apologize um but uh, yeah, we you know so I uh, that was kind of my first week of kindergarten, um, and then was just very shy the rest of the time. We would go to like school assemblies, and they would be like, "Well, you gotta pay attention to the school assembly. You can't like take bathroom breaks during it." And I started crying because I was like, "What if I gotta piss?" <laughs> like, like I was you know, yeah, no. I was like trying to you know, I wasn't trying to bend the rules and be bad, but I was like, I might need to bend the rules because what if I gotta fucking piss? You, you might legit have to go and piss. Yeah, 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 like your pants, and um, and I found out that that w- that was just a formality. That was just so everyone and their mom didn't like try to go and take a piss, you know. Yeah. So if I had to piss, then they would be like, "Yeah, you could piss if you need to piss." And I was like, "Okay." Um, so yeah, so that and that also taught me early on that uh, like uh, school is a load of malarkey, basically. Hey, I mean, uh, there are there are uh, grown ass uh, men and women who are trying to have beef with a child. Uh, yeah, in, but in like school. the child deserves it. Uh, no, not I'm, I'm playing. I'm. <laughs> that's kind of that's kind of lit. That was kind of lit. That know, was kind of lit. Light fixture. Um, kind of lit. No, that sucks. I mean, I wouldn't. I mean, you're a very sociable person, from what I know about you. I um, am good. With people that I know and people that I know, I'm like cool around. Like I like, hear that. I I won't be like my full because I've talked about this. Fuck my, I don't. Me. I don't think my my sense of humor, my brand of humor, is like universal. I hear that. Yeah, I agree with that. Um. So I will make sure that someone is cool with like my my stylings and like understands me at least to an extent before I will like be fully myself. You know. Yeah. But I'm also like getting better where I'm just not afraid to like be myself and. You know, I don't know. Except that if someone doesn't fuck with me, like I, I don't know. Like that's 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 it's it. Their, it's their law. Dude, come on, man. What the <laughs> fuck? This shit sucks. Um, it's pretty. No, good. I hear that. I mean, I've game, I've sort of had the opposite. Like when I was a kid, I wasn't like anxious at all. Yeah. And now, like now as an adult, dude, like I'm like, I'm not like I don't have general anxiety. Like I don't like you know sweat when I'm opening up the door every day. You know, like right. the outside, but. I do have a lot of like social uh, preventatives in my mind that like make me um, make me like eat, like scared to socialize and like make friends. Which like That's I don't think I don't think you would you would peg that about. I me. wouldn't have picked that up about you. Do you want me to take? No, over? I got it. Okay, I got just, it. Just, just, I'm only really as, stressed as a about friend it. asking. Um, um. Yeah. 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 I don't know. I think it's just like because of similar instances but like I think a lot of like what 
I don't know, like maybe like the culture. I mean, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> like, I'm just getting fucking destroyed by this fucking dumbass fucking robot cowboy, dude. <laughs> why the fuck is he a cowboy? He's a cowboy. What, but why the fuck is he a cowboy? Why did they I decide don't know. to do that? Oh, thematically, they just mm. needed to do it for whatever reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Sandy had a companion in this world. Yeah, probably. So Sandy actually. had someone that could understand her. That's um. <sighs> Oh man, I don't know. Oh yes, dude. Oh, this is for a sock. Oh, dude, fuck my life. Damn, that was that's a crazy. Dumb fucking... Well, it's two socks that you need, you know. Come on, come on. Oh, you're, you're gonna go for I'm, the death. I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm trying yeah, to yeah. end I got it. You, I got you. No, that's interesting um, to me because I, like, I wouldn't have pegged you for like a, a guy who has anxieties now socially and everything. Yeah, but I'm sort of like the opposite of you, like. Well, maybe not the opposite. Well, so so what's interesting is that I had kind of about where I wasn't really like that. Like I remember being, um, I was maybe ten years old. My brother was like a, like four years older than me. Mm -hmm. We went to camp the one time, or like not camp, but we went camping like next to like this summer camp with some friends, with like some of my brother's friends. My experience with my brother's friends has been like they kind of just didn't like me because I was younger. Like that's kind of just how yeah, dudes and that's, are sometimes. Yeah, you know, that's like normal. It's like my brother's like the cool one. I'm like the fucking lame one that's four years younger or whatever. And they were like his friends and stuff, but I would get dragged along because like I couldn't be like home alone or whatever mm -hmm. when there's like you know families hanging out. So yeah, we we went camping. Uh, it was all of us, and then I was like the only one that was younger. Um, okay. I was ten. They were all maybe like thirteen or fourteen at the time. And uh, I just remember there were, like, these these girls that they were like, oh, those girls are cute. Like, we should talk to them. We should do whatever. And, like, I just had, like, zero fear at all, like, talking to them. Like, I walked up to them. I was like, hey, those guys want to talk to you. And then, like, we hung out with those girls, like, the entire night and stuff. And I, nice. I, I, was, I was the man. You know, I was like, oh, fuck. I'm cool as fuck for that. Um, and, uh, and, yeah, that's just, that's just, like, just one thing that, like, I remember and stuff from, from back in the day. Oh. Am I? I was on it, right? No, no. That that opens up a thingy that you have to throw a bowling ball at in front of you. Oh, yeah. So what yeah, is yeah. this? Like I have to hit it like that. Okay, there okay. we go. I'm refamiliarizing myself. Yeah, yeah. No, you're good. This one, I feel like it takes this like, one's fucking, a bitch. Dude. It's tri it's literally trial and error because some of this stuff like isn't very intuitive. This is actually something that I feel that the remake gets a little bit better, where you can tell what the fuck's going on. Really? <clears throat> yeah, because like, it, how are you supposed to know about this shit? And then you gotta go on that. It goes up there. I and pretty much immediately have to hit this, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mother? Oh, no, don't hold it. Don't hold it. I'm not trying to. Oh, no. I think the... Oh, is the ball lost or not? No. Okay, okay. You're good, you're good. Oh, oh my God, keep bro. Keep going, keep going. Run, run, run. Is it that path up there? How do you, where yeah, do you go? Yeah, it's this path up here. Fuck, dude. I'm All not right. going to make it. You're gonna make it. Just stay on that shit. Okay, keep going. Okay, you could hit that button with your fucking. Just hit it with your spatula. Okay. Oh, and then that that's like a balance board thing. That's like a balance board thing. Oh, oh. no way. No fucking way in <laughs> hell. Are you for fucking real, bro? <sighs> no. So you you was just the man, huh? Uh, yeah, no, I was the man, and then I also had like a phase where like I was just like a little shit also, where like I'd be like really annoying to people and like not annoying, like I yeah, like kind of annoying. Like I there I had kind of a phase where uh, I wanted to be oh, cool, so me. I was just kind of kind of like an asshole in like middle school and That's stuff. That's life. I was, like thirteen or whatever. That's life. Um, and then I went to high school and I didn't know anybody and I was really quiet again, and then I was really shy and then like social and like normal when I was like maybe 17 uh, and then went through some phases after that and then here I am today nice you know well you're back you know I'm back now uh, still got the, still got a little bit of the anxiety but uh, got a lot of good friends a lot of good support systems yeah that's part of life you know I get anxious about like life stuff now like I I feel like I make enough money to make ends meet on a lot of things, yet I will still be like, can I pay my bills? And it's like, well, yeah, like, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm like, okay with Dude, come on, dude. Oofa. <sighs> it's so fucking infuriating. It's so fucking infuriating. So, yeah, I went, I went from uh, super anxious to uh, super uh, balls to the wall to, uh, to, I don't know, man. There well, you go. 
I feel like being anxious about life things is absolutely normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd say if you weren't anxious about life things, like just general life, like paying bills and shit, mm -hmm. you're not human. Yeah, that's true. Everyone's had the thought, uh, can I pay? Can I afford to... <gasps> go down, go down, go down. Oh, come on. This bitch got stuck. What a load of fucking malarkey, dude. What a load of barnacles. Oh. Okay. Well, Mr. whatever. Mr. Krabs, I have an idea. Yeah, I don't know why I got, like, socially anxious. I don't know. I think it's just life. I don't mind talking to people once I fuck with them, but it's just yeah, getting yeah, to the yeah. process of fucking with them. And I also don't mind talking to strangers. I, I'll, you know, I'll talk to a stranger every day of the week. You've mentioned this, yeah. Yeah, but but put me in a room full of like acquaintances, friends of friends, or coworkers. Dude you went it's to high over. With, uh, oh, yeah. no way, no shot. It's it's over. What what are you afraid is gonna happen? They're gonna I don't know. Like, they're gonna be like, you changed, man. You used to be cool, but now you fucking suck, Addison. To is be, that your fear? Not even. I wasn't. I mean, I was a relative. I was like not. The you most think it's popular. gonna fuck you over right now? Yeah, for sure. Nope. Nah, nah, nah. Um, so like, for example, there's this one person from high school who, like, I wasn't close with back then. Mm -hmm. uh, dude, dude, how like, the fuck is it? Like, there's no. I I wasn't <laughs> slow on that, right? I think it's because you hit the other one so early. It came up faster than. Oh my god. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I hear you. Um, Sorry, one person from high school. This person from high school is this uh, waiter at this bar in my town, mm -hmm. and uh, we didn't talk much in high school, I don't think. But now he's like, he's cool as fuck because I'm a regular at the bar, mm -hmm. um, and that's like a nice experience. Like he's a really nice guy and goes out of his way to like say hello and like, mm -hmm. like you know, make friends essentially. Right. And I think it's because he has the same shit where like he's, you know, he's been stuck in this town that I'm stuck in and like is a waiter at this bar and he's trying to go back to college. Like he's going to like community college and shit. Mm -hmm. And, uh, with that, I think he's just trying to make like friends or at least just be friendlier, you know? Yeah. No, I feel that. Oh, dude, fuck, fuck. You're good. You're chilling. I know. I know. I know. I know. I, this is a genuinely, this might be my least favorite spatula in the game. Yeah. It's a lot more, uh, arduous than I remember from, uh, from before. A lot more fucking annoying. I could just hit it, right? I think so, right? No, nope. you need. I'm sorry, you need the. It's fine. That's life. Okay. I'm. I, it's gone. It's gone. Why the fuck is it gone? Because oh, is I, there the fan? The fan. Look, look behind. Oh, what? never mind. What do you need that fan for? That fan uh, turns on once it's in there, and then you need to throw the bubble to like right. knock it down finally. Damn, that's annoying. Like as once fuck. It, this is like the last part. Like once it's past this part, it's you're good. It's yeah, just yeah, getting yeah. past this part. I might hand it over to you, and if I fail this time, understand. I'm getting tired of it. Yeah, yeah, you're good. You're valid, sir. Throw that back. That seems like a good time to. Yep. There's a little bit of leniency on that one. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Um. Wait, I forget if, if I asked this. Did you play the movie game for this game? Yeah, you asked me a little Spongebob? bit ago. I I haven't. It's uh, it's like a sequel to Battle for Bikini Bottom. Really? It's a little bit worse, but a little bit better. In some well, I heard ways. Cosmic Shake is also like a sequel for. Yeah, yeah. yeah. BFB, as the kids call it. Yeah, BBFB. Wait, BFBB. BFBB? Yeah, BFBB. Battle for Bikini Bottom, yes. The best friends forever. Best, best friends forever. forever. Ding. Yeah. Nice. Okay, we're solid. we're solid. So what does that do? The that stops there? the hammer. Oh, okay. Which is, I mean, frankly, it's an RNG chance of it being hit anyways. Yeah. Okay, come on, this side. Go over here. I mean, what the <laughs> fuck, you dude? Want, you want, yeah. You want me to give it a try? John Hub is now on the controller. I'm on. Man. I'm on the control. So I just wanted to. That's a sock right there. That's yep. a sock right through Weird here. Genius. Oh fuck my life. My fault. That's embarrassing. No, not actually. Oh, that's just fucked up and embarrassing. Isn't there a way to like glitch into here? Can't you do like a little? Can't you do like a little fucking? Dude, just do the actual thing. <laughs> I could do it. I could do it. No. I mean, I'm sure there's a clipping method, yeah, but... But if I do it like this, then I don't have to do it like any other way. What? Yeah, but you're going to feel so much more satisfied. I think I'd feel better like this. No. Okay. All right, you got this. I'll get it the proper way. I'll get it... I'll get it as God intended, you know? <laughs> uh... <laughs> Christ. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, I was going to say. Well, well like, this is your first time doing it. Oh. Uh, get ready to hit it back. Get yeah, ready to yeah, hit yeah. it back. There we go. Fucking 
perfect. Barely. Fucking perfect. Thank you. Yeah, of course. That's just because it happened to me. It's my yeah, it's my first time, but I have the experience of having seen you go through it. Yeah. So I can. Uh, this one's pretty liberal with it. Once you see it in the top right corner of your screen, hit it. Yeah. Like uh, like right now. Uh no, top right. Now. There we go. I'm going. I'm going. Yep. You have plenty oh, of time. I can't see the fucking screen that well. I feel like I'm going blurry eyed, but I'm going blurry visioned right now. I'm seeing you red plenty right of time, now. Plenty of time. You don't even have to hit the hammer if you don't want to, but if it gets knocked off by the hammer, you're going to be pissed. I do. I do want to hit the hammer. So. No. Yep, that's part of it. It fucking shatters into a million pieces? It's, that's just, I mean, it's, they couldn't it's even, a stupid thing because it's like completely RNG anyways. They couldn't even hit it off. It's fucked up. It is fucked up. Once you get that hammer, though, the balancing shit is so... In <laughs> He's doing it again. <laughs> He's going back to his old speed running shenanigans. It's not going to work, my man. I could do it. Come on. I could do it. I can't do it. You got this. You think I can do it? No. I just gotta look up how. To, I gotta look like if I saw a video of someone doing it, I could probably do it. No. All right, come on, you could do this. All right, let's do it the proper way. Where the fuck am I going? Other way. Oopsies. 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 Mr. Krabs, how'd you even get in this silly situation of yours? I don't know. He's never been involved with Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy, yeah, according to the according to the SpongeBob lore. Yeah, he doesn't like give a shit about them. You got to toss it now. Yep. Get ready. You just got to do it. It's every time, bro. It's every day, bro. Yeah, what's Jake Paul been up to? Uh, He just does fights now, I think. Is that like his new shtick? Yeah, I think he just does fights these days. Hey, good for him. I think um, he had a controversial kind of history, so then he got famous off of people being like, Oi, they're going to kick his ass. You know, like everyone got excited because they were like, Yeah, I'd like to see Jake Paul get his ass yeah. beat. But like, he's actually a pretty competent boxer. Yeah. Believe it or not. I haven't watched too much of it. Yeah, you got it. In fact, you have more time than you need now. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, he's all right. You know, I've watched like maybe one of his fights. But he definitely fucking rigs that shit, though. For sure. Like, they definitely say to themselves, like, how much I mean, money maybe, can we milk yeah, out maybe of Maybe they go a little bit easier and or I don't, something. Yeah, I don't think, like, it's like they pull punches or whatever, but they definitely, like, don't punch him as hard or they'll go out of this, their way to, like, make, like, clumsy mistakes. Right. Oh. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. That's okay. it, baby. Good job. Yeah. Nah. You... I'm gonna play the boss fight now. You just All did right. the fucking. You can play fucking Krillian. Dude. Krillian Murphy. Chillium, Chillium, Chillium tentacles. <laughs> Why didn't SpongeBob just drop his big ass on that counterweight <laughs> if that was the problem? Honestly, that's probably how the speedrunners do it. Yeah. They probably, they, pro they probably go out here like this and then go. Yeah, SpongeBob he drops his big ass. Yeah. You know, yeah, shit yeah. like that. Yeah, I got scared for a second just in case the fucking dude. Dome I would hope not. Down. I mean, based on the other instances in this game, yeah, I can't I imagine think, it would. I don't think it would do that. It wouldn't fuck around and do that to you, but you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. You know what they say? What do they say? It is what it is. That's oh. What they, say. they also say that that this boss fight is the best boss fight in the game. But you don't fight them yet. No, you, I mean, you don't. You have to talk to the computer, and then the computer opens up the bridge. But once you do that, you can fight Chillium Tentacles. Okay. Um, and oh, yeah. Yeah. Dude, this level's so awesome. I think his name is Big Krill. No, I think his name is, like, canonically, like, like, you know, Mozart or some shit like that. Ice Spice. Ice Spice, yeah. yeah. He, he is kind of Ice Spice, yeah. for real. Yeah. You try that new Duncan Ice Spice yet? That looks disgusting to me. I, I I'm not a, you. I mean I'm not sure if you I'm not remember how I take either. my coffee. No, I like Duncan. I actually really. No, like I know Duncan. you are, but I'm not. Like I'm, oh. not a, I'm not even a coffee guy. I don't drink coffee. Yeah, we can change that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I wasn't a coffee guy, and then college started. I would. I. I mean, so I've been trying to get off Sodi. Also, is the thing. Yeah. How's that been going? Um, it's been like two days since my last so. I don't do like full stop. I don't do cold turkey, but. If I could do like, if I can get down to maybe like two, three sodies a week, that'd be mm. quite nice. That'd okay. Be a, that'd be a good change of pace. Like a little treat. Yeah, it was nearly daily before. So I was like, uh, let me 
consciously make an effort to not do it because uh, I want to do more things for future me. You know, that's that's my goal. Okay, I get that. So that's good. No, been working I'm, out. I'm been trying to you. trying to lose some weight because I'm I, I weigh more than I've ever weighed mm. uh, lately. So and I wanted to film something, but I'm like, what? What if fat? You know, like I hear that. But also, it'd be funny if if I'm like the size I am now, which I don't think I'm like fat, but like no, you if I'm the, not if I'm the size I am now, and then some, you know, you see me like three videos later, and I'm like forty pounds later. That would be insane. That'd be funny. Yeah, that would be funny. People would be like, who is this guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that jabroni from Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Uh-huh, uh-huh. You've seen that. Right? Yeah, 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 that right? is crazy that uh, Mac from Always Sunny, he, yeah. he gained like a ton of weight. Apparently, he was just like drinking a bunch of butter. It's Chillium Tentacles, by the way. That's Chillium, bro. It's Chillium. Is he related to Mr. Krabs somehow? Because he's not Chillium Tentacles. No, he's a krill. He's a I don't krill. know if he's related to Mr. Krabs, but he is a krill. He, he looks a, very he a shellfish. He's got Mr. Krabs' eyes. He does. Yeah, he yeah. does. He is a shellfish. They might be, uh, they might be brothers of some sort. I don't think they're brothers. They might be like second cousins. <laughs> um, yeah, sorry for yawning in the mic. I'm not tired. No, definitely not. I mean, I feel more more awake than I did. I can say that much. I do too. Um, but yeah, no, I've been doing the opposite. I haven't weighed myself recently, but like I'm just drinking beer every day. Okay. Yeah, it's That's, a little, that always helps lose weight. It's it's a good treat. <laughs> it's a good little treat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I have you substituted coffee for beer? Or no, just no, I do up? both. Okay. My ideal day is to sit there and drink set seventeen beers. Okay. And like play video games. What's like, your what's your what's your beer of choice? Um. So I, I typically like a Belgian white, um, which okay. is a, uh, or just any white ale. Um, typically they're a European style. Mm. Um. So an Allagash white, uh, which is a brewery outside of Maine. That's a uh, like it's brewed in Portland, Maine. I'm pretty sure. Okay. What the fuck? I think you gotta dodge him, and then eventually, he opens up the floor for you to throw some shit at him. Yeah. There you go. There, there's yep. your chance. There we go. Yeah. It's liberal about the hitbox, too, it seems. Yeah, that's good. Um, I'd like to see that. But yeah, so um, so Belgian White, um, I try, I've try. i been trying a lot of uh, local state breweries mm -hmm. that have the Belgian White. Um, or you gotta, or jump. Brew. you gotta jump over shirt. I see, I see, I see. I wasn't paying attention. Oh. Well, do you see or where you're not paying attention? Both. <laughs> it's like I see it, but I'm not, I'm not observing it, you know? Okay. Like my brain was off. Okay. Factually. Okay. So nothing I would have said would have made you dodge. Is what you're no, saying. genuinely not. Okay. Like at that point, my my hearing was off, my brain was off. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I okay. That shouldn't have hit me. Yeah, you but gotta that's jump life. over his shit. Though. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I got you. I got you, brother. I I thought I jumped over that one. I'm Don't not you die lie, on the bro. last hit of Krillium tentacles? Don't you please, die? Please, 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 please. Ufa. Um. You know, he's never appeared in the show until, like, last year. Oh, he actually did appear in the show? Yeah. Interesting. Is he? Did he show up as one of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy's rivals? I don't know how he appeared, frankly, but he okay. did appear factually in the show. Did they just find, a, like, a, some red, random red krill and then call him Krillium Tentacles? Because I, I don't fuck with that. No, dude, no way. I think that's probably what they did. I, I bet he didn't show up. It's, okay, how about you look it up? How about you prove me wrong? All right, what's his right? It's not Krillium Tentacles. What's his name? Say that motherfucker from B Battle for Bikini Bottom with the, the tuba. The Kr Krill... Krill... Krill from Boss from Battle for Bikini Bottom. <clears throat> Krill from BFBB. His name is... Uh, Johnny Krill. Nope. His name is... Uh, Dude, I keep getting hit by these stupid fucking fodder enemies, and I'm getting angry. Because uh -huh. I think uh -huh. I think enemy spam is genuinely one of the dumbest things for, in boss fights. There's like three enemies on the field. I, don't, I wouldn't call it spamming. It's enemy spam. Uh, I skill issue. I think. In my opinion. Keep talking that work. <laughs> don't quit the. His name is Prawn, bro. His name is not Krilly. He's a Prawn. His name is Prawn. It's the same thing. <laughs> a Prawn is just a really big ass krill. But his name is not Krillium Tentacles or anything fancy. His name is literally just Prawn. It was a fucking joke I made in our first recording. All right, I'm sorry. No, not actually. I got really butthurt about I'm it. I'm not actually mad. I'm not actually He's mad. He's pissed at me. He is in the show, though. Where's that last sock, though? Because I know you got three. I don't know, bro. We really going to hunt it down. <laughs> do you want to do 100%? We really going to hunt this shit down right now? Not right now. We'll find it another day. Okay. Um, You're going to hit up... 
Yeah, let me Rock go bottom, back to right? Bikini Bottom. I'll, I'll, I'll fuck it up. This is downtown Bikini Bottom? No, just bottom? put a regular old Bikini Bottom, sir. Back home. On top of Shady Shoals. Yep. That's all you. That Shady Shoals Retirement you, Home. Shady Shoals oh, Retirement Home. Oh, yeah. I didn't jump up on top of that, John. Yep, and that's also where the other golden underpants is. Really? Mm-hmm. How hurt would you be if I just run to that sand level right now? I'd be so pissed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd be unbelievably angry with you I and with myself for trusting you. I wouldn't, though. But, oh, but I wouldn't you, do that. You wouldn't do it? But I'd never do that, though. So uh-huh, uh-huh. Nothing to worry about. Sir. If you want, we can unlock the next the next upgrade and the next part if you want. I think we have enough. Really? Do we I, really I think we're enough? gonna have enough at 40, bro. For sure. I feel like I'm cutting it close on time here. I feel like... Ah, you have plenty. You have so much time, dude. Very well. You know what we should play? This is making me think of it. Sunshine. You know, we were talking about Mario 7, however many parts ago this will have been now. We were talking about Mario 7. If we're going by, like, like main series Mario games, including 3D... Mario 7 Mario would be Sunshine. Sunshine. Would be Mario 7, yeah. That is a fire game. I, that is a good-ass Mario 7. I like 64 and uh, Galaxy more. I agree. Okay. Um, as long as we're in agreement on that. Because I didn't grow up with Sunshine. That's my thing. So, like, I yeah, played you, it... I played it as, like, this very callous, you know... 20 year old who who now is just like resentful wait do we have 40 yeah we do oh my god yeah. all right let's, we're let's blazing get, through this shit dude yeah let's get the fucking cruise the cruise bubble what then they we could just run back boost? through and you know then we don't even have to like we could probably just like any percent it pretty fast like within the next i'd say within the next recording session for sure perhaps wait so do you not want to 100 percent it we can 100 percent it I think if we 100% it, it's going to be way... You don't want 100% it. I'm seeing I don't the face. Really He's I'll, making I'll, a face right now, spatulas. folks. I'll go all spatulas. I will not... He looks horrifying, by the yeah, way. Yeah, that mouth texture is gross. I'll go, like, full level completions, right? But you have to, like, farm the fucking shiny objects for Mr. Krabs. How about you we... have to... It's a lot, bro. It's expensive. How about we just... We we see what happens. Okay. Wink, wink, no judge. We'll just yeah, we'll just let the yeah, we'll just let it if, happen. If we get to a point in the series where we're both like tired of it, yeah, yeah, yeah. or like frankly like levels just unfun, then we just right. say fuck it and we just like end it. Because I know there's a couple of bullshit um, spatulas. Oh, for or sure. Or not socks rather in this game. It's the same as the blue. That's why I don't like sunshine as much as the other two is because of the fucking blue coins. Bro. Yeah, the blue coins are the blue pain coins in the are ass. ridiculous. Well, I also think the levels in Sunshine, my opinion, are not as good as Galaxy or 64. I think it's because of what they went for. They they went for a style of like let's um let's have a shared theme, the tropical theme, and then make all the levels about that. Yeah, and I don't think that sells the game as well for me because there's no diversification. Like there is an Odyssey 64 and Galaxy. Yeah. I liked um, what they were going for, and I think they they were able to stretch the tropical thing very far. But yeah. it does it does result in a couple of forgettable levels or levels that you mistake for other ones. I will say, however, it's still like an eight out of ten. Right, right. Like right. if the other games are nine to ten out of ten, which I think Galaxy is a ten out of ten. Yeah, yeah. I think Odyssey is just an, a ten out of ten. Mm -hmm. um, I, I think 64 I, is a nine out of ten. Simply actually, due to its age. I actually completely, like, pivoted my stance on Odyssey. I didn't like Odyssey at first. Okay. But then I tried doing an all moons run, and I loved it. My like, I, I, I think it's it's a master class in level design. Like, I think, I think you go to any level in Mario Odyssey, everything serves a purpose. Yep. There is no stone left unturned. If something looks a little out of the ordinary, it's like, well, this shouldn't be here, and it's a fucking moon, or it's a fucking purple coin or whatever that's spongebob texture yeesh yeah it's a little they're a little scary looking i'm not gonna lie without like proper shading and stuff yeah they I, all look pretty uh pretty wild i will say however that my big beef with odyssey and i haven't replayed it in a while like so this might just be like mm. poor remembrance or something like that right um this is how why are you did doing that bro because you're avoiding everything just just fucking swing no i'm I'm going above everything so he doesn't hit me with the fucking thingies. Okay. Um. My big... I, I'm not a big fan of the open world-esque design. I okay. think it's cool, but 
I don't know. Part of me likes the the separated levels. Everything. He's shooting in a straight line. He can't even hit me. I gotcha. Part of me likes the separate levels of 64, of Sunshine, of Galaxy, of Galaxy 2. Which Galaxy 2 I haven't played, by the way. Yeah. We should play that shit because I need to actually play I didn't that play one. Galaxy 2 either. Oh, that would be fun then because yeah, it, yeah. it would be blind for both of us. I'd be down. Yeah, I'd but be we'd down. have to play Galaxy 1 first. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah. I have that on Switch, though, if it, if it would make it easier. Um, I have, like, the collection of the three on no, Switch. It, it, I could do it on here. Okay. I was it well, just for the motion controls is what I'm referring I, to. I got a, I got a Wiimote thing. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh, I can bring my Wiimotes then. A little, Wiimote, little Wiimote emulator thingy. That's cool. I yeah. never could figure out how to set that up. And also, I don't have enough patience for it's it. It's just a sensor bar. It's like a third-party sensor bar thing by... Uh, by Wave, what do they call it? Not Wavebird. What's the company that makes the GameCube controller? I, I think it's Wavebird. Is it Wavebird? Yeah, it's. Uh, then maybe it's just Wavebird. And uh, yeah, they do, they do like a uh, sensor bar thingy that you can do for emulation. That's pretty awesome. It's pretty sick. I like that. Would highly recommend. It was cheap too. It was like ten dollars. Oh, nice. Yo. Okay. Oh, yeah, cutscene. Oh yeah. Hey, now you play as Patrick, right? Uh, no, no. You just go back to SpongeBob. Oh, I was unaware. Dude, you should have been able to play as Squidward in this you, game. I know he doesn't you, have much that he can do, but I'm sure they can. this last time. Fuck Squidward. I'm sure they can. I love Squidward. He's my favorite character. Are you being real? Yeah, he's my favorite SpongeBob character. Whack. I love Squidward. Whack, whack, whack. That's the sound he made. He's out. Um, I'm evading him masterfully. Right, which you doing awesome? Turn? Which turn? Oh, fuck. All right, all right, now we're good. Uh, I don't think you hit it. You got to be closer. He didn't listen Come to Come on, folks. bro. And I can do he, it. he wasted it. Or oh, did I? Oh, he did not shit the bed. I'm fucking nasty. I've never shit in my whole life. You've never shit in your whole life? Mm -mm. Oh, yeah. Hopefully it lands towards you. Makes it easy. I doubt it, though. Nah, he's always gonna go to the fucking side on yeah. me. Is it but RNG gets... or is it like uh no, it's pre programmed. It's probably pre programmed from where he starts spinning, but I didn't pay attention to where he starts and like where he No, ends I would up. say it's pre programmed from uh like every from time player you fight character him, model. He... Maybe. Where it's gonna say it's gonna say you're here, so there's a range of where he can land where the player can realistically get to in a set amount of time. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Because they wouldn't make it where his, like, his front's facing you, but his back is all the way back there because the player's never going to be able to get there. Yeah, so he's going to be facing, like, fucking... He'll be facing... I have to go over this way, and then I can hit him. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. And that's, like, I would say that's the furthest of your range. Yeah, probably. No. Oh, my God. I could do it. What? No. Bro, motherfucker. I'm sorry, I'm tilting. Yeah. Come on, man. Yeah. He might have just landed right outside of your range. I don't think you can hit him. Fuck. Wow, dude. <sighs> sorry, Patrick. That's insanity. I couldn't kill you, bro. I'm sorry. Damn. I can't believe that. I'm standing over here so that he fucking he lands on the out elsewhere thing? or something. I don't know. So no, do it. it. Yeah, he won't. I mean, he'll... he'll I think if you, you might have moved too early. No, you're good. Wow, nice job. Guess what? Yeah, bet you didn't think I could do that. I don't. I mean, I didn't. Mm-hmm. I didn't. You're absolutely right. I doubted you. This boss fight is scary, by the way. Like it it's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of terrifying. The themes in this game were not designed for a children's game. Yeah, no. Like there's some, you know, imagery. The mechan yeah. If you see the concept art for this game, it's like pretty nightmarish. Like it, really, they, they. I feel like they were trying to scare kids, Loki. That's awesome. Um, so I have the sponge bubble now. Yeah, yeah. You want to try to finish up a few spatulas and then let's let's see what we can do. Nice gamers. Let's see what we can do. Oh yeah. So awesome. Wait, let's look at this Mystery Theater 5000 and see what you need to unlock 40,000. So you don't even need spatulas. You just need 40,000. Yeah. Think. I'm not. We're never getting that. Uh, I'm not doing that. It's, that's what you say right now. That's what I say for life, brother. Check oh. this out. Oh, wait. Did it wrong? Huh. Bet you didn't know I can do this. I don't know what you're trying to do. You can store the bubble for later. You can store the... <laughs> store it for later. 
Interesting. The Wusty Web. The Wust. Uh, I'll save that sand level for you, by the way. I'll say I'll save thanks, it for you. Thanks, man. That means a lot, man. I got you. I like the I like the sponge level. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The, the sand level. I got you, bro. I think if you break everything in the Krusty Krab, you get a sock. By the way. That checks out. You need to break like every single thing. Are we just gonna be like 3D RP or 3D uh, 3D platforming boys? Probably. Is there any 3D platforming games you've heard of uh, but haven't played and want to play? Uh, a Hat in Time. Oh, really? You haven't played a Hat in Time? Uh, Blinks the Time Sweeper. Fuck, dude. There's no way that you want to play Blinks the Time Sweeper. What the um, fuck is that? What? So it's one of the early 2000s Xbox 3D um 3D platformers. Is that the one with the cat? Yeah. Blinks, Blinks. the cat, right? Blinks, yeah. Uh, any of the Banjo Kazooie games haven't touched those. Okay. Any of the Spyro games haven't touched those. Really? Any of the Crash uh, I'll, games I'll haven't touched you, those. I'll show you Spyro Three, bro. I, I, I love Spyro. I know Three. you're it's a big Spyro guy. Spyro Three, one of my faves. Um, there's um a Hat in Time. Did I say that? Yes, you did. That was the first thing you said. Fuck. Um. Sorry. No, it's fine. Cool. There's another thing, dude. Spyro Crash. There's another play, like three D three D platformer that I wanted to. You ever try. play Billy Hatcher? No, I haven't. I don't know Billy Hatcher. You ever I, play uh, Ape Escape? No. You ever play, uh... You gotta name all the weird ones. Uh... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what else. Any of the, uh... Oh, DK64 we should do. That's I a good you, one. That's I gonna know. be a long-ass series. That's a long it. game, bro. But I'll do it. I did a 24-hour stream years ago where... I well, played all the all the DK games. I that, did Country one through three and sixty four, and I almost beat sixty four. That wasn't years ago. That was years ago. How many years? It was in twenty nineteen. Fuck off. Yeah. No, I call horse shit on that. There's no way it was twenty nineteen. It dude. was. Because remember, I was still in college. No, you must have done another twenty four hour thing recent. Oh, Spider Man. I did a Spider Man twenty four hour. There we go. That was the, that was the recent one. I can't. I don't think the. the I'm not calling you a liar, but it's, something about that don't seem right. It's true, sir. Is it still on your uh, your Twitch? It's still on my Twitch. You can go to my Twitch. It'll say, what, four years ago? I'm looking now. And you're about to be like, oh, holy shit. I'm looking That's now. That's what you'll say. Oh, holy fuck. Maybe I will say that. <laughs> can um, you say it like like that? Like, just really exaggerated like that? Oh, holy, 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 oh, holy, holy crap, Lois. Oh, shit. Um, I wish the Twitch app was easier to use. Holy shit, this shit, this this sucks. Mm. I'm not sure. Am I going crazy? There, there is definitely like you you destroy all the thingies in here and you get a, a sock. You're crazy, bro. I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm not crazy. You ever see a uh, Better Call Saul? Uh, I haven't actually. Oh, never mind. Um, it is not up on your Twitch anymore. So therefore, it is. It's in highlights. Go to highlights. Uh, I'm on Page. home. Bitch. Three years ago, Monkey Games. That was 2020. Nope. That was 2020. Nope. Yeah, if it was three years ago. Well, guess what? It I'll wasn't go back exactly your... four years ago, so it, it will say three years ago. But it was 2019. It was exactly four years ago. No, it wasn't. I'm going to go on your Twitter. It actually was around October or November. Maybe it was only three years ago then. You're misremembering. It was 2019, it man. I... <laughs> Let me lock. I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. Um, well, have fun losing it because I'm gonna gain 24 hour. Where the fuck? Look up 24 hour from you. Um, the 22nd, which was the star, uh, 2022, which was Spider Man. Okay, and then 2019, which was Monkey Games. The predecessor to Monkey Mode on on the John Hub channel. Check it out now. That's just me. That's just me plugging my shit, dude. I'm going insane right now. There's, there's a, there's a spatula up here or a sock up here. I know there is. Boom, Saturday, February 29th, 2020. No shot. Yup. That's not true. It, it is. Hmm. It is, brother. But I don't believe it. You don't gotta believe me. No, you might be right, actually. Yeah, I think you're right. Damn. You were then... thinking about doing a, a second one for the LEGO Star Wars games. This was uh, for New Year's 
going into 2021, but you did not do it. Okay. Your first 24 hour though Cute. was Monkey Games. Okay. Well, you, you it go. was between Chow Garden and Monkey Games, and I'm upset you didn't do Chow Garden. That what Chow are you Garden doing? I, dude, I, there's something I need to break in here. To I get think the, you're bugging. There's a sock. There's a sock. You I want know me to look it is. up? You want me to look it up? Yeah, look up the sock. And, All right, and you'll never be crab. satisfied. And, Crusty, you will never be satisfied. I will never be satisfied. Satisfied. Why do I write satisfied. like I'm running out of time? Um, Eliza. Sock in <laughs> Eliza. Crusty Crab. Here we go. Crusty Crab. Can you um open up the the menu screen? You need to break everything in the Crusty Crab. I. That's yes. Including. Included. Hold on. Like, there's one thing I haven't broken, presumably. I'm working on it. I did it. Oh, there we go. I had to hit the condiments table. <sighs> Dude, okay. Something ridiculous, of A course. Silly. Something so, like, minute and ridiculous. <laughs> it's just fucking impossible to find. Rusty Cray, yeah, 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 yeah. What's about Sponge Robert? Sponge know, that's Robert. his name if you think about it. Is it? Yeah. Well, I've seen so. the speedrun so many times, I don't know how to do this the right way. Is there like a Dude. little spring bob somewhere? For what? For the, the, the golden underpants up there? Well, you gotta get on top of the chum bucket. You gotta get on top of, uh... Her. You're gonna make me like look it up or some shit. Hold nah, on. nah, nah. I, I would never make you do that. Hold on. Uh, I think you have to go inside of the chum bucket. Nope. There it is. You're a genius. You know that. Check this out. Nope. <laughs> Hold on. Show us again. Nope. Didn't work. One more time. One more time. Okay. Third, third time's the charm. It hit one button. Hold on. Hold on. You got this. You got this. It hit one button. Dude, nice job. First try. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> See, what I was trying to do, you can't even comprehend. So that's kind of what happened there. You don't even know what I was going for, really. Oh, I saw. Yeah. Oh, okay. I, you were trying to use the, the I splash both damage. Buttons. I was trying to use the splash damage. Hit both buttons. You got me. Yeah. You think you're slick. Motherfucker, I am slick. Why didn't... Motherfucker, I am slick. Why not? Why what? Nothing, nothing. I was being dumb. Ignore what, me. What, bitch? I'm going to the chum bucket right now. Like, I don't think you can. I think you got to have like 60, 69 bitch, spatulas. I'm in it right now, baby. You need 75. 75. To, Yeesh. And the TV falls. And they say, bitch, get out of here. But here's what you don't know about. I think you can wall bounce. Yep. I was trying to go for the speed run strat. Yeah, so. it didn't work. <laughs> well, I got him. I got him, guys. Well, I tried my darndest, though. You gotta be honest. You gotta be... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess you did. We got all of them in Bikini Bottom. But we actually have, like... We have Patrick oh, and we have Oh, now Mr. we gotta do, do Downtown Bikini Bottom. We don't oh, have 3,000 do... shiny objects. We can't buy them all right now. <sighs> this motherfucker needs so much to We be might happy. as well just save them until we're done the levels. Yeah, but we have to spend them every fucking level anyway. <sighs> exactly. There's no sense in it. It's silly, bro. Come back with the cruise bubble. I'm back with the cruise bubble. You okay. got this. You got this. First try, you think? Um, yeah, I would hope. Uh, you have to fire it the other way. Wait, it just canceled. Yeah, you have to fire it the other way. Nope. I could do it. He thinks he's slick. I could he do swears it. to God he's slick. I could do it. Bro. Did I do it? No. I did it. You didn't. Why is the splash damage not enough? <laughs> it's just not gonna work, bro. I could do it. You've been um. I'm the splash damage king. You've been playing the the League of Legends recently. Nice. Now you still have to go all the way around, but oh no, you don't. No, you don't. My oh bad, yeah. My bad. my bad. My bad. I lied. Okay, I lied. I have not been playing the League of Legends. No. Interesting. And I played why a. Not? I played a game or two. I. No, fuck that game. Fuck that game. I don't like League of Legends. I played for over a decade. Uh, I have such a love-hate thing with League of Legends at this time in my life. Have you um, uh, touched CSGO 2 at this point? I saw some friends playing it, and it looked pretty good, I guess. Um, that is all. 
That's your take? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, fair. it's all right. Yeah, I, I don't. I mean, I'm not. I wasn't a huge CS:GO fan, so you're not a big competitive shooter. Like I'm that. not. I'm not a big shooter guy. Like mm -hmm. in general, I hear that. What does this motherfucker like? You can find out on the John Hub channel. I do reviews. By the time I put this up, I really, will, you'll have your first one out. I'll have my first one out. I'm holding you to it. What's yeah. the first review on? I can't. I can't say. Why? The the fans can't know. It's gonna be out by the time they watch it, anyways. Oh, I guess it will be out. Um, <laughs> hopefully, I'm deciding to be honest. Oh, okay. I might do it on. Uh, Baba's you. I might do it on this new Spider-Man game or the first one. New Spider-Man would be good. I might do it on uh, Yakuza Like a Dragon, one of my favorite games. That would be good to start it before Yakuza Gaiden and Yakuza um, Infinite Wealth. Yeah. Dude, Infinite Wealth is going to... I think it's going to make me cry. I really do. Really? I think it will. I think there's a chance. It, uh, it, 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 I, have a, I have a certain fondness for that game. Uh, for Yakuza? And it's in Hawaii, too, which is... Uh, uh, a notable location, and uh, I'll tell I'll tell the story another day. I'll just I'll clickbait with that. Do okay. You, do you know my Hawaii story? Yeah, I know I know your Hawaii you know, story. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll I'll clickbait here, and then I was tempted then, to be like no because I genuinely couldn't remember, but yeah, then I remembered. Yeah, yeah. But so. uh, no, no, for for another day, and then and then I'll never tell it, and then someone will go like, "What's with that Hawaii story?" And then I'll go, "Oh, oh. They, they'll be like, y'all remember Hawaii? Oh, here, oh, that that's a story, all right, is what I'll say." That's a game where you should stream. You should stream the your Yakuza games. I think, yeah, I think so too. If if you're up and running by then, like if you really want to, I, don't I think really like I think streaming. there's a level of pressure to streaming. Yeah, that I, don't I really I don't, don't like. I don't love streaming. Yes, he's playing it right. Fuck sneaking. Yeah, I don't sneak through that shit. I just do the jumpy jump. Oh, but I can't do the jumpy jumps there. You can. I, I couldn't do it. There oh, you couldn't. The, the platform was moving. My bad. Well, you can, like I'm going to, but... This level's too dark. I don't like it. It's... I mean, that's just the tone. Yeah, it is rock bottom. I just don't like how dark... I just The dark levels in this game, I can't fucking see anything. Like, I think this is a really well-designed level as well. I think frank. so, too. Especially inside the museum. I like the, I like the museum Oh, section. that's a good part. That's a good part. What? You have to hit him with the cruise bubble, dude. Nope. This motherfucker is. You could insane. also just sneak through and then. He can't knock this away. No, he can't. He doesn't know that we got the next upgrade already. Uh huh. You like that combo right there? Yeah, like that, that was slick, bro. That was mm -hmm. slick. I'm sure there's some shit over here. Oh. He's gonna. Oh, they he... thought about everything. Yeah, I think you can do that. I'm sure you can, but I. I can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> Sandy, 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 Sandra. Um, Sandy's the best playable character in this game. Oh, for sure, a thousand percent. So that, that's not a hot take, right? No, not at all. This lassos are cool. Her lasso is cool. She's got hella mobility. Mobility. Uh, she's got. I don't know what you're trying to do. And she's cute. Where do I go? Left. Left. See that arrow? Like this way left. See the arrow pointing you in the direction? There. That that way. There, right there. <sighs> you, you see the arrow? Frankly, my dear, I daren't. What, One Piece reference? No. Frank. What? Who? Fra Frankie, my dear, you know? No. That's Whatever. not what I said. Is that was Frankie? close. <clears throat> Whatever. Yeah, I quit the show. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> One of my buddies um, from work is watching it, and uh, he's he's light One Piece spoilers. No, no, I meant I quit this show uh, from that joke. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I didn't mean it. I was joking. Uh-huh. I feel like I'm attacked for my humor, you know? <laughs> like, I feel like it's just so highbrow that not a lot of people can get it. I don't it, understand and it, so attacked I, for I it. fear you because of it. And I, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're exactly like that one SpongeBob enemy I would fuck with mm -hmm. the glasses and the umbrella hat. You're scared of me. Yes, precisely. I'm glad someone. I'm glad one of us can admit it. I bet you didn't think I was capable of that, though, right? Yeah, I didn't. I'm gonna keep it, keep it a buck. Yeah. There ain't no way he's capable of this either. I am. I could do anything I set my mind to. Actually, my mom told me so. So. <laughs> really? Yeah. Mm. I, I got a, I got a secret to tell you. Mm. She might have lied. She would never. So. 
Really? She would never? She ne no, never. Never, The ever. key to this is despite the time limit, you have to take your time. Or you could just do that. You can walk most of it. Whatever, man. See, before <laughs> we were playing the Dragon Ball game, we were, we were singing a song. This time we're not even singing a fucking song. Yeah, there's no song. There's no song really like like that's worth singing in this level. In this game. It's just very... That's just too... It's too complex. Like, some of the songs are just too complex to sing. They're too... Com I mean, I thought you took voice lessons, dude. You should be... You should be the I can goat. sing. I'm worried about your ability oh, to keep up with me. you're watching out for me. Yeah, yeah, I'm watching oh, out for you. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Uh, yeah, you're that's holding really, me that's back. That's really nice of you, dude. Yeah, 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 you're holding me back. And okay, I just I wanted to let you know. I think we need to word it like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Uh, I'm joking. I'm just joking. All right. Where's this... Uh, where's this Sandy? Where's this right Sandy there. at? I think you've, you've kind of... Uh, well, I don't know. Why don't I? Maybe this level is really small. It is not. I definitely missed a lot of good stuff. Okay, I was gonna say. I feel like you missed a lot. Oh my god! No. He definitely did not trigger the fucking buttons, dude. I missed a couple of things. All right. Yeah, but that's the last one. I swear. Is it? I swear it. Well, I guess we'll find out. I guess we will. You're doing awesome for what it's worth, buddy. Hey, man. Thanks. Appreciate it. I I believe in you, and I think you're awesome. Smiley Aww. face. Aww, All right, you don't have bitch. to twerk the twerk the camera like that. Jesus. Because I want to see. I need to see. There's things in this life I want to see. Well, just because you you do doesn't mean you know the game wants you to. Damn. You're not gonna be able to get up. Well, guess what, bitch? I found a way. I found a way. <laughs> All right, we just got copyright there, struck. Is there? <laughs> what the fuck is Drake gonna do? It's Drake. Drake Bell. Oh, okay, true. Uh, I mean, that's not his name, but pop off. I Drake Campagna. Yeah, is that his new last name? That is. Uh, oh, what oh the my fuck? god. That's cool. Is he still in jail? He, I don't think he ever properly went to jail. Maybe he did for a little bit, but I think he, he was on got, trial. No, I thought he was on yeah, trial. Yeah, he I got he got like community service off of that. And really? Then I, think, I think he, yeah, he didn't get. Uh, uh, I I saw. I just remember the video of him, his court hearing. It was like done over Zoom, so it was like public. Yeah. And someone put like the Drake and Josh laugh track over it. I did see and that. I thought that was. I thought that was just wonderful. That was funny as fuck. What? Dude, that's embarrassing. That's awesome though. For the game, it's embarrassing. You're pretty awesome at what you do, you know. Thanks, man. Yeah, man. See, I just improvise. I just, I just make shit work. You know, that's just what I do. So, oh, you actually just reminded me of something. Mm. I got a question for you. Sure. <laughs> this is like an old. This is one of my one of my limited social experiences, and and so I I don't know if I'm in the right or the wrong. Okay. okay. Bastard. What do you rank that on like a scale of like cuss words? Oh, um, like like from like. I think it's so goofy that like it's it's just fine to say like no no if you call someone a bastard like only like a sixty year old man will get mad at you and I don't think anyone will take it seriously. All right, thanks for being based. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Is that based? Uh, yeah, for sure. Is it really bad? Uh, I was at um I went to a, a school event when at university, and uh, they were hosting an improv event for one of my classes mm. um, because it pertains to the career that I'm in. And so, while they're doing this, I, I ask a question. I use the term bastard mm -hmm. in, a, in a comedic sense. I was like, you know, how do you deal with, you know, someone that's like a bastard, essentially? Right. And the, the improv crew that was hired by the school was like, whoa, can we can we not use language like that? Like, <laughs> And I'm like, I feel like it definitely was not that inappropriate of yeah, a word. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I could have been like... <laughs> Like, not to, you know, take a bit from I think you should leave, but yeah. I could have been like, you know, what a, what if I said, like, you know, how do you feel about that one fucker? You yeah, know, yeah, just, yeah. You know, and like, I I don't know. I just felt like they were being uh, a little ridiculous, <laughs> frankly. Whatever. Yeah, I don't think Bastard is that bad. I, I can kind of get their point of view or whatever. Yeah. But I still think that it's not that bad. You, you make me feel valid and seen. Yeah, no problem, man. 
I just, I just, you know, I just, I just calls it like I sees it. You it's know? like I'm not even using the language to be comedic. It's just how I naturally speak. Yeah. The words just come flowing out, you mm-hmm. know. Um, and so people don't like that because it makes them feel uncomfortable for whatever reason. What if one of these fuckers? <laughs> I love that fucking bit. Dude, that oh. bit is great. No, I can't. I can't sneak. Sandy, don't sneak. Sandy, don't sneak for real. Hashtag have- Sandy. Yo, we should sell a shirt that says Sandy, don't sneak on it. We should say we should sell a shirt that says Remember Red. <laughs> Yo, word, word, word. <laughs> get your red t. It's just if I got a red t-shirt, nothing else on it. <laughs> well, no, it have black text on the back. Remember Red. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, it has to have some sort of connection Remember to our red, brand. This is him now. This is <laughs> a Heinz ketchup bottle. <laughs> I don't understand the connection. I don't know. It's all right. It works. Because the yellows, right, in the... Watch our Dragon Ball Z sagas play through. If you the know mustards? Remember, the, yeah, the, we called the... we call, You called them yellows, and I called them mustards. Because they were yellows, bro. And yeah, I yeah, don't yeah. know why you called them mustards. Because it looks like a bottle of mustard, but if we... Like, I don't know. I, don't I, know. I feel like you're trying to do this path, by the way, in, like, the most speed-runny way possible. I, what do you mean? I'm just built for speed, bro. I don't know <laughs> what to tell you. You're, like, not taking the intended path at all. What's the intended path? I'm pretty sure it's different than what you're doing. I am not trolling. Really? I swear to you, I'm like, not Like, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to go up past that, that one rail. No. Also, I'm half sure you're not supposed to play a Sandy in this part. What do you mean? How am I supposed to get you, to do you, places? Do you play a Sandy in this part? Uh, yes. Okay. I'll, I'll buy it. Cause how how the fuck is SpongeBob supposed to get up like up top here? Like there's like high up areas. That's true. The SpongeBob. Well, is there's just... parts where he he's supposed to be sneaking though. Yeah, that's true. But uh, fuck him. I don't know. What do you want me to say? I don't. <laughs> you know what? You got me there. Ooh, dude. Fuck this game. Those guys are game, crazy, dude. bro. Those fucking enemies are annoying as shit. I think I'm actually going like the right way, in my opinion. Okay. Go whatever way you feel you feel safe with, buddy. Mm-hmm. Thank you, thank you. See, you validate me too, if even if it's sarcastically. No, I was being genuine. <laughs> Very well. There we go. You see it? I that was not the way that I was referencing when Fuck, I said you man. see it. You what? know that that wasn't the right way too. Which, like over here? Yeah. Oh, yeah, fuck, that, man! That far one. Oh. Sorry, do you want to hand it to a better player? No, no, oh. there is not one in the room, so... Oh, okay. Ooh, I'll keep that in mind. Got myself into some hot water with that one. Ooh. I'll keep that in mind when we're playing Hollow Knight, and you go, why Please. the fuck can't I beat Hornet? <laughs> what if I pop off, though? What would you do then? I would be happy for you. I would, I would genuinely is be very... Is there a button over there? No. Uh-huh. The ops are trying to prevent me from... Who's the ops? Me? You. Um, you're probably right. And I'm, I'm a squirrel. I'm kind of an op. I'm kind of an op. No, no, no. You're you're a friend. You're you're not you're a good friend. Fuck. Dude. All right. A damn close one. All right. I'm not doing this the way that God intended. Okay. I'll, I'll admit that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, button right over there to your left. Other left. Don't need it. Okay. Check this out. I wanted to. I wanted to flex on the. I want to flex on him real quick. Give me a second. Check this out. <laughs> He's definitely not doing this the way the fucking devs intended. <clears throat> Alright, well, not doing it that way. I I just know in the speed run you see. <laughs> they do it like that somehow. Somehow. I don't know. For how. someone that has way more hours in this game than we do. <laughs> yeah. There we there go. We the go. fucking lasers are finally off, man. God damn, I could finally breathe. All right. <laughs> you got this. Feeling good. Do you think they Couple. got a lot of mileage out of Sandy being from Texas? Do you think they got Yes, enough? dude. Yes. Funniest joke of fucking all time is because she's from Texas. I'm from Texas. <laughs> Look at me. I'm Texas. I'm so stupid. <laughs> Do you Patrick, think... Patrick, what am I? Yeah. Uh, stupid? Yeah. <laughs> I'm Texas. It's basically the same mm. thing. 
<laughs> What's the difference? Ge There's Genius the fucking writing, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that was good. Um, yeah, I think they got a hella mileage out of it. I Plus, she's so. like an astronaut. That's like a good reference to the NASA site being in uh, uh, Houston, Texas, I believe. Is that is that the whole is that the thing? Well, she's an astronaut, yeah. but she's underwater. I don't know why they made her like a they made her like a scientist in like later uh, seasons and stuff. Well, she's an astronaut. Astronauts have to be scientists as well. You can't just be a regular old jabroni and hop on a like a like a rocket ship, you know. But she's squirrel. She is squirrel, Thoughts. but but like <laughs> I don't know. I don't think they retcon anything by making her a scientist. Yeah, I don't think so either. There there is the one where. Uh, uh, SpongeBob and Patrick like steal her rocket or whatever. I feel yeah, like she's, dude, that's a good a, episode. I feel like she's a woman of science. She's definitely smart. She's you know? a STEM. Like she's a she's she's definitely a woman in STEM. She's dude. yeah, she's woman in STEM coded. Not even coded, bro. That's just her. She's coded. legit. You look up popular women scientists. I guarantee you, Sandy, Sandy Cheeks, Cheeks is the top third. 10. Third result. Okay, that's kind of sad though. If that's true, they probably is, and it sad is sad if true. You know how many fucking high schoolers in their bio or chem class probably wrote, like, essays on, like, women scientists and chose Chandy Sandy Cheeks? Uh, I don't think many did that. Nah, bro. I, dude, you'd be surprised. What do you, uh, well, hold on. Hold on a second. Remember when I just had a, a, a memory just now, okay? Memory okay. just came up. Remember when we were in the Mermalayer? I was like, there's fucking four socks here. And you were like... Rock bottom probably doesn't have a lot of socks. Yeah, how many socks does it have? Would you believe me if I said nine? That's not that many. That's like probably the second or third most amount in a level. Look at the previous levels. There was like 11 in the one. Okay. All right, let's see. 11, 9, 14. Oh, 14. Okay, 14. Damn, where the fuck are they? My, my, yeah, see? I mean, it's not really... I, it's... It, I yeah, that's not that. That's not that. I, I didn't. I didn't own you. I didn't like nothing yeah, you happened didn't school there, me, bro. No, yeah, nothing fucking happened. We I'm had sorry. a uh, we had a net 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 zero in that. that yeah, exchange. yeah, that was just ass. That was just that was just friends attacking friends, and it wasn't cool. And I'm fucking sorry, okay. I'm, I'm fucking sorry too. Fuck. Is there something over there? Yeah, I think there is. <laughs> or maybe it's just a shortcut for you to do it faster. It's definitely Perhaps. one of the two. But that's why I thought it was it was a sandy type. Oh, it is just a shortcut. Just a shiny. No, it's just a shiny, which makes it worse. Don't need it. Don't need a shiny in my life. I already have you, enough shining stars. And you already got me, moments. baby. You yeah, already got I, me. I already have enough people that lighten up my life. I don't need a, Aww, a shiny object. Stop. I have a, I have a shiny blushing, star of a human I'm being. I'm blushing. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Mm -hmm. Fuck, dude. Stop. Fuck. 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 I got you, bro. I'll stop. Thanks, baby. Yeah. He's I'm gonna not try jumping. to do some fancy trick. Yeah. He did it. Yeah. And he got nothing out of it. I fucking hate that motherfucker. Die. Die. <laughs> he didn't think I'd get him. He didn't think I'd come back for him. He, he thought he would just get away scot-free. There's got to be a... Oh, okay. There's got to be an art piece up there. I couldn't agree more. All right. No, I was referring to something else. I was thinking that there had to be a way, like, to teleport back to the, the slide. No need. I feel like... What do I need the slide for? I don't know. I feel like you might be missing something, to be honest. Wow. And here I thought... Right there. SpongeBob's right down there. Isn't that the other way? SpongeBob, SpongeBob. Where the fuck am I going? I hear what you're saying, but I'm not really picking any of it up. Oh. See? Yeah, you gotta talk to Gary as Spongebob. Fuck. Look, there's even a spatula up there. Do you think Spongebob's gonna get that one? Yeah, for sure. Because he's gonna be like, hi, Gary, and Gary's gonna be like, meow, and he's gonna be like, what do you mean someone's stuck at the bottom of a well? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I missed what he said. Nice. He just said get the damn spatula up there. That's all he said. Basically. And then I need Sandy again. Swap him back. I think Sandy's just better suited for the job. Hand is gonna attack you, bro. How much of shit just fell? Yeah, because you're supposed to play a SpongeBob here. Nope. Nar. Nar. Untrue. You might be right. Yeah, invisible wall got you. 
Oof. Uh, embarrassing. You said it, not me. Return the museum's art across the trench of darkness. How in tarnation do you get there? That might that's the one for me. That yeah. This is an arduous level. Is that crazy to say? No, no, you'd be right. This what do I need the long. ball for, man? You need to stomp there there's a button next to you that you stomp and then you roll up and you have to race. You know who would be better at racing though? Sandy. Sandy Sandy J Cheeks. You right. You right. Sandy M Cheeks might be might be the way to go, but where's this button at? It's right next to the ball. So, yep. Oh, hello. I didn't actually. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I could walk over there. I think. Oh. You sh no, you're too far. Oh, yep. he clipped through yep. it. Yep. That was clean. Yep. Bitch. Oh yeah. Nice, dude. You're awesome. Thank you, man. Appreciate you. There's a there's a spatula here where you need to like talk to Plankton as Sandy, right? Um, I don't know actually. Am I going fucking bananas? What did that do? This is a hook, for sure. Boom. Okay. Not a doubt in my noggin. Then looks like I need Punch Bob for this one. Punch Bob, Punch Bob. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Smatrix, Smatrix. Couldn't have said it better myself. Yeah. Squid. Where the fuck? Where? Sock. Is, is it just the sock? Um, it looks like there's something else down there. Nope. Sparklies. That's it. I w just for a sock? Yeah, dude. These socks are legit. Motherfucker. Maybe it did something else elsewhere or something. I don't know. It, no, bro. Just for a sock? Two thousand dollars down the drain? Two thousand dollars. <laughs> but we have enough for another. Uh, another uh, spatula from Patrick. See those lasers there? Yes. Shut down the fucking lasers, bro. Hmm. I think there's multiple lasers, right? If you oh. could get all three, go for it. How do you get the? How do you turn off the lasers? You just go up there and you hit a button. Very well. If I'm remembering correctly. Very well. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure three let is me, the magic let me, number. Let me get the spatula. It'll be quick. I'll be I'll be three quick as fuck. It's magic number. I was just talking about Schoolhouse Rock, bro. What's your favorite Schoolhouse Rock song? Is that Schoolhouse Rock? That three is a magic number, yeah. Oh, I was singing the Spider-Man No Way Home end credit theme song. Is it, did it, is it three is a magic number? Yes. Really? Yeah. No Way Home? Yes. No, yeah. Yeah, No Way Home. I'm pretty sure that's a Schoolhouse Rock song. Oh, well. They might, they might use it for multiple things. They might. Namely that. And Schoolhouse Rock. Um, yeah, I'm pretty good with the end credit theme songs because I work at the movies, so. Okay. As, as a little bit you of lore. You make the movies. I definitely do not make them shit. Damn, but. what was your favorite movie you made? Um, Scream 5. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Um, I played Jack Quaid in that movie. You got to scream in that one? Yeah, five times. Would you meet Jack Quaid if he wanted to hang out with you? 1,000%. He yeah, seems he, like a cool-ass dude to have a beer with. He seems like a cool-ass dude. He seems like he would be on a Let's Play also. He seems super fucking humble. yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, he seems, like, like super down-to-earth, super humble, super cool. He seems like he would be on a Let's Play, like, if he was a fan of us. Yeah, yeah. And we were like, Jack Quaid, come on out. He would be like, hey, guys, I'm Jack Quaid. I came on out. We'd go, hi, Jack Quaid. And he would go, hi, guys. And I got the and I got the Mrs. Puff, bro. Holy That's a good fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you scream? <laughs> Before I came over, I started the Spider-Man 1 Heist DLC okay. with uh, Black Cat. Is that the first DLC or is it the last it, one? It is the first one. Okay. I think the last one was with that jank-ass villain like, that's a part of the Silver Sable crew. Yes, yes, yes. I saw Twitter like bitching and moaning about that guy. Wait, I already did all this. Yeah, you finished it, I believe. Where do you go from here? Do you remember? Uh, Plankton's got a um, spatula for you if you haven't grabbed it. I believe I grabbed it at the end of the last step. We're in a different session, guys. But yeah. I believe I, I grabbed it at the... Fuck. Yeah. Um, there should be a way for you to go... Oh, the, There's got to be a way inwards, I thought, right? Yeah, I thought there was like you were straight well, this way. Well, there's a sock down there anyways. Yeah, yeah I, do, I do see the sock. So <laughs> let's do that. And then... Oh, what the fuck is this? Boom. Is that it? Exit. It says exit. Yeah, but it's going to get you that spatula. Oh my fucking god. See? Wait, how do I get over We're there? We're geniuses, though? dude. I have no idea. 
Um, sorry, you were playing. You were playing Spider Man. Oh uh, yeah. No, I'm excited for Spider Man too. Um, it's a good ass game. Oh. Uh, hopefully. Oh, there we go. You see it. I see it. I see it. Um, <gasps> I know you're really excited for it. Have you seen the review scores? I'm not um, sure if you pay attention to shit like that. To be fair. Yeah, I do pay attention to shit like that. I, I think that there's a little bit to be, uh, you know, gained from just reading an arbitrary number. <laughs> to be honest, like I, I don't think it's that arbitrary, but I sometimes I'm like I read the IGN score and I'm like, what the fuck? Didn't they give it like an eight? They gave it an eight, which I, I mean, frankly, is in line with my expectations for the title. Really? Like, I think we talked about it a little bit in the last session. I think you're going the wrong way. Nope. Oh, nope. You're right. Nope, my bad. You, nope. My bad. My bad. It's all good. Um, nope. It's all right. It's yeah, all they good. gave it an eight, but like they <clears> described <throat> it as a lot more of like the same shit with like. You know, a lackluster open world or whatever, and it's like it's it's a fucking Spider-Man game where you can fast travel to any point on the map. I don't like the open yeah. world serves as a method for traversal. It's not designed to be, you know, super fleshed out or entertaining. How in is and of the, itself. the how the fuck is the open world lack? It's New York City. I think it's just because <laughs> it's 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 exactly it's New York City, but like, what is there to do in the open world? between activities and like we don't know because the game's not out right but that's where my like you know how many pigeons can you chase and how many bad guy construction sites can you can you can you beat yeah it's a little formulaic but i think it's the traversal that really shines above everything no, else. And I, I feel like we said this the last like this isn't our first conversation this on not. this we're on this let's play about this we're we're big spider-man fans I'd we're say. big men we're big men we <laughs> What what are you doing? <laughs> I'm grabbing fucking nothing. I don't know. You okay. gotta sneak, dude. I can't. You can, Sandy can't sneak, bro. Are you kidding me? She, she, you I got mean, big ass squirrel feet. She can't sneak. Big ass squirrel feet. <laughs> that's, <laughs> and that's the truth. And any fans of the show would know that I'm spitting the truth. Yeah, that Sandy has big ass squirrel. That's going on one of our merch shirts. <laughs> big <Bye>. ass squirrel. <laughs> and it's just a picture of her fucking Lego shoe that she has. Does Sandy have a Lego show? I just mean these big fucking block fucking oh, shoes okay. that she's got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I thought there were like fucking Lego versions of like Sandy's Jordans or some shit like that. No, you're that good, would you're go good. hard. That would go pretty hard if they just had big fucking gray silver pieces of shit that you could wear on your feet. Two hundred dollar Sandy shoes. Yeah. Um, Mrs. Puff. You got to be SpongeBob. Oh my god. Also, you bro. need to. There's like five more spatulas. Where the? Oh wait, how did I miss those? I don't. I have no idea. What did I miss? You kind of skipped over the. You went really fast on this level. To Fuck, be fair, bro. Yeah, I really do feel like I just. I just jumped on some terrain on the side and did not complete the I, the um objectives in the intended no, way. No, you did not. Like at there all. was there was the. <laughs> but I still got like all but two spatulas. Which yeah, you did really. Honestly, good. he kind of ate with that. He did. Um. <laughs> What is this task? I, I don't know. They're in the middle of, like, they're laid out. Um, All right. They're probably around the museum. The God damn it. They're laid out, like, in order. Okay. So, so they're, they're before the museum. I go to the museum. I just fucking step out of it. I say, fuck it. Yeah, basically. Wait, does he have a spatula for me? Um, No. Doesn't okay. seem like it. I thought maybe he did. I think this is the entrance and not the exit, but. um, It should be. IDK. Yeah. Yeah. I think um, Barnacle Boy's at the beginning, so. Yeah. Barnacle man. Barnacle fucking man. Oh, the slide. You have to do the slide to your left. I don't think you've done that. Oh, that's a that's an objective? Um, I don't know. I'm assuming. Okay. This is... Okay. Let me just... Uh, maybe Sandra. Oh, I think you yeah. have to use SpongeBob for the slide, though. Um, No, she's she's able to slide. It's a big part of the snow level. You play as, like, every character. You play as no, every I'm... single character in that level. No, you don't play as Patrick. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you do. I'm I will sure bet you, you $300 man. that you don't play as Patrick. I'd, I don't have $300 to bet. Well, it's gone anyway, so. Okay. Well, I mean, I think you... I'm going to look it up. No, I'm not. <laughs> We're going to play this We're going to play this session. session. We're going to finish this game. And honest, I'm doing it again. I'm fucking doing yeah. it again. I'm just trying to jump on the side of the terrain and, like, skip ahead. Hello, Mr. Speedrunner. You don't even know. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> it reminds me of our first session for this game. Yeah, where I'm just fucking jumping on the side of shit and, like, going slower than I need to be going. Or you when uh, you were trying to do that uh, that fucking, like, bowling puzzle. Mm -hmm. in, um, and I was just fucking lair. throwing that shit at the damn... No, you were jumping in and you were fucking pausing and unpausing a bunch. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Well, yeah. I had to. I remember. Oh, there's a spatula. Okay, how the fuck do I get to it? Um, There's a bouncer behind you. Behind you? Behind you? Oh, behind me. Yeah. Hello. Thanks. And now you... I mean, you might be able to... They really wanted me to out. not do it, but I think I could still cheese it. Yeah. I know you run out of steam on the fucking... 
I oh. think I can do it. I think I can. Yeah, you gotta. You can do it. I think I can cheese the fuck out of it and get it done. Oh fuck. Oh wait, no, no, okay. There's a, there's a guy right here. There we go. Yeah, no, you're definitely supposed to be able to do it. No, no, it shoots you backwards. Oh. See that? How are you supposed to get up there though? Uh, like this. There's a little ledge up there. Oh, maybe you have to jump up there from the uh fucking. You think I could slide. just stand on this? No. You also uh, land in the middle of that. Yeah, you probably go. You know what? I bet the way they want you to no do is way. going up fucking backwards up the slide. I just need to get to the start of this slide. I don't know how to fucking start it. There's, I, it's got to be around. Right? I don't know how to get to the start of the damn slide other than fucking doing this shit. Then, then not following the directions of the game. Yeah. Yeah. Can we agree not to do kelp forest? By the way, I really don't want to do fucking kelp forest. That's fine. All right. Good. Yeah. See, you definitely do have to do this slide. Yeah, but the I have to be SpongeBob, bro, I swear. Yeah, you do. And then, oh, it's a timer, right? Doesn't Mr. Krabs go, you have to slide down the slide in... Let's see. In a minute 20, me boy. <laughs> that's the that's the shitty Clancy Brown. 40 minutes. You have 40 minutes to... <laughs> 40 minutes, my bad. <laughs> Arr, gar, 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 gar. <laughs> ah, gar, 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 gar. You um, have, that's like the shitty Clancy Brown version. I find that I can do decent impressions of, like... That what was the fuck am I doing? Dude. I find that I can do decent. <laughs> come on, man. I find that I can do decent impressions of like uh, really exaggerated shit. Like I can't do. Like I was doing my fucking Lin Manuel Miranda impression before. Ooh, can I hear that? I thought I was doing it. Yeah, uh, the the last time we recorded. Uh, we were at Gula, go to the go to the Gula Goon episode to check that out. All right, let me quickly pull it up. I was just. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, thanks, thanks. All right, what'd you think? <laughs> Dude, that was really good. Yeah, thanks, bro. <laughs> Oh, I forget what I was doing. I was I was fucking saying oh, some shit. Eliza, Eliza, <laughs> Eliza. Yeah. Can we just acknowledge? I know we we're all over the place so far, but yeah. I feel like it's going well. In any event, mm -hmm. uh, can we acknowledge that he made a fucking musical and just cast himself as a lead because he wanted to? I don't think that's what ha he keeps trying. I don't know if it's a revisionist history thing. I don't know if it's the truth, but he he did say that. The person who was supposed to play Hamilton had to drop out at the last second. And horse he was, shit, dude. And he was quite literally the only one who knew all of his lines. Legit horse shit. I call, I call, un, why, number one, if that was true, why would they not hire an understudy like a traditional, like a traditional... I don't know. I really don't know. Like, I don't believe it. Also, he goes out of his way to try and cast himself and stuff. You know, oh, fuck is he did the music for Encanto, oh, right? And so he tried yes. to cast himself as fucking Bruno. He did? Yeah, dude. It's like a big thing. He has got like a whole audition <laughs> tape where he sings the song, like, you know, Bruno's yeah, song, yeah, yeah. And, and it's 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 not that great. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I love you, Lin Manuel Miranda, but, you know. But what's wrong with that, though? As casting yourself as lead? Yeah. I think there just needs to be, like, I think it becomes a little presumptuous to cast yourself as not only the lead actor, but you're also already the director and the writer of a production. Like, I feel like at that point, you either are very egotistical or you are going to spread yourself too thin as a creator well have you seen abbott elementary well keena brunson directed that or wrote it or yeah she created it, the show the and she's like the lead in that show yeah but she didn't i mean she doesn't do all the writing for that show to my knowledge i mean she's probably like a pretty pretty integral in the writer's room pretty yeah i don't believe i mean i don't i don't disagree but also she is from philadelphia I think, I think, like, I th well, Lynn is Alexander Hamilton, so. No, he is. <laughs> you know what? You got me. So, you got yeah. me. How the fuck are you supposed to get any of these? Is this a sock or is this? Yeah, it is a sock. Dude, I need to look this up. Hold on. Oh. Now I need to look up who writes Al Abbott Elementary. Um, go watch Abbott Elementary. That is a great show. I really, that, I really do enjoy that as, show a lot. As it is really good. I've I've watched it with a lot of friends who who generally don't like uh you know sitcoms and stuff like that. I would consider that a sitcom. It is a sitcom, yes. Um, but they fucking love that show. I think it's a really smart show. I think that they talk about a lot of modern stuff, which can be like to a show's detriment if you know they. Same with like our fucking let's play, where if we talk about the Spider Man game and this this you know episode's coming out in fucking November. Yeah, it's gonna like, be late. It's gonna yeah, like it's it's before it comes out right now. Like it's it's you know less than a week before Spider Man comes out right now. We're all hyped for it, but what if uh, you know? I mean, this is probably gonna come out in December, and people are gonna be like, yeah, that shit was great. And yeah. Then That'll be it. And then in February, we'll be like, oh, yeah, so the Game Awards are coming up. And mm. uh, people will be like, uh, that already came out, guys. Here's what we can do. If we talk about something more 
modern, more relevant. Oh, oh my god, dude, dude clean. please give me the speedrunner of the year You're award for that fucking clean, shit. Bro. What is the spatula called so I know how to uh, avoid it? No, no, so I know how to, like, what you're actually supposed to do. You know what do. you should do? You should teleport to it. Go back, go back one more. What is it? One Plundering more? in. Oh, yeah, it's swing, swing along spatula. So oh, you know what? It was the fucking oh swingy God. things. You had to hit all the buttons in. And you just did not do and that. And I just didn't do that at all. Respect, and I kind of cheesed the system. I kind of. Uh, I kind of broke into the matrix and cheated. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got it, bro. You got it. <laughs> yeah, I'm absolutely right. Thank yeah, you. Thank you. That was nice. Um, you I'm know, not picking up all the socks. Fuck it. No, that's fine. We have to do the, the snow, the snowboarding level, but I can. Yeah, I no, I'm giving. Uh, listen, do. don't think I'm trying to rob you of the fucking snowboarding. Level. <sighs> I have to I, double check. You got bro. nervous for a second. Grew, you were I, like, <sighs> he better not just do this entire level. And I, I can't yell at him because we're on a let's play. I'm exactly. going to look unprofessional. I'll yeah, have yeah. to send you 15 discord messages after <laughs> about how it's not working. Or during, and I look over at my phone, I'm like, who the fuck is blowing me up right now? And it's just Addison, like, motherfucker, stop! <laughs> Give me stop! the sand level! <laughs> Give me mine, mine! I'm just like quiet, staring at the screen yeah. for like 20 minutes. You're like having a conversation with me at the same time. I'm not even noticing that you're texting <laughs> and you're somehow eloquently talking shit to me into like behind my back. Exactly. Or in messages. All right. What is the next level? Is this the last one for the, it's the sand um, one? It's the last one in this in the zone. Wow. Okay. But I do, I do want to. If we need extra spatulas, sure, we'll do kelp forest. But otherwise, I don't want to do. Kelp we forest. shouldn't. We yeah, should be I, able. To, oh. You got to do flying Dutchman though. I told you I fucking hate that level. I'll do that fucking level. Maybe I do a couple in kelp forest, a couple in flying Dutchman. Yeah. Because you need eighty spatulas. Isn't there a hundred in the I game? I thought it was seventy-five. I didn't think it was eighty. I forget. We were at the plank. We just door. looked. It was like maybe it was like. It's, you, it's you, either seventy-five or eighty. Yeah, it's one of the two. I'll, um, I'll bet my bottom dollar on that. Um, sorry, I'm like actually reading this. That tomorrow. He's like, all right, get this, get, go down the slope. All right, cool. Um, there is a fucking bungee cord to my left. This level more than anything else. I, see, you, you try to do the thing that I do. Yeah, I, I, tried, to, I tried to speed run like like this, Mr. John T. Hub. But. No, but that's what I was saying. This this level <laughs> is just T stand for Tron. Uh, <laughs> John Tron Hubberton. <laughs> no, I, I feel like the T is just the best like. Like a letter to go in between your name, you know? Right. What the fuck is Gary doing there? Oh, uh, whoops. Are you I trying to cruise boost? Are you trying to cruise boost? Cruise boost? No, what is that? That's is that the... Wait, 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 wait. You could jump... Oh, no, you have to be sandy. You can jump on top of that little fucking missile yeah, thing yeah, and then yeah. get on the thingy. I don't know how else you're actually supposed to do it, to be honest. Let's go to... Oh, you need so much fucking bread, Dude, you bro. Need, yeah, that's why there's like a whole right? enemy you spawner need more? in here. Um, you need... 4,500 okay. total, which is fine because there's a lot of And then you need the fucking hook. Bro, this is just a spend, but we're at the fucking shopping this is, mall right this now. This is literally a spend money thing. This is so arbitrary, bro. Isn't it the best? I hate to say it, game devs, but y'all gotta, y'all gotta fucking stop this shit. Bro, this is from fucking 2005. <laughs> yeah. With these fucking microtransactions. These microtransactions? We, got, we can't even beat the level. Yeah, donate $20 to unlock the SpongeBob Lithith. Li li what's her name? Lithith? L who? Lilith. Lilith? That bitch from uh, Diablo 4. Uh, that young lady, you mean? Yeah, I'm sorry. The woman <laughs> from Diablo 4. <laughs> Lil oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, did you play Diablo 4? I did not. I'm not a a, a looter, like, sort yeah, of... Yeah, lo uh, looter, grinder. There's a button. There's a button. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Oh, wait. Right. Isn't it the Sandy Texas thingies? Yeah, so we could get that, that spatula. Whoever made these, like, little Texas guys kind of ate. With they that, did kind of eat. To be honest. I hope they got a great modeling job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, just the idea alone was, like, kind of golden. It doesn't even have to look... Like, if they fucked up the shape of it and it, like, kind of only barely resembled Texas, I'd still be like, that's... You're a genius. Yeah. No, it's really smart. All right, come on, Gary. Meow. Jesus, fuck, dude. It doesn't make sense to me that it have to be sandy for Gary to have the fucking dialogue options is all... Oh, my God. Yeah, I'm kind of nice with what it. What the fuck? Bestie? Oh, kind man. of fucking crap. There's a lot it. of like stupid fucking spatulas in this level. Yeah, bro. There's the one where you have to destroy all the snowmen, right? Oh my god. That one's yeah, annoying. Yeah, just reminded me. Yeah, I, th I, I thought you loved this level. I do love this level. It's just like I forget. I Again, I haven't played this game this year. Mm -hmm. So this is my excuse to play it and have it on my playlist. Fair enough. Are we going to play this game every single year, you think? Yes, for sure. All right. I mean, at least I will. If it became like <laughs> a... It, honestly, if it became like a... A yearly playthrough? Yeah, like a tradition on the channel, that would be dope. 
I think say, like, that uh, we have to play run. like we have to play like the the rehydrated version or something next year if we, if we play it again. You know, what we should do. We should play Cosmic Shake. I'd be down. Neither of us. I have haven't. Played I, yeah, I haven't played it. I saw somebody play it. I've heard good things. Uh, yeah, no, I did. I did too. And yeah, eventually we will have to play the rehydrated version, so everyone just hears me bitch and moan, and then you can yeah, do all the cool speed running shit the you could fuck do. Is SpongeBob Square? Like you'll be you'll be doing shit like that. Yeah, all the time. Yeah. You have to be PunchBob. Doesn't every course have a time trial, right? Yeah, it's a time trial and then typically a mini objective. Yeah. So, like, you mentioned the snowman. I think one is, like, kill all the enemies. Um, or maybe it's, like, a time trial. Oh, you gotta fucking move it. Okay, no, it didn't I start until it, you... They give you all the time in the world if you gotta stretch out. If you gotta yeah. do whatever you need to do. You gotta warm up, you know? Mm. I feel that. Let's see how nice I am with it. Yeah, yeah. There's like 600 fucking socks in this level, too. Yeah, dude. This might be most most socks in the whole world. Most socks in the whole world challenge. Mm -hmm. Try mm. not to come. Try not to come challenge <laughs> SpongeBob's <laughs> sand level. Yeah, yeah. I'm kind of nice with Is it. Is that? I wish you could title YouTube videos anything you want so <laughs> we can call it Try Not to Come 18 Plus. Uh, fuck, fuck, sponge, fuck. Sponge Throb Challenge. Sponge Throb Challenge. Dude, we should upload this on <laughs> sponge fucking... Sponge Throb, Sponge Throb. Oh, yeah. oh so well, I think you got a checkpoint, right? Or does it not it matter? Doesn't, I, I think the time doesn't carry over. Mm. All right. Well, <laughs> womp womp. All right. Where the fuck is Sam Mountain? Beat Mrs. Puff's time. Um, Mrs. Puff skated this in a yeah, minute 21? that's like the thing. She's like fast as fuck. Does she know she's that bitch? Is she... <laughs> I think she does know <laughs> she's that bitch. <laughs> Were you the one telling me about the theory where she's like a fucking yes, felon? Yes, yes, I did. There's iconography everywhere where she's... Can I pretend that you didn't and be like, did you hear that Mrs. Puff is actually a felon? <laughs> no, like that one podcast that you told me about? Yeah, yeah, I was telling you about this one. That might have been on the first recording also. Oh, I, I there's was so watching many things we gotta bring back. So much, so much good shit. You know what else was? So this is a, an in-joke in, in the whole series where I think... So I'm... I like to be player one in games. I was player two a lot in games when I was a youngin, because uh, I'm I'm the younger brother. Um, Addison's younger than me, so it's true. By all accounts, he should be player. Motherfuck! I did it again. <laughs> same fucking time, same place. <laughs> by all accounts, he should be player two in every game. But in theory, we played one game where I was player one. But I think I think the tradition's got to be I'm player two. But. I gotta work my way up to player one. Yeah, that's like sort of, I mean, your name is second, right? So that's the lore behind our channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is, uh, you know, it's unfortunate as a as a player one -er for, I'm sorry, a player two -er who just wants to be player one. Right. I think I gotta be, exactly, like you're you're the, you, you would humbly accept both positions. You would be fine being player one or player two. It's true. Me, however, I'm like, I need to be player one, but I'm, I'm never player one. I, um, well, I grew up and I, I mean, I guess I had two older stepbrothers, but, mm -hmm. um, shout out, but, um, you know, I, they, when, whenever we played collaborative games, there was really no player one or player two attached. Like we always played like Halo and shit. Y'all were players two, three, and four. Yeah, exactly. No one like, got the top left fucking part of the screen. Like there was no actual like competition over oh, it. Oh, there was no... No, I mean, I think no matter what, it's like assumed roles, right? Like, I mean, obviously my brother's going to be fucking player one. No, actually, I, I think it was important to me that I was like, I want to be fucking player one, you know? I don't, I mean, I don't blame you. That's just yeah. mad important when you're young. It's also like, um, yes. the oldest, the oldest gets to sit in the fucking front seat of the car. Like when, we're, when you're driving to places oh, or whatever. Oh, dude, that was a big fight for our family. That, exactly. That, that's, that's the equivalent. That's like the, the normal non-gamer equivalent to that shit. I wonder, dude, there's some, some like weird families that didn't have that growing up, which is really interesting. Where no about. one sat in the front? No, where people sat in the front, but like, they like, the, like the, and they yeah, were civil yeah, about it. Exactly. Like that's the, insane to me. We, we beefed. Like yeah, there was yeah. mad, like I would, like my younger stepbrother would like cry and shit. If he, because mm -hmm. he's only six months my younger, yeah. So my mom, who's my my biological mother, would be like, "Well, Addison's six months older, so he gets you know all the benefits." Mm -hmm. Um, whereas my younger stepbrother Ethan, again, six months my younger. Like I guess in retrospect, it's fucked up, but whatever. Right. Um, you know, she would just be like, "He go fuck himself." Like he's <laughs> he's six months younger. Like you know, there will be times when Addison's not in the car, and you could sit in the front then. You know what was the fucking banger to say? Because because. When my brother moved out and it was just me and my sister, I was sitting in the front. There we go. I would hit her with the, you could sit in the front when you're older. There we go. <laughs> that shit was fucking turn. heat, bro. That shit was fucking heat. That you're a bully, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, was, that was just like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm an asshole. Yeah, yeah. Um, 
No, that was that was fucking. I was I was like you know, because I went through it and then I was like, nope, nope. Now I can be mean and yeah. I abused, I abused the power. That's really what you have to do though. Yeah, yeah. It's just you, part of being a sibling. You gotta fight. Yeah, you gotta fight for that power and then when you finally get it, you gotta abuse it. That's kind of how it works. Um, honestly, yeah, it's kind. Of, it's a really fucked up by dynamic. Yeah, it's interesting it out loud, but doesn't one of these um. One of these areas have like a snowman that you just destroy it, and then a fucking sock spawns. It's like before the the yeah, I think so. It's 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 either two or three. It's that early two thousands game like game development cycle. Well, how do you mean? Do random bullshit, get reward that's imperative yeah. for hundred percent of it's the game. It's the fucking blue coins from uh, from, from Super Sunshine. Mario Sunshine, which we I, talked about. I hate about. those, bro. I really do hate those. Um, I think Mario sixty four had a way better just the stars, bro. The stars, eight red coins. That's yeah. all we needed. That's all we needed in there life. There were a few random, like, arbitrary stars inside of 64, though. Yeah, like, yeah, talking the to the stars. random toad or... Mm -hmm. Not even the secret ones. Like, I mean, I guess, like, the one, like, peach. Those are considered the, secret stars, the, the ones that aren't tied to a level. Mm, the peach um, window. The peach window that gives you two stars. That one's kind of sick, too. Yeah, that This one has the snowman. Yeah, yeah, yeah kill there that shit. Is. Bop. Bop, bop. Oh, no, one no. One out of eight. Never mind. This isn't the one. Well, I think I have to... Yeah, there's, there's, all the there's, there's on th this here. is the yeah, this is the secondary objective for another Jesus spatula. Christ, I wouldn't go out of my way to try to kill all those snowmen right now. I'm gonna do it. I don't I'm think gonna you, do it. Can and you you're get gonna all be eight in one go? I'm sure you can. I feel like the game is designed for that. To be honest with you, okay. It's de oh, you're designed to get all the snowmen that they put. Yeah, in I think so. Okay. Like, I don't think this game. As a 3D platformer, wants the player to go back and replay the levels too, too much. Right. It's pretty, like, cut and dry about what you need to do a lot of the time. And, and does typically means, like, on one go-ahead, if you do it right, you don't have to repeat. Can now, I tell a very gross and unrelated story about this, <laughs> this specific level and this specific game? Oh, Jesus, yeah. And I think in our first recording, I was like, I want to tell a story, and then I kind of bitched out of telling the story. Okay, so now you have to. Well, I'm finally ready to tell it now because the thing that happened, it happened the most on this level, and I remember it. Like, okay. For a fact. So, oh, fuck. When this game came out, uh, when this game came out, 2004, 2003? Um, 2003, because it was one of the first games I got on my original Xbox. And I was two and a half when that came out. So, yeah, I was, I was five when this game came out. And I peed my pants a lot, and I peed the bed a lot when I was growing up. Um, probably until I was like seven or eight. Okay. That's kind of a late, you know, late bloomer or whatever you that's, call it. That's fine. I feel like there are people that pee the bed until like 14. So, I'm like, I'm, I'm chilling. I, I got that. I got like that median age, maybe. I don't fucking know. Anyway, uh, no, no disrespect. Uh, peeing is cool. Um, peeing is cool, factually. <laughs> I love to piss. Um, anyway, uh, I remember that I was really trying to beat one of these missions. Probably this one right here where you have to get the eight snowmen. Yeah, it's hard. Um, and I literally like, I, Fuck, it was, I didn't even like sleep piss. I literally just pissed myself because respect. I was like, I need to beat this mission first. Honestly, and, uh, it's respect. So that's what that's why, you know, on this very day we deem this fucking level piss your pants mountain. Dude, by the way, mm -hmm. barely fucking no. Oh my oh god! Oh my god! I was dead bro. silent for you. I was I was getting ready for for like fucking funeral processions, but then I was already also getting ready to just be like congratulations. I, I I had both ready. Dude, that was scary. That was actually the scariest moment of my life. Probably. I had like a get well soon card for you uh, that I crossed out, and um, I just crossed out like the get and the soon. Return to the store. So it's just, it's just like well, like like good job, just well, <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, you know, in case you did well, I would, I would be like, okay, well. It's like a shitty whiteout job, too. Like, it doesn't even... <laughs> yeah, you could tell that it just says get well soon. <laughs> oh, man. So, but but it's you, you got the well card. You didn't get the get well soon card. So, anyways, Piss Your Pants Mountain. Piss Your Pants Mountain. Um, I think it's the third mountain, actually. It's not it's not this one because I remember going inside of that one. Oh, yeah, where the, the third snowball, mountain like, like, the, opens up. Yeah, the, there's like the, the, yeah, yeah, there's like the cave that has the big fucking spiral slope or whatever. Yep. Um, yeah, so it was, it was that mountain I was on where I, I, I pissed my pants at like age six, probably. Nice, dude. And then the one time, so the the, the first time I ever did laundry. <laughs> okay. I was five or six years old. Really? That's young for laundry. Well, it's because if I peed the bed, I wasn't allowed to game. <laughs> <laughs> Your parents punished you that way, Yeah, huh? yeah, yeah. I had, okay. I had uh, conditions like that. If I peed my pants or if I peed the bed, I wasn't allowed to game or whatever. Pavlov's pisser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that, that inspired me to fucking do the laundry. And okay. then they were like, you know what? You know, he's he cooked. He cooked. So they said that when I was like six. They said he could he can piss himself because yeah. he's doing his own damn laundry. Yeah, you know what? He kinda he kinda cooked with that. He's allowed, but don't let that happen again. 
Okay. And then I don't remember pissing like my, the bed ever again after that. So I think you just have to grow up and then you don't piss the bed anymore. Honestly, you deal with wet sheets once and you're mm-hmm. good. I um I did not piss the bed for that long. Um, though I don't remember when I stopped pissing the bed. To be frank, yeah. it just I think it just you know faced out of my life. And um, when was the last time you pissed the bed, dude? I have no fucking idea. I have I genuinely I don't think I've pissed the bed. In, I I mean in years. Okay. Like l- literal years. Well, yeah. I mean, like as a child, like because you could have been like drunk and like pissed the bed. No, when I I don't think I've ever I throw up a lot and shit myself a lot when I'm drunk, but I okay. never piss myself. Okay. Like and I don't throw you up shit a yourself. lot. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't really shit myself. It's more like oh, I say to myself like oh, I've got a shit, mm. but then I'm so drunk that I go to like get up from shitting, but the world is spinning, so I throw up at the same exact time. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a really so fucking bad combo. So it's the threat of shitting that makes you throw up. Yeah. So you don't actually. Okay. I wouldn't say I wouldn't call it the threat of shitting. I mm-hmm. would just call it the the impending doom of of having shat. The fact that I have to get up after <laughs> shitting and it's just like you know, and then you have to like wipe and shit, and it's just at that point like my head's on the fucking shower, right? And I'm I'm you know I'm basically like done. I'm done okay. for the night. There's been that actually hasn't happened in a few months, luckily, because mm-hmm. I I kind of said to myself this shit needs to stop. Yeah, yeah. I still drink a lot, but I don't I don't get that drunk anymore. Okay. Oh, I don't yeah. drink that often. Like, I, I drink socially. Yeah. Um, I'm throwing a Halloween banger soon. I know. I'm still sad I can't go, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's okay. You're you're still loved. I know, I, I know. I understand. Y'all, y'all, y'all got plans. But, yeah. um, yeah, like, I'll, I'll be drinking during that and stuff. But, like, normally I don't really, I don't really, like, you know, get done with a long week and then just, like, crack open a beer or anything. That's not really my thing. Dude, I get done with a long day at work and I crack open a beer. <laughs> It's not even a fucking competition. I like it. Let me I'm, just say, it's the best feeling in the world. That and being on a really hot ass beach with a cold beer in your hand, mm-hmm. brother, that is fucking beautiful. Okay. Yeah. I just don't like beer that much. Like, I just don't like the taste or anything. That's fine. You'll grow up one day. There's a. <laughs> <laughs> you go from pissing your pants to not pissing your pants to then appreciating beer. And then pissing your pants. And then again. pissing your pants again. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm gonna go this way. Okay. Okay. Oh, he cooked. He cooked. I'm trying my best, dude. I think you're almost seconds. done. I don't. I don't. Th- I don't think there's much more of this course. I can't believe I fucked myself twice on the first course, and now I've done the other two, which are objectively harder. Mm-hmm. Um, just easy peasy. It's because you're prepared now. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely like it's the muscle memory's back. Because they're not like that oh, much harder. Oh, oh, speak of the oh, oh, fuck me, dude. Fuck. I was actually. I was actually really close. You kind too. of manifested that in a weird I way. I did. I fucking jinxed it, dude. You know what? I think you gotta. Wait, if you robots um be Larry's t- Wait, Wait, no, so, yeah, so what the, is the, the snowman is just a sock, it's brother. Just a, who fucking it might cares? be a golden underwear though, but I doubt it. I don't care. No, the golden underwear is only you have the max amount right now. You only get them from unlocking the new zone, and then That's it's usually insane. like on top of SpongeBob's house, or it's on top of Squidward's house. Sorry, and then the second one is on top of uh, what Shady Shoals. Oh, I might have fucked myself. Going and the third way. one's on top of the Chum Bucket. Oh, okay. So yeah. The, uh, then, yeah, it's definitely just socks, which is. Dumb. Yeah, that's kind of stupid. We're not doing that. Um, and then that's probably the one that because I remember watching the speed run. I get, I guess they get that snowman last or something, and then that's the fucking sock or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. I just remember them like like killing a snowman oh. and then a fucking sock drops or something. Gotcha. But I uh, mean, anyways, I, the, I think the, you need to be sandy too. Uh, yeah, I saw I saw like a little Texas sign. Mm-hmm. In fact, there's one in here. So yeah, yeah. And there's corner. a sock up there too. If you yeah, there is. It's next to one of them missile throwers, dude. Okay. So I, I'm gonna try a quick little speed run trick. Not actually a real speed run trick, but you're like, trying to jump down the mountain. I know you are. You're trying to go in that cave area, yeah, right? Yeah, dude. And well, you're there's, to jump down. There's two signs that point inwards to one another, and typically that tells the player like, "Hey, go this way." Like, look. Okay. Here, you see it straight ahead. Yeah. It should yeah, be yeah. popping up soon. The draw distance is garbage, right, right there. Right. Oh wait, he ate. Oh, dude, I did eat. What the okay, fuck? Okay. Okay. I'm kind of clean with it. I'm not Kinda even gonna nasty. lie. Wait, did you ever play the SpongeBob movie game? We talked about this. Uh, no, I haven't. <laughs> We're gonna be so bad. Honestly, about... dude, people are gonna be like, they've talked about the SpongeBob movie yeah, game five times, we... <laughs> once per episode. And like, I, that's I brought okay. it up at least three times. I, I don't know, bro. I have the worst fucking memory sometimes. Well, I mean, we also record these once. I mean, uh, look, peeling like back apart, the veil, yeah. we pull this. We record it a week apart. We don't keep track of what we talked about. Yeah. And frankly, I think the podcast structure of it helps. Though it probably wouldn't hurt to have like a like a Google Doc where we just have like some topics lists, you know? 
yeah, that'd be cool. Just kind of go, yeah, go down the line of like, here's what we're going to talk about during this session. or Because we recorded like an entire session. Fuck, 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 for, fuck, fuck. If you hold back on the controller, yeah, you go slower. Yeah, it slows down. Yeah. So you got you to gotta take your time. I think I'm also taking a poor path. I'm th I don't think I'm supposed to go down the middle path. You good, baby. Um, But uh, yeah, no, we should do that. I mean... I we'll we'll get more core. We're getting more and more coordinated every time because our first recording session. Oh my god! Um, yeah. We lost all the fucking audio because we like I, I just didn't. It was a weird software issue where like the the mics weren't. I literally ordered a new fuck. I told this story too. I literally <laughs> ordered a new fucking interface because I thought that the um, I thought that the like interface was fucked up and that's why the yeah. audio wasn't capturing. But it was just the the software that we use. Um, just acting up or whatever, which is really strange. I've never seen that happen. So I just reinstalled it. It started working. And uh, and here we are today. Yeah, that's really interesting. Which we could have, like... Uh, he doesn't think it's interesting at no, all. No, it is no, interesting. Okay, okay. <laughs> His ass is not interested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There, There's a lot of tension between us. No. <laughs> they uh, We hate each other. He was 10 minutes late for the recording session. I'm hey, pissed. man. I no, no, I'd never... I mean, get, I mean you're, you're literally... Gas, bro. Uh, Addison drives a fucking hour 15 to see me yeah about in traffic it's typically an yeah hour with 15. traffic to get like, home it's about an hour like basically no like at the start of rush hour too um yeah so i can never complain yeah but, he's, like, but he's, like but john also does everything so yeah like i set up the recording i i edit the show and stuff hello oh, fuck i mean i jumped out at the I think right place be, like right? through the signs do like, i have to like slow down when i do that I don't know. Yeah, because you're like, even the first time you kind of clipped into the fucking thing. Yeah. Oh, um, I've come up with a with a strategy, by the way, for fair compensation for this this channel we're doing. Okay. For when we make it big, you mean? Yeah, for when we make it big, specifically. Okay. When we sell out to Rooster Teeth. Okay. By the way, shout out Rooster Teeth. Um, love all their shit. Big um, fan, big fan of, of the... I only watch like the Minecraft stuff and like the Halo... You, you didn't accept the, the Larry Challenge. <sighs> Um, it's up to Lawrence. Uh, sorry, continue, and, and we can we can talk shop in front of the in front of the folks. Yeah, we can. Oh yeah. So here's the thing: when we make it big, mm -hmm. until we hire an editor and a person to, like handle our shit because you're doing everything, yep. the revenue split. I shit you not. And if you fucking argue with me about this, we're gonna have problems. Mm -hmm. Is gonna be 80-20. 75-25. No, 80-20. 70-30. 80-20. 80-20. Because you do everything. So until there's an editor, it will be 80-20. And then that from that point forward, if we get an editor, because at that point all we're doing is recording, If we get right? an editor, I take it out of my percentage. That's fine with me because you would probably do that out of the goodness of your heart anyways. Okay. But And then at that point, we split it to a 40-30-20 split. I don't know if editors deserve to make that much, but I feel like editors do no, a editors lot of work. No, editors deserve the fuck. Editors I know, do like they the do most. a lot of work. Editors but do like I would actually say the most. They they are typically good with like, hey, make sure you record this shit like this sometime. Mm -hmm. I, I want to just meet like a bunch of editors and stuff in general so that I can get better at editing. So like I can do my own shit. Because I, I don't, there's, there's going to be a long point of where I'm editing my own shit and I really have to get into the cycle of doing it. I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. I can edit a Let's Play, right? I can edit... Yeah. A basic review, which I'm, you know, I'll, I'll, I will have done one or two of them at this time. You know what? You're trying to follow oh, the fucking. I got it, dude. I yeah, got it. You're trying but to follow the fucking dick vein of the cave, but really, what you had to do was just follow your heart. You know? Yeah. Well, I think I'm trying to follow the signs, and the signs are play strong. Yeah, perhaps. It's like an eight year old made a fucking Mario Maker level, dude. <laughs> Wait, calm down. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> what did the devs do in 2003 <laughs> that upset you so much? THQ Nordic. THQ. Actually, I think this is Heavy Iron Studios. I could be wrong about that. There's like a. Fucking, I think it's both of them. There's a factory that plays at the beginning of the level, and the, yeah, yeah, yeah. or at the beginning of the game. No, take it slow. Take it slow. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. You gotta go it slow. Um. So uh, yeah, and I think that's gonna be a split because you inspired this, and so I want you to okay. get a larger cut no, for a lot I of it. I think it was both of us. It, I was, think a, it was both of us. But to go back to to the to the 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 story, right? The here's the here's the origin story of Addison and John. Slow down, slow down, <clears> down, and it's not down, much of a story. Down, I mean, slow down, slow down, slow down. Me, me, and Addison have always. I mean, we we just want to make content and stuff. We yeah. just want to make stuff on the internet. Fuck yeah, dude. Um, we have. I would say our goals are pretty aligned. You know. You got a checkpoint though, I so know, it's okay. I know. I'm not that beat up about it. Um, I'm sure it'll save your your Larry progress too. It does. It does. So yeah. So we you know we have we have similar aspirations on the Hello. internet, but I think our biggest problem is that we just don't don't get motivated. We don't get motivated, and we don't make stuff as much as we'd like to. Uh, we both kind of work full time jobs. We both. Um, 
don't know, we both have lives, we both have partners, we both have... We both just have things to do in our lives, and mm -hmm. I think me at least, I'm finally at a point where I have a pretty good like work-life balance. Like I was taking singing lessons for a while uh, while doing like um, my fucking content and stuff. Like that that was happening concurrently. Now I'm like seeing a therapist while I you know work on this thing and everything. Yeah. So like I'm I found a good work-life balance for me and everything. Um, but also I think you work more than I do We'd and work like a little bit it. harder. No. no. Um, no, you you do like. <laughs> I just work. I work more. I would say like yeah. more hours. Yeah, so it's, I like my it's real harder jobs. for you. And you're also earlier, kind of in your in your career. Now. Like I, I've yeah. I've been out of school for um, yes, dude. How long? Three years now. God, really? I graduated 2020. I'm really surprised about that. Got my bachelor's by. degree. So and you know what I realize? A lot of YouTubers just don't have like college degrees. Have you ever noticed that? Yeah, I mean, I feel like I've heard a few stories because I like watch Alpharad and shit like that. Like, yeah, it's yeah. one of the few people I still watch. Does he? I feel like he sent me, he mentioned he he and Joe, who he does like his side channel with, yeah. have bachelor's degrees. Yeah, I would like I wouldn't be yeah because I I know he's around our age, right? Um, he's a few years older than you. I want to say he's twenty eight. Okay. Okay. Um, but he's been doing this. I mean, he's been doing this for a while. Yeah, I used and to also, watch his like uh, edited like smash shit all the time. Oh, you got all the spatulas, right? I did get all the okay. spatulas. Um, and we don't need. I to don't know. Yeah, it's, there should just be like a quick like go back to bikini bottom thing. But like, go back to just go to like. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, I'll put you in the crusty crib. At the, wa the wusty web. At the wusty web. Um, no, like he's. I think he's only a few years older than you, and. Yeah, and I think he has a bachelor's, but like also getting bachelor's degrees, you want me take, to take a lot over? Of, yeah, take a lot of people out of content. A popular content creator around like my age went mm. to our school and uh, retired after he got his bachelor's degree. Mm -hmm. um, when so, I already got this bachelor at seventy five, by the way, you were right. Yeah. Um, do you know who I'm talking about? I do know who you're talking about, but so, yeah, I don't want to like it, no, 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 say I who it that. is. I, because, no, no, that's why yeah, I was general. Yeah. Um, but it's a pretty interesting thing. Mm. Um, from just a uh, from a culture perspective, I guess. Yeah, no, absolutely. I I think it's uh, I think it's pretty rad. I think I might need to um, do a lot of these levels. I might need to do no, the no. You gotta get the... you gotta get thirteen, and so that's an average of four per level. Yeah, you gotta get four on two levels and five on one level. Yes, but yes, with the sock, you could probably just do four on each level and then get a sock from Patrick. Well, here's what you got to know about me. I actually like the SpongeBob's Dream level. Whack. I think it's a pretty creative level. Whack. I do think that they threw it together because they needed another level. That's what I think. Like it, it's not derivative any, of anything, but I think it's really cool, and um, I just, I just, I just enjoy it. Well, why don't you just get all the levels in, or all the spatulas in here then, if you enjoy the level? That's what I was planning to do. Oh, okay, cool. Good plan. Good plan. Um, and in then I was event. gonna say fuck kelp forest. And <laughs> fuck kelp forest. In any event. Love content. Yeah. That, yeah. Oh, sorry. I'm, I'm not continuing the fucking story that we were telling. I, I feel like we, uh, we... Yeah, we jump around. We jump around a lot, but I think people might appreciate that all... What the fuck? You might appreciate that also. Yeah, like um, the, the ADHD folk that are watching. We'll, <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll throw up a little Subway Surfers in the bottom right yeah, we're, corner. Yeah, we're for you. And a Family Guy clip, too. <laughs> we're, we're, we're for you guys. Um, but, uh... No, so so yeah, so I, I I've, we've always have a had a had a penchant for content. I think that yeah, means that works properly. End games. We yeah. we love video games. We want to do something in the field. I just want to talk about video games on the internet in any capacity. Um, I really like people that dive into like analyzing like um, mechanics in video games and people that um, you know just just you know reviewers that go super in depth. I, mm -hmm. I love watching those fucking three hour video essays, even wow. though. Oof. Uh, yeah, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Um, love watching those three-hour video essays, even though um, I don't think I'd make anything that long. Um, yeah, that's a long time. I think that uh, some of those get a little fillery, too, but I, I just love having it on. I always want to make content that people can either put on in the background and, like, listen to it while they're, like, working on something. Yeah. Or something that, like, um, I don't know, just, just yeah, just, just something that's, like... Uh, you know, oh boy, the new fucking John video came out. The new Addison and John video came out or whatever. Like, you know, just just something for people to like look forward to when they, I don't know, get out of school or they get out of whatever. I, I, I feel like um, I had a lot of content growing up that, um, you know, was very, I don't know. I, I watched more like YouTube and stuff than I did uh, television, you know, yeah. back in the day. And no, it did So it, it, it's, it's nice. It was always nice to just have like a creator to go back to. You you do feel kind of that like parasocial sort of connection almost. Yeah, but like um, I mean I think that's 
kind of part of what what every creator does. Not to say that it's right, yeah. especially when it gets to a, a level. But um, I I did it. Oh, you did get it. Oh yeah. Um, uh, no, but but I, I I not not that I like a parasocial relationship, but I I like going in and then listening to you know content and being like, oh my my good friend, you know this person, my good friend, you know, not yeah. not not my actual friend, but you you know what I mean, like I. I just enjoy, uh, you know. I mean, for me, it's like I want people to look forward to my shit, no matter what I do. Yeah, and I like I've talked to you. Hopefully, I'm like a little bit more in in industry than you are. You know, like I want to mm -hmm. be a producer eventually and and project manager on games, right? Um, or at least just in marketing or something inside of the industry. Yeah. Um, but if I stay online, like that would be dope. Like again, like I know we we spur ideas and we're making this a lot for ourselves. Mm -hmm. But like if this shit popped off, like that would be dope because then we could have like actual. How do I say this? Like it would be, it would be cool to have a fan base that looked forward to our shit and was hopefully respectful to our privacy and, and personal desires. That's yeah, absolutely. It's the best way I'll describe, brother. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying my best. That's, okay, that's the best way I'll describe. Because I remember when I was in high school. Mm. Shout out to Uber Hacks or Nova and Immortal HD. Okay. Um, when I was in fucking high school, I would come home every day. And because people are smart with when they post shit, they would post shit at 3 p.m. EST. Yeah, man, that, that's, that that's what that's what I'm trying to put this shit up. Yeah, that be would honest. be the best time to post things because, you know, the Eastern like time kids get off of school yeah. and a lot of people get off of work or start getting off work. Yeah. And, and the, then the West Coast folks the, are like on lunch or whatever. They have you something know? to look they, forward to. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So every, every there's something for everyone. No, I, I totally agree. And I used to watch like like. You know, game grumps every time I came home from like high school and stuff, and that was very, that was important for me. You yeah. know, like I, I, I understand people that have like a connection to like a creator or anything. I don't have that that much anymore because I'm yeah. 25 or whatever. But <laughs> yeah, it would be cool if if I could provide that for somebody else. You know. Yeah, for me it was like cow chop, which was um. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I would like to say. I mean, I know you didn't watch them at all, but I would like to say that, that their attitude sort of inspired me doing this in a lot of ways because right. of the fun that they seemingly had um no i i just i just like to make things for people um and i like mm -hmm. to make uh i don't know i like to make people laugh you know that's that's kind of my goal yeah. at the end of the day yep it's uh it's a good life man yeah and we've been doing this i mean how long have we been doing this for a month at this point about a month at that's this point that's insane and, and none of us none of it has gone up we've done like what th this is our fourth recording session i want to say it's our third third or fourth because we did the we did the one that we did was the one and then that failed that didn't work we did we did the, the first one of this that was last time that was no that wasn't last time then we did sagas we did oh we did maybe it is our pro fifth, skater then. we maybe did this is our, like our fifth i think yeah, yeah i think it is it. i think it is wow um which is insane and awesome and i'm super happy about it yeah because... and, I, and i hope we can do this for longer oh, fuck years on. bro that was that yeah, I'd like that too. Bad. I'd like that to be like a routine. I hope no one, uh, no one moves away. I hope nothing bad happens. No, you know, I'm hope, not planning uh, to move away at least not for a while. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't have plans to either. I'm, I'm happy where I'm at. We are, uh, we're very lucky where we're at. Yeah, say that. Um, uh, yeah. No, I no, feel that though. It's a good time. But uh, no, I mean to to wrap up the the origin and everything. We we want to put something out that uh, people can enjoy. Like that's yeah. that's really like the 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 reason to be honest. Like there's there's definitely a part of like I would like to be a notable person on the internet. Yeah, but even when we but, were doing what yeah. we wanted to back like back when we did meet, it was just for like the social aspect and the fun aspect of putting out things that people enjoyed mm -hmm. and contributing to something bigger. Yeah. Like yeah, absolutely. We we had met at a uh, club, essentially. Yeah, and, yeah. We, uh, we met at a, a club in in university. In uh, university, and, and uh, so that's how we we. You should be able to teleport now back to Plankton, right? Just in um, case you get the shiny objects. So yes, I believe so. That's, that's why I talked to him because I thought that there's yeah. another spatula here too, right? It's on top of the acorn. Uh, yeah. It should you be the end of the course. The whole fucking this level kind of... I, this is my least favorite part of this entire... Um, See, I was going to say this is my favorite part. I really like the slidey bullshit. I just... it. I don't know. I feel like I fell off at like a random part or whatever. It's a little... I don't like parts of it. That's fair. Oh, check me out, baby. You're clean, bro. Check you're me clean. out. I think that's the way you're supposed to go, too. Um, this is the way to the acorn, baby. Uh, but yes, yes. The, the, sto the story of how we met. We, we met at a... Uh, at university at a club. Yeah, at a club. And... Yeah, it's just like been... a school club, not like the fucking no. 
No. You know? <laughs> yeah. <Not. laughs> I would hope no one thought that. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. we're fucking Melvins, but yeah. yeah. Melvins? Yeah. yeah, yeah. What fucking, the fuck does that mean? Fucking uh, 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 long, long, long eared geeks. I don't know. Long. <laughs> long eared geeks. <laughs> we're fucking long. I don't. What, what do you call it? Uh, snot nose, uh, uh, glasses having. I don't know what you're trying to say. I don't know. Well, loses. Yeah, we don't really party much. Um, but yeah, sorry. Continue. <laughs> you, uh, yeah. In any event, <laughs> I'm so. F- <laughs> so you just threw I've back stunned to me. you. Yeah, man. This shit's so thin. This shit's. I hate it. It's it's fun. <sighs> It's, it's America not, themed. It's not. Just tell me you're not a patriot, brother. It's Texas themed, baby. I'm getting like a fucking vertigo right now looking at this shit. Yeah, it's making me dizzy. <laughs> All right, go in, go in, go Who, in. What is this fucking fun house ass fucking? It's the stars, bro. Oh, okay. The uh, stars and stripes. Stars America. and stripes and dookie. Literal fucking dookie. Yeah. Well, that's part of America too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what uh, the fuck? Did you like stop me in my tracks? Yeah, this game is so weird. So yeah, there's some jank. Like they, they want you to go a certain way, so they will like fucking gravity will force you to go a certain way when you're on these fucking slides. It's really odd. Yeah. A um, checkpoint, a checkpoint. This shit's so long, bro. That's what I hate about it. There's a level like this in what the he nice, fucking dude. He fucking beamed fucking me with that sliced, shit. Dude. That motherfucker's a cannon for an arm, bro. I know, that was fuck? awesome. That was pretty awesome. There it is. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he's fucking insane. All right. Also, if you need to grind uh, like shiny things, you could always go back to uh, Sand Mountain. Is it Sand Mountain? I know there's a place in Goolagoon you can do it too. Yeah, I mean, Sand Mountain had that one had that one setup where I fucking bowling balled them and they gave me like 200 shiny objects. You know what I'll do instead? I won't get this this thing here. You're just gonna wait until later. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait until later. I'm gonna. Well, I'm not gonna like maybe yeah maybe I'll come back when um. I have enough shiny objects, but for now, oh, don't I don't need I need shiny objects to like everything in this map, though, right? Yeah, that's kind of the issue with like the later on levels is there's a lot of shiny objects required. This is such a until weird until you exit. do like Kelp Forest or Flying Dutchman, which both of those fucking levels suck bad. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of them. I think they're a really bad way. I mean, they're they're difficult levels or whatever, but uh, I think they're a really bad way to end the uh, end the levels in this game. I would agree. We've talked about it. Yeah, yeah. I would agree. <laughs> Oh my god. I fucking rock. Yeah, you do. Oh yeah. In and the party, and I just want to rock. If you rock, I roll. That's true, actually. <laughs> Go back to our Dragon Ball Z Sagas episode where we talk about rocking and rolling. Yeah, another shout out. Remember Which, Red? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> That's got to be an actual shirt that we do. It's it's too good. That would be a good shirt. It's too nonsensical, but it's too good. Um, did you, um... The squid <sighs> weird level. What do you think of the Squidward part? The Squidward part's good. I love the Squidward part. That's like a cool, oh. it's a cool part. I was going to bring up something and I can't even remember what it was. I'm upset now. Here's what you can do. Yep. No, no, that, no. Wow. You can, you can jump on the fucking like bottom and you start bouncing for some reason. It's really odd. Really? Yep. Wait, this put me back like right here? Yeah. That's actually cool. They, Did you they, fell off the ledge, you didn't like die. I thought falling off the ledge brings you back to the last checkpoint. No? Nah, bro. I, I think it does. I think you're bugging. But I think there's a checkpoint like every single thing that you do because they know this part is kind of hard. That There's a possibility. Squid weird. This, this level was definitely not looked upon fondly when I was a child. Yeah, I, I, I think that people actually don't like this part because they think it's like hard or whatever. But me, I'm the ultimate gamer, so I actually never make a mistake and I never really? die or fall. Really? You sure yeah. about that? Yep. Bet money on it. I won't, I won't die. Ah, ah, ah. Ah. <laughs> Look out! Don't scare yeah. me like that, oh, bro. Oh, me when I clip the fucking mic because I scream. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, You're team. Good. You're good. You're good. It actually doesn't fuck it up that bad most of the time. If you just barely clip it, it's it's not too bad. Okay. That's good. Hashtags in my game? Oh, my God. Hashtags. <laughs> Don't think that's what they're called, music guy. <laughs> Mr. Vocal Lessons over here calls them yeah. hashtags. Yeah. I'm, I just call it like I see it. Because I call it like I see it. With my glasses on. Hey. But most of y'all don't get the picture less the flash is on. Oh, speaking of, you know what's out now? What's that? Mega Man. Mega Man. I was January 7th. <laughs> yeah, Mega Man. I was never book smart. Ma- I'm I was really smart. smart. Makes me more, more intelligent. intelligent. Call me Mr. Rock Festival. I got I'm hella no bands. bands. Shorty Cute and her circle too. Tell her bring a friend. <laughs> okay. 
You know, that song is actually kind of good. And also, <laughs> I think it's like out now. Like, I think it's unironically out now. What the fuck? Where was it leading me to? You fucked up, dude. I did fuck up. I said I would, but I went pretty long you without fucking up. said he was never going to die, chat. I went pretty long. Sorry, chat. I went pretty long without fucking up, though. I'll be honest with you. Oh, yeah, you did well. But now, it's all, yeah, it's all, it's nothing row, but dude. down from here. Nothing but downhill. All right. Huh. I don't know like, if he saw it, but SpongeBob was like sucking his dick for like one frame. Hello. I don't know. Oh, it falls. Yep. <gasps> I was gonna say, by the way, thanks for the uh, coaster. I got you, bro. Well, yeah. I did it for me more than anything else. You got, well, you got your, yeah, your your water on my desk. Yeah, I got a big water cup on his desk. Water. You call it water or water? It's water. Okay. Water is like a a dialect of those that 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 live around us. And, yeah. Uh, it is not the correct enunciation. Yeah. And, like, I pronounce enough things wrong in my life as it stands. I don't need to pronounce more things wrong. True. Like, for the longest time, I used to call it, you know, um, the epitome. You know, water, I used to call it water. <laughs> you know, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> you know, uh, like, ep epitome. Spongebob laughing at me, too. Yeah, epitome. Yeah, yeah. That's what I would call it. That's what it is. Wait, what did I call it? Epitome. Oh, yeah, that's what I used to call it. Yeah, that's the wrong thing to call it. Well, that's, it looks right. It does. It's it lo it's spelled that way. It is spelled. It's spelled way. like epitome. I'm sorry. No, it's spelled like epitome. Wait, no, epitome. It's spelled like epitome. How, how the hell both, do you spell like epitome? Both ways say like sound wrong. You know. I don't give a fuck about the spikes, bro. I just go You're through. You're a beast, bro. I don't even fucking care. Doctor called me. They said I'm morbidly obese. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> That's my one of my favorite fucking jokes, dude. <laughs> oh, I know. Yeah. The cruise bubble. Is that nice. what they call it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Actually, I think they might call it the bubble missile. The bubble ball. Bubble missile missile. The ba ba ba. The ba ba ba. I don't like this part. Actually, you know what? Maybe I don't this like just a lot of parts of this. Dude. Maybe I don't like a lot of parts of this uh, level. No, you liked like one part. Yeah. Out of like five. I like the Patrick part. You know Patrick's house in this level? Yeah. I like that part. I don't know that part. I forget. Oh, you're going to see it and be like, hee hee. Yeah, I'm going to be like, oh, that makes a lot more sense now. All right, here's what the... F oh, my God. Is he okay? Dude, here's what you do. Cruise bubble from from where you're like, standing. I like, I don't know the cruise bubble from... <laughs> you hear the fucking... Yeah, you got splooged on, dude. <laughs> oh. That's why you can't splooge on him like that. Oh, wait a minute. You can go on that shit. Yeah, you can. You think I can do a little cheeky, like... Um, cheeky cruise bubble strat? Cheeky cruise bubble under the you thing. You probably can. Under the sea. It's probably what it's there for, to be okay. frank. Oh, what Wait, you die immediately. I'm just trying to rotate. I'm just trying to rotate oh, so bad, I can shoot bad, it from the bad. right. Yeah, yeah. I don't mean to be fucking up, but I am. No, no, you're fine. <laughs> Alright, yeah. I just gotta get like a little angle like that, you know? I was never book smart or money smart. Makes me more intelligent. We love we love Jay dude, if Jay Z went on the show, bro. Dude, that would be awesome. <laughs> rank your guests like rank your guests like characters for this uh this this playthrough. Um what do like you mean? This, this like this let's play channel. If we could have like oh, 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 guest, guest people guest. here, yeah, who would it be? I would actually love to have Ben Schwartz. Um, ben Schwartz would be awesome. I love I love Ben. Love me some Ben Schwartz. I've been following him for a while, like since before Parks and Rec. Okay. Um, I used to uh, watch a lot of College Humor. He was on College Humor a lot. Yeah. Um. Yeah. He's he rocks, bro. Okay. Anyone else? Um. Jack Black would be very cool. Yeah, I think we talked about this. Yeah, one, yeah, yeah. I can't believe it, dude. Fuck. You know I've met Ben Schwartz? You met him? I met him. He what? went to um, a college event at ah. the college I used to attend. Um, and I met him there, and I asked him some sort of improv -y, like, hypothetical question that he appreciated. Nice, dude. Um, and then that was really cool for me. That was, that was one of my, uh, I don't know, it was just a really good day. I went there with some friends, too. That's all. Awesome. Friends, it was it was it was just a vibe. Like, and it was it was a free admission thing. Like, it, they did they just let us meet fucking Ben Schwartz for free. It was very you very might sick. Die here. What? Yeah. Me? Yep. Never. Um. No, that's really cool. Yeah. I would go. I don't know. I might go like fucking. Who would be really cool to Who? fucking talk to? Who? Yeah, I think Jack Black, Ben Schwartz, and. Uh, I don't know who else. I'm. Uh, I'm gonna go Matt Mercer. Oh, I'm a Matt Mercer fan. Yeah, I feel like that would be, that would be cool for him to come in. We talked. I don't think we talked about this on the show, mm. um, but we talked about it after the show one night. How I was listening to Critical Role. 
Yes. And you brought up Dimension 20. Yes, bro. Um, I think my I'm, other a, buddy, I'm a Brennan Lee Mulligan fan. My other buddy recommended them. They're, and, they're, and very, then, they're like the two biggest D&D podcasts like, well, ever. So I the way you didn't explain it when you when you brought it up to me. Yeah. He explained that it's a bunch of mini campaigns. As yes, opposed yes. to like a longer form series. Mm-hmm. And I think I might appreciate that more. Mm-hmm. Because number one, the cast gets to be very diverse in the characters that they make. Yeah, and also and the like they, can get, they, they can get a lot more guests because they don't have to commit to like a really long campaign or anything like that. Exactly. And that part is very cool. So I might do that. I know they're making another new D&D thing called Natural Six. Have you seen this? No. So it's a bunch of UK-based voice actors and actors who are doing um, a D&D campaign, and they're actually kickstarting it right now. Four. So it includes like like uh, the voice for Geralt. Okay. Um, and the voice of Rivia, you mean, right? Of Ri- Geralt of Rivia, okay, specifically. Good, 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 yes, good. Witcher. Um, <laughs> as well as uh, Clive Rossfield from Final Fantasy 16, Ben Starr, mm-hmm. shout out, who does a great job in his role. Um, no, what? And a few Why others. Does that one do that? Um, those are the two voice actors I, I know and I read about the other. There's uh, four others, I think, and they're all very, very well known okay. no, to my knowledge. That's very cool. Everyone check out Critical Role. Everyone check out Dimension 20. Everyone, I'm not even a big check D&D. out Natural 6 on, on Kickstarter. Okay. I'm not even like a D&D guy like that, and I really enjoy uh, all of those. See, I so I played Baldur's Gate 3 earlier this year, which we've talked about. Right. And that shit got me on a, a fantasy kick. Oh, I'm in I'm in the Patrick I'm in the Patrick area. Oh, is this it? This is why yeah. you like the dream? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Very well, sir. Challenge. What is the challenge? Very well. <laughs> Genius. You did it. This game has really good writing, dude. I'm a fan. I'm really annoyed about it. <laughs> you wish you could write like that? Dude, I'm about to find six. I do. I'm not fucking clever enough for it. It's really annoying. Oh, that you didn't write SpongeBob? That, like, SpongeBob's so well written, is my point. What if you wrote SpongeBob really well and then you played him? Would you be mad? Would would you would people be valid and <laughs> oh be mad at you for God, playing he's SpongeBob? Oh, my God, going on about it. <laughs> yeah. I love Lynn. I love Lynn. <laughs> I do love Lynn. It's just, it's it's a little bit disingenuous, I think. He, he Remember when 69. he said in the play, when he said, if I, 69, I didn't even freak out. I didn't even care. When he, when he goes, when he goes, he goes, if I could prove that I never meant to play Hamilton and instead <laughs> the guy dropped out at the last second and I, then I played him. He goes, Eliza, <laughs> Eli- won't you 69 me? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Eliza, George Washington is coming over for dinner. <laughs> you know? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I remember when that happened. Eliza, Eliza. Fuck that, fuck that special. It didn't save it. I have fucking three fucking shiny <sighs> objects to my name. Do you want me to do Kelp Forest? I could do whatever you want me to do. It's up to Let you. Let me do Kelp Forest. Wait, can I do Dutchman first and then you do Kelp Forest? All right. I- Wait, how many more levels are fight? there? Actually, you fought in every single boss. Why don't you... You can fight... Yeah, you can fight, Robo, fight Ro- Robo Punch. Can I be honest? That's the boss that made me quit the game when I was a kid. Really? Yeah. I Robo- remember it being, like, incredibly hard. It's fucking annoying is what it is. Okay. It's just a bunch of enemy spam and shit, dude. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna... Can I just do half and half here, and then you fight Robot SpongeBob That's and fine win me. the game? That's fine. Okay. That's yeah, I just, good... just want to quickly get all the all the spatulas that we need. Yeah. We're doing T-Bell tonight, right? Oh, I would like to. Nice. That'd be nice. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, shout out T-Bell. Shout, shout uh, out the Deluxe <laughs> Cravings box at T-Bell for $6. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. Dude, it gives you like so a lot of food for good. $6. It's so good. I get like three Doritos Locos tacos sometimes, and it's like more than $6. I, and then you get like a fucking Chalupa Supreme, uh, a new... A five-layer a, beefy burrito. Yeah, a fucking uh, a new kidney in case you lose yours. A new ki- a new what, kidney? Yeah, 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 just in case you lose yours, you know. One of my buddies growing up actually only had one kidney. Oh my God, why do you have like such morbid <laughs> stories? It's not morbid. You know, I think he was just like born that way. He lost a yeah. in football or some shit like that. Okay, I'm not... Uh, listen, I'm sorry if, I, if I'm no, implying that he's morbid. He's not. He's... We we were we were cool. We were cool friends. I was actually gonna donate him my kidney at one point. I was like, Oh my god, really? Yeah. Well, I was just like, Fuck it. Like, why do I need a kidney? Okay. Like that was sort of my belief. I still would, frankly, if he reached out to me on like Instagram or whatever. I yeah. would, and he was like, Dude, can I have your kidney? I'd be like, Fuck yeah. I'd be like, Give me like two fifty for him. We're solid. I found a good let's play partner, guys. Yeah. Well, I'm I'm, <laughs> I'm type O blood type. So. Oh my god, he's such a he's such a giving guy. Did you play support in League of Legends when you played? No, I played ADC. Really? That's surprising to me. Did we not play League of Legends I together? Don't, I don't know if we've played it like very much. Can I just go off the edge? Yeah, here? you can. That's the point. Okay. 
Um, for the brief moment where I played League of Legends, which, by the way, fuck that game. Okay. Um, I played for a decade and fuck that game. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I played ADC because I I enjoyed top, but I didn't like being alone. Uh -huh. So I had to basically play ADC because that's the one where you have a support, like hold your hand. Okay. And um, I liked dealing damage because numbers are cool. I enjoyed getting top. So, <laughs> geez. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Never mind. Bro. I don't know why I'm pirate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because we're on the Flying Dutchman level. Oh, true. Um, so whenever I would play, I would always do the lowest amount of damage because I was too much of a bitch to play ADC. Okay. Um, Here's the thing about ADC and legal. Any League of Legends heads out there, you can vouch for this. Fuck League of Legends. Um, ADC has kind of sucked for a lot of its lifespan because they die really quick, right? Like that's yeah, kind of the trade-off. They, they do a lot of damage and then they die really quick. Here's the kind of thing that's unspoken that, like, a lot of... Unless you're, like, kind of a higher-level player, you don't really notice this as much. Um, ADCs do not do the most damage in the game. Why, no, why it's is, always, like, mid. Why? Yeah, why Why is a roll call attack damage carry not doing the most damage in the fucking game? Because they always n over nerf ADC. And I, it's yeah, like, a, and that's, like, a lot of, like, MMOs and stuff, too. Like, they're like, oh, this character is ranged. We have to make sure they don't do too much damage. Like, bro, like, you die in two hits. If you, you fuck up a little bit and you're dead, and then a dude with... 7,000 health can run up on you and do more damage than anyone in the entire game, like, easily. Yep. It's very weird. Also, meanwhile, if someone could play as fucking, like, Cat in League, and she could just fucking teleport all over the map and throw daggers and shit from 10 miles away. Yeah. Because that, that makes sense. Now, like, I think you might have fucked yourself. Uh, and I'll do it again. You could do this, you could do this, you could do this. And then... SpongeBob, SpongeBob, Patrick, 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 Squidward, Squidward, Sandy, Sandy, Larry, Pearl, Mr. Krabs, Mr. Krabs, Mr. Krabs, and Plankton. Um, <laughs> I like talking about League with you, man. <laughs> yeah, me too. We should play that shit on channel. That, that would be interesting. That would be like our COVID special. Yeah, but it's like COVID's been, um, you know, not it's like on, but we're not. What the fuck? I'm in the booty hole. Yeah, you're in the booty hole. Arr, you're in me booty! Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> no, it's um, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I let the intrusive pirate thoughts win. Uh, what the fuck? There's a tongue section? Yeah, for like three seconds. Ah, oh, damn, SpongeBob, you a freak for that. Yeah, I respect right. it, though. <laughs> I think I missed a spatula. Isn't there one where you... It's the one where you gotta drain the fucking main vein, bro. No idea. Remember? The main... The dick vein of the yeah, Flying the Dutchman vein of the, Yeah, yeah, I missed one right there. Goo... Goo tanker ahoy! Isn't that the one you just got, bro? No. No, go... Teleport to it, then. No. Yeah, it makes too... So, it makes too much sense, guys. <laughs> so... Fuck you. My bad, my bad. <laughs> So anyways, COVID special of when we play it League of Legends. It makes too much sense, guys. <laughs> I can't do it. It makes too much sense. <laughs> you gotta hit this shit. Oh, there we go. You remember? Yeah, now I remember. You don't remember. I do, I do. Okay. And then it drains the main vein. Yeah, the dick vein. The dick vein, and then you can... How the fuck do you get in there? You just jump down. Off the top. But in the cage, he's chucklehead. Sorry. What? Chucklehead. What? Oh, in the cage? I think you just walk up to it. For real. <laughs> really? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Is the cage gone now? Okay. I guess. See? Why didn't the cage go away in the cutscene? Because it was... A, I don't... Fuck, I don't know, Kind of silly, IMO. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of silly. Kind of kind of, kind of silly wacky. IIRC, pretty silly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did you miss at the beginning of the level? AITA? I don't know. I think there's like a collect fucking three testicles... Three of the Dutchman's nuts. Collect three testicles, yeah. Three of the Dutchman's nuts. I, male 23, am doing a Let's Play channel with my friend, male 25. Uh huh. And we started beefing over the Taco Bell menu. Am I the asshole? <laughs> Did we start beefing over it? Uh, you didn't believe me that they had a $5 cravings box. And then we went, and it was our first time. It was our first fucking time with the fucked up recording. And then uh -huh. they didn't have the $5 cravings box. So I was they right. got rid of that shit. Yes, to, an, to a... To a to a wrong extent, you were right. Okay. It was my saddest day being alive, <laughs> frankly. It's very frustrating for me. You got a friend with one kidney and that was your saddest day? 
I mean, again, he was like born with that shit, bro. Oh, okay, it's I'm not, sorry. No, it's, not, it's, <laughs> my fault. My fault. Is that kind of in poor taste? My, I mean, it's not in poor taste. It's just saying it's not like he would lost he it. would he laugh if I said that? Probably. I mean, he, he hasn't had a kidney for. I mean, how old am I? Twenty three. So he hasn't had a kidney for at least like thirteen years. Okay, I would probably laugh about it. At is that he thirteen? How old is he? He's fucking twenty three. He's my oh, age. But didn't you say he never had it? Yeah, I don't think he. I mean, he lost it before we became friends, and then I assume he still doesn't have. A second kidney. Okay. But you can live with only one kidney. He just yeah, can't play yeah, like yeah. football anymore. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I hope he's doing a shout out. Shout out to, um, you know who you are. Okay. <laughs> Would he like to be mentioned on the... I'm not going to say his Is he a name. special guest? Not mentioned by name. Not not like... We don't, we're not going to dox him, but... He is not um, a special guest because we haven't talked in, I don't know, years. That's more reason to bring him on the show. No. What the fuck? <laughs> Give us your 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 dirty tea on uh, on Addison. Uh, be like, I've got five. Where got are five. you? Where the fuck am I? See, this is my problem with these later levels, man. They're so fucking abstract. I'm at the beginning, it's bro. Like they become a su like a Super Mario 64 level. I think you have to jump down there. I want to go to I want to go to Kelp Forest. I think. <laughs> I think I'm sick of it, and I want to go to Kelp Forest. All right, bet. I think I can get four spatulas there a lot easier. You definitely can. Is there like you an obvious spatula can. that I'm missing? I mean, I'm missing like a Mr. Krabs one, but you need like fucking 4,000 shiny objects. So 3,000, yeah. 3,000, bro. Yeah, it's fuck? ridiculous. You're a silly goose, Krabs. He is a silly, silly goose, isn't he? We can do this. We can win the level. Hold on. No, this is Dutchman again. Yeah, Sorry. that's Dutchman. <gasps> Sorry, same <gasps> color palette. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly, bro. Why they put these two right next to each uh, other? No, he wouldn't be a special guest because I haven't talked to him. I like him, though. I like yeah. him. I fuck with him heavy. I hope he's doing well. Okay. Yeah, I have a lot of friends that like I don't talk to anymore, and I fuck with heavy. Like one of my friends from when I was growing up, he was in the same friend group with the kid with the one kidney. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's a funny story. We used to um, we used to like reenact WWE on this friend's trampoline. Okay. And my stepbrother, that that's six months my minor mm -hmm. uh, or my younger, he my did not mind. have friends growing up, so mm -hmm. he had to hang out with me and my friends, mm -hmm. um, which my friends did not like him because he didn't have friends. Right. And it wasn't like, like oh, he's like, you know, like people just didn't Is it like just him. because he was younger? No, he was just a fucking dickhead when he was younger. Okay. Like, he was in our grade and everything, like, just forever. Like, he was just a dickhead. Like, mm -hmm. he was just, like, not a nice person or anything like that. Right. And it took him a Look, while to, like, shit. took him, like, a while to mature. <laughs> That's kind of hot. Oh. I know, bro. Okay, sorry. He took a while to mature. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So eventually he got his own friends, but we like he had to hang out with my friends. So we used to reenact WWE, and this friend of our like mine, I'll just call him like I don't know. I'm just Greg. Gonna, uh, yeah, I'm gonna call him Greg. So Greg, Hi, Greg. Greg lived with his his mom and his grandparents, mm -hmm. and uh, his grandparents were super fucking nice. Okay. Um, and so. They had a trampoline, and we used to reenact WWE, and everything just, was just like here. dope. Yeah, it was that was easy. That's pretty sick. And uh, eventually, I had to bring my stepbrother over, and uh, while we were reenacting WWE, my fucking stepbrother's elbow went through the fucking trampoline, and he fucking busted up the trampoline. Uh <laughs> That's yeah, pretty sick. it was really fucking frustrating because everyone was like, every, I don't think everyone was mad at me, hmm. but I was like, dude, like, what the fuck? Like, you have to like, <laughs> like, this isn't your place. Like, you know, because he always goes crazy on shit. My, yeah. my younger stepbrother. And uh, did he do it on purpose, though? He, I don't want to say he did it on purpose. Like, I, I think it would be disingenuous to blame him about that shit. Right. But like, he definitely could have been more careful. Wait, is there a is there a, a um, thingy at Goo Lagoon that I didn't get? No. no? I just hate this level, man. Yeah, this, this level sucks. This part also, really you're like sucks. skipping all the Patrick shit. I think you're supposed to be in this area as Patrick. I think you're right, and I hate it, bro. Oh, I fucking hate this level. Um, Here's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm gonna what? go to Goo Lagoon. I'm gonna go to. I think. What it's... is the goal here? Get shiny objects and you're gonna grind crabs. fifteen thousand shiny objects right now. Fifteen hundred, right? 3, no, 000. fifteen thousand. You need fifteen thousand to get three spatulas. Yes. No shot. Uh, well, no, you need fifteen thousand to get five. Let's. Uh, no, I only need three. No, you need three thousand to get one. Okay. One times five is five. I need three. Five spatulas. times three. No. Oh, yes, you do. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah. Excuse me. I thought you were still at seventy. You're valid. There's this. Uh, there's this shit over here where you can farm shiny objects. Oh, where was I going with the story? Oh yeah. So this friend Greg. Yep. Um, he works at a gym in like the town that we went to high school in. 
And uh, my sister still lives in that town. My sister, who's two years younger than my, mind you, so she's she's twenty at this point, and she's gonna be twenty one later this year. Okay. And uh, he fucking she goes to his gym that he like works at, mm-hmm. and uh, he he was hitting her up. He was like trying to hit on her and shit. Um. And then my sister was like, "No, I don't want to date him. He's gross. He has a mustache. Yada yada." yada. Okay. I was like, "He's a really nice guy, and I fuck with him." I was like, "You should go on a Me date with him." Me twirling my mustache. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> uh, no, I don't know. Yeah, she was. That was a good. That's amount. good. That's a good. You could probably hit right? that like a few more times. Is there like a quicker way to get like over here though? I don't know, Fuck, bro. Do I have to go in the sea caves every single time and like? No, you should just be able to spawn at the the end, right? Do you really have to go through the sea caves? There's gotta be a different place where you can spawn, right? Yeah, I feel like there should be. All right, maybe I get one thing here and then I go back to Dutchman. I'd rather do Dutchman than fucking Kelp Forest. That's one section. That one section sucks because there's the one yeah. part with the slide. The slide is fine. The yeah, the slide slide's is valid, fine. but yeah, yeah, it's just kind of crazy. All right, kind of cringe. All right, that you get all that, you destroy all that, right? And then you go over here. And I think this nets you like five, six hundred, if and I'm that's not mistaken. You, like, a good amount. Yeah, yeah, I think I might get almost. Almost the fucking 3,000, yeah, yeah. We're about 500. Yeah, you can... So if we get the 3,000, then we only need two more spatulas. And we can just... We could do the one at um, kelp and one at flying. Let's just go straight to flying Dutchman. Why don't... <sighs> Bring me back here. No, go... Okay. I, got <laughs> I was going to say go at the beginning, but it's fine. Um, oh, right, because of the... Because of the... Because of the... Because of the yeah. box. The box. Yeah, yeah. Pulling you, out the coop in the lot. Told them fuck 12 fuck SWAT. There we go. Busting out the bells of the box. You ever have any friends hit on your sister? Uh, no. It's a weird experience. Yeah, no, no. I, I, we're, I mean, we're like three years apart. So like in school, it would have been kind of weird. Like in like middle school. And like yeah, in like middle school or high school. But like, I'm done college. She's my age. She's done college. Yeah. Well, I, don't, I mean, I, none of my friends have hit on her. No. Oh, okay. Respect. Um, You're lucky. Yeah. yeah, I don't, I don't. Stay blessed, dude. Yeah. I don't know. I think that's kind of weird. Um, yeah, it is weird, but he's a nice guy, so Is there respect a special it. down yes, here? Yes, dude. Yes, I was trying to tell you that last time. Wow. Yeah, I know. Well, thanks for letting me know. I did let you know. <laughs> I did. Don't even get me started. Well, where is it? You have it? to do a race, I'm pretty sure. Like, there's, like, a gate that opens. You have to, like, press the fucking... Wait, is that, a, is that it over there? The fucking... Do you see the glowy? Um. Yeah, that's the cage. You have okay. to come the other way. So I have to go over all the way over here. Yeah, and dude. And then it's like you have, I would do yep. SpongeBob probably. Yeah, exactly. SpongeBob. 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 <laughs> Fat dick. <laughs> Fat dick, dude. Nice. Um. Yeah, man. That's all I got. That's, I'm, cool. out, I'm, cool out of, I'm out of Let's Play Steam right now because I. Uh, really? No, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. Oh, okay. I was no! gonna say I was like, we've been recording for for what an hour? Wait, what the? Do I need to? Hour? No, no. I, did, I meant like that joke took so much out of me that I had. Do I really need to? Shut the fuck up. <sighs> there it fucking goes, dude. Uh, all right, maybe I just get the rest of the fucking spatulas in this level then. Yeah, you might as well. And then maybe if I get to three K, then I bada bing bada boom. But... You won't. You know how insane it would be if you got to three K? That'd be cool. Yeah, I could do it. This one's actually a really hard race, to Not be fair. Not for me. Not when you're John Hub. Yeah? Okay, let's see a John T. Hub. Let's go. Let's go. All right, go f- I'll fuck myself then. <laughs> I can still fuck it up. <sighs> oh, yeah. You're oh, clean. Yeah. You're clean. I'm a, I'm kind of a goat gamer. I just can't call attention to it. Every time I say I'm the ultimate gamer, I immediately like shoot myself in the foot. Yep. But, uh... I don't oh. remember that spatula at all, bro. Now take the uh, box back. Yep. Pulling well, out the coop in the lot. Sure. All right. I could, I could definitely get two more spatulas on this fucking You box. got this. Any stories you want to share for the Let's Play? Um. Well, I got to plan that before I actually do the fucking Let's Play, right? I, you can't just you can't just call attention to that like that. What are you talking about? I pissed my pants one time. Oh, that's true. <laughs> yeah, you told me about When's that. When's the last time you sharded yourself? <sighs> <laughs> fucking yesterday, I guess. What? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. How often do you shard yourself? That's a real question. Um, I haven't since I was uh, probably 15. Really? 16, yeah. You never live the rescue life. You don't take those rescue farts a lot, huh? Well, I just don't drink that often. Well, I don't think you need to drink to shard. Okay. I just don't... No, I got a, I got a good feel on my farts, bro. I, I can... You know, nothing's ever per, like guaranteed in this life, of course, but mm. I think I can definitely... With 99.9% accuracy, tell if a fart is going to be deadly. Okay, that's good. Tell if a fart is going to be fatal I mean, to you my know, trousers, bro. What are you counting as a shard, by the way? 
like actual shit comes out. Oh no. I mean I'll get like a you know, the turtle peeks out its head, you know. Okay. But nothing nothing crazy. Nothing like stains like, your I'm underwear not, though. Yeah, I'm not dropping a fucking log in my pants, okay, you know okay. what I mean? Okay, that's fair then. Yeah, yeah. So, so you didn't like. I'm talking. I'm not saying just like a wet fart. I'm saying like literally shit like gets on your underwear and then you have to fucking change underwear. No, not like a lot even. Just like a little fucking you know smudge or whatever. A little smidge of poop. A little, just a little. <laughs> you know. Yeah. No. Never. Okay. No, I mean, not never, but you know, I I don't really keep track of it. I'll just you know be like, oh, I guess I. Here's my story. Guess I gotta change my fucking underwear, you know? I was 14 or 15. I was playing Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm, the first one. Uh, okay. Because I was the only one that was out at the time, I believe. Yeah. Um, and, uh... Wait, no. When I was when 14 you were or 15? When you were four... That was 10 years ago. No fucking way. I don't you remember must have been when. playing the second one. I was playing the first. Well, maybe the other ones were out, but I was playing the first one. The third one came out... I remember I was playing the third one when I was in, like, seventh grade. Okay. So that, I mean, that must have been 10 years ago. Oh, wait, wait, right. It goes out and then in, right? Yeah. In any event, so you were playing um, that and playing then Playing Naruto were... Storm 1, the first one. Okay. <gasps> Hold on, I gotta climb this shit. Um, don't shart, don't shart. Okay. Uh, we're good. Um, <laughs> don't shart, don't shart. Don't shart, don't shart. Um, no, yeah, so I was, I was playing, yeah, I was playing the first one. Oh. Huh. 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 Nice. Um, and then, yeah, I just trusted the wrong fart, you know? Oh, okay. Just, sometimes in life, you just trust the wrong person, you trust the wrong fart. And uh, I did that. I cleaned up. Uh, I changed my underwear. And then... What? And then I fucking... I sat down again. I did it again. Wow. I that's... Like, 2X combo, bro. Honestly, that's, all, that's fair. For all my Tony Hawk fans out there, 2X combo. What? You know, I actually have a story about, like pooping recently okay um it's not me related but i well so this happened today actually i was getting home from my my job and i was on my my uh elevator for my apartment complex okay and so i was taking this elevator up and this guy came in at the same time as me and i, I haven't seen this guy in my apartment complex Dude. before but he had a he had a box of popeyes uh -huh. and so i got on the the elevator and i was like <laughs> i was like hey man like that smells really good i shouldn't have gotten on the elevator with you haha -ha, you know like yeah, just yeah. making a funny joke uh -huh. um because i can't and then he sharded on you <laughs> no <laughs> jesus christ i can't eat popeyes because i'm allergic to chicken and turkey oh you yeah, know this. yeah yeah yep um and a few other things. And so uh, this guy was like, yeah, man, you know, I always get it, but I always end up, you know, shitting myself for like an hour. Like, mm. I'm just I'm just stuck on the toilet. But I've never met this dude before in my life. I'm yeah. like, you don't you really don't need to tell me about how your bowels get destroyed after Popeye's, <laughs> dude. Um, that's my story. I like that. He got off the elevator and he reeked of like weed. And I was like, oh, yeah, dude, was he reeked of, of shit. No, he didn't reek of shit. Yeah. He just reeked of weed, which okay. was fine. Like, whatever. Sm yeah. Smoke a bowl. I don't give a fuck. But. Right. Um, smoke a bowl, chase a bag. Who, what do I care? Oh, fuck. Genuinely. Smoke a bowl, chase a bag. What do I care? <laughs> Die, fucker. All right, thank you. Like, no. Second most annoying enemy in the game. More fucking shiny objects, you gotta, dude. You got to pay for every... Capitalism-ass game. Dude, microtransactions-ass game. Oh, okay. It's the underwater bungee hook. I don't need to access that right now. Yeah, but the, we know a spatula's there now, which is good. That is indeed up, good. I need two. You, you missed one? Or maybe that's the one that's, you're on right now. Wait, top of the stack of ships, shipwreck bungee. I don't so know. So the bungee is the one you're on. You just passed. Can I, can I, I kill me? I don't know. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Brother, you have a hard life. <laughs> it's hard being John Hope. It's man. hard being John Hope. It's one of the hardest jobs there is being John Hope. He's a hard worker, guys. Get, come from Slack. Jesus I want it. Almighty. I want it first cycle. Can you just? I shouldn't wait? have to wait. Yeah, you should. <laughs> you should have to wait. <laughs> Fucking wait. Ah! <laughs> so frustrating. It's hard being me. It is hard being you, dude. <laughs> they should make a uh, SpongeBob Arxis fighting game. <laughs> That'd be kind of cool. Wouldn't it? Why can't I fucking stick? <laughs> dude, you want you want to hand it off? No. No. Oh, no, I don't. Wow. Keep that in mind, folks. I'd rather die. Keep that in mind. Then let Pla you touch this controller. Player one's trying to come out and take <laughs> over again. His, I've become toxic. His evil fucking identity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do got to do like retro game reviews and have like an evil persona that comes out. Yeah. This is ridiculous. <laughs> oh, oh, get it, get it, get it. SpongeBob, get it. SpongeBob, yeah. Patrick, nice Patrick. Job. All right. <laughs> I did it. I did it.
I did it, I did it, I did it. Don't knock me off. Fucking... How nice. would you like it if you died? All right, there we go. Uh, How would you like <laughs> it if you died? <laughs> it's a, this to him. Jesus no. almighty. If you got hit Dude, in the head with some... Are struggling. You might have better luck. Yep. No. Okay. Well, no. fuck me, I guess. Oh. This right. game sucks. Hey. What? Am I wrong? I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Oh my god! What the <laughs> fuck is this game? <laughs> Dude, you're doing great. By it, the way, it show it shows its age specifically on these fucking levels, bro. Yeah, truly. you're right. This is the one part that re uh, rehydrated does better, in my opinion. What does rehydrated do for this? It brightens the fucking level so you can see some shit. And then it fucking, like, does this shit fairly. Like, you actually... I don't remember struggling at all on these levels in the Rehydrated. <sighs> rehydrated baby mode. That's what I'm hearing. <laughs> Baby-ass mode game. No, because this isn't hard because it's fucking, like, designed to be hard. Watch, hard. I'll, do, I'll do a first try. Watch. Nope. Okay, he's afraid. He's I guess afraid. we'll never know how that's going to go. Because <laughs> I'm about to do it. <laughs> Cause I'm about to do it. There we go. Mother All I had to do was okay, trying to okay. take it. <laughs> that, that is how you. Uh, oh, die, fucker! Yeah. Nice. nice. Uh, more shinies behind you. I'm going straight to. Go okay. I'll, I'll get those. See. I, I'm going straight to fucking. Gulag. No, just get it. You've got one more spatula left, dude. What's gonna take more time? It guarantee. Mm -hmm. The gulagoon shit. You're gonna have to cycle no, this shit you at go, least because you go times. to the ship, right? Don't you go to the ship and then you have to get all the cannons on the different ships? It's not that long. You'll Ugh. be fine. I guess I'll be fine, guys. Also, this is one of the levels that has a fucking boss fight that not a lot of levels have. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to do the boss fight, but... In an anticlimactic sort of way, I'm going to Gula Gula. You're so lame. <laughs> <laughs> He's so lame. Fucking bully him, chat. I am what I am. And that's all right. And what's wrong with that? It's like being a uh, wreck of Ralph, dude. I am who I am. I am who I am, and that's all right. I'm cringe, but that's all right. You knew it. Yeah, you knew the meme. I'm, <laughs> I knew the line. I knew the exact <laughs> line that he says. I and you know what? Cringe. I found a faster way. I know a faster way to do all this shit. Check it out. <laughs> Kill <laughs> self. <laughs> well, it's funny that you say that. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I just thought it would be even faster way that isn't this. Hold on. Check this out. Literally okay. kill self. And then look, 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 look. Let's look, see look. this. Look where it puts me. Wah. You know? <laughs> and then. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, oh, oh okay. Oh, I need a, a better angle than that. Oh, yeah. Need a better angle than that. Just make sure you don't kill yourself before you get the, the spark place. Me never. Don't, okay, don't listen to me, I guess. I got them all. I got them all. They need to actually hit you. you I got that, right? them all. Okay, whatever, man. Come on, man. You think I didn't plan for all this? And look at and look at how many shinies I I can get all the Mr. Crab spatulas right now if yeah, I wanted to yeah, with this trick. You're going to have to cut this shit out. <laughs> I, I got it already. There we go. Okay, you're clear, you're clean with it. Nothing to cut out, bro. You got to cut it out, if anything. Me? I don't... <laughs> yeah. Fuck, dude. I haven't said I got to cut the episode. You got to cut it out. Oh, come on, man. Stop. <laughs> I'm playing. <laughs> He's playing, sure. I'm playing. Guys, I'm playing. I'm not... I'm only kind of a dickhead. IRL. <laughs> I'm only... <laughs> kind of? Yeah, yeah, yeah Only kind right, of. Hand that shit over. I got to walk over to it, too. Really? <laughs> Rip, really? Yeah, you fucking can't do really. it. <laughs> fucking player one over here, folks. <laughs> I gotta do it all. I gotta do all that. He just wants to play video games. That's all he wants to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He just wants me to commentate with him. And it's in your hands. Oh, it's oh, like a fucking God. drug for him. Oof. <laughs> Jesus. What are you playing right now, by the way? I'm playing... Dude, I'm losing so hard on this level. I'm playing fucking nothing right now, bro, oh. to be honest. That's your chance to... Yeah, I see that now. Shoot the cruise bubble. Shoot the cruise bubble? No, I have to hit this fucking glove, dude. No, you shoot the cruise bubble. No, dude, watch. Fuck. I've never seen anyone do this level this way. Well, I have to hit all of them eventually anyways, right? You're... Yeah, but you can you can hit the other hand. Oh, I would like to point out that they copied this boss fight from... Um, like, you can hit that hand right now if you wanted to. They, uh, they copied this boss fight from Sonic Adventure 2, as an FYI. Okay, you can hit him again. Oh, no, never mind. Like, he's there. 
mega plankton, actually. Okay. I don't think it's actual plankton, right? Uh, yeah, it's a robot. Isn't that like the whole you thing? Yeah, hit him. You hit the robot. Oh fuck! Robot plankton, you mean? Yeah, yeah. Fuck me. Hold on. See, I thought I remember a different thing first. Mother fuck, dude. Hold on. All right, let me not backseat. All right, I'm. It's, I'm, I'm it's inverse flight controls, right? Yeah, it is. I didn't fucking realize until just now. Okay, well, you could also like fucking smack him with your spatula. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Yeah, you could like just jump and get him and then get back up. There we go. See, it's it's a it's a hard game. Oh my god. There we go. Um, so yeah, they copied this from Sonic Adventure 2, specifically the, uh, Egg Mech, the Egg Pyramid boss fight. Okay. You know, um, in the pyramid before Eggman goes to space? I'm aware. Wait. Oh, yeah, they did. Yeah, yeah, I, I guess, yeah. Right? This is the same exact shit. I've never even considered doing it that way, I'm not gonna lie to you. Really? I'm not gonna call you crazy for it, but I... Because it makes sense, right? No, no, because when he, when he chops with one hand, the other hand is vulnerable, and you can hit that with the cruise bubble, too. I mean, I guess. I don't know why you're overthinking it, though. Because... I, come on. Because I you can hit... Because he, he stays still a lot longer for you to shoot the cruise bubble than he does for you to jump over two platforms and then ground pound him, you know what I'm saying? Cause me at compartmental, if I if I could hit every single spot the same way, why wouldn't I, you know? I don't know. Just seems like basic, you know? Uh yeah, but Dude, you told me I could hit him. You lied to me, John. You just gotta jump farther and then hit him. Thanks. <laughs> he hated me because I spoke the truth. <laughs> yeah. They hated him cause he cause he told the truth. Where do I need to go? You gotta hit that planking, bro. I'm trying. I'm working on it, bro. And you gotta do that today. Chill. <laughs> and you gotta do it before the end of this session. Oh, watch out for the karate attack. I'm nice with it? You are nice with it. I would like to point out who died on uh, fucking King Jellyfish three times. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm fucking joking. Okay. But th this one, I know like the back of my hand, truly. I, I, fight, I fought this boss so many times as a kid. This is probably my most fought boss. Like in any game? Um, No, just in this game. Okay. Well, maybe. You know what? Maybe. I don't know. I'm trying to think of a boss I fought more. I didn't play a lot of the Souls game or Elden Ring. Is that your most fought boss? Like a boss in like uh, Dark Souls or something? Yeah, probably like... Pontiff Sullivan, I know really well. Dancer of the Boreal Valley, I know really well. Okay. A lot of the Dark Souls 3 bosses. Okay. So excited for that playthrough body, by the way. Mm -hmm. That fucking playthrough is going to be the best. I'm so pumped for it, dude. Let's, let's run it. I'm not. I'm probably not going to like touch Dark Souls at all if we play it. Like, oh, I'll, dude, I'll let you do everything. You're playing every other boss. Every, no, every time I no, die, no, you're no. taking over and vice versa. Yeah, I'm, yeah my, I'm a, my playtime is going to be like 40 hours. Yours is going to be like four. Like yeah. It's, it's going to be like a huge difference because I'm just so unfamiliar with the game. It's going to be awesome. We'll just do it. We'll do an easy dex, dex build. No Dex, need. Dex build him in Dark Souls 3, by the way, is like... Oh, kill his ass. Kill his fuck. ass. Throw it. No, dude. I was going to die. No. Because the uh, Dex build in Dark Souls 3, you could just use the Cell Sword Twin Blades and you you decimate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, which I've never used. I always end up using the Ithril Straight Sword, which is actually fucking garbage. But we got it. So, okay. Cool story about Dark Souls 3. Mm -hmm. My one buddy, when Dark Souls 3 came out, which I guess was 2016, um, he came over... What the fuck, dude? I've never had fucking problems with this before. There you go. There you yeah, go. Yeah, I see it. And so, um, in 2016 when the game came out, oh we used to host God, fucking sleepovers. Karate, we used to host sleepovers at my one buddy's house. Mm. And, uh, oh my God, I'm dead. <sighs> no. Oh my God. No, no. Ah. That's it. That's it. Kill him. Kill him. Um, so we used to host buddy like sleepovers Sponge at my bombs, buddy's Sponge house. Bombs. And my one buddy brought over Dark Souls 3. Okay. And uh, we were like, Dark Souls? Like, isn't that a really hard game? Yada, yada. He bought it on a whim, right? Mm -hmm. So we end up playing it all fucking night mm -hmm. until like 4 a.m. And then everyone bought the game the next day because it was that. That's pretty sick. Fun. Yeah. So that's, we all, a, that's a that's a, like an epic gamer moment. It was actually like the game is very, very 
important to me. Yeah. What the fuck? I should have watched this cutscene. What was the, the most epic gamer moment you think has ever happened to you? Ever? Yeah. Uh, top 300 NA opening night of Dragon Ball Fighters. Okay. You know, what? I didn't even think of it like like that. Like that that is a really epic gamer moment for me. I mean, I hit Diamond in League of Legends. That's a pretty epic gamer moment. Um, that's like the dream, you know. I remember I hit Diamond, and people I went to high school with were like, "Bro, can we can we play a game together?" Are you was, for real? Yeah, yeah, like for real. Like I, I, Jesus. I, I achieved clout through just hitting Diamond or whatever. I got like 13 likes on Twitter or whatever. I was like, check me out, gang. Check me out, gang. For real. Sure. This is why this level fucking blows. By the way. Oh, you don't like this part? I hate this part with like every fiber of my fucking being. Do you want me to do the last part where you have to hit the fucking three different thingies? Oh, I, I'm no, I'm I'm good at the cruise bubble. I'm, I can do the cruise bubble really well. I think I could do it. I okay. think I got it. We'll see. Yeah, I don't I don't want to just. Oh. Okay, I thought I hit him before he started up his animation, yeah. but fuck I don't me, think I you can even hit them like on the side. You have to grump on no matter what. That's really annoying. Does Plankton show up again? Yeah, he shows up every single fucking part of this level, dog. Nice. Yeah, I'm nice with him. Beat his ass to it. Wait, are there no checkpoints on this level? Uh, there are for every single platform, I think. I think they're just hidden checkpoints. Okay, good. Oh my goodness. SpongeBob, SpongeBob, Patrick. I think there's one more, and then I have to do the three inside, right? I believe so. Yeah. Right. yeah. We're going to try it. I'm going to try to do it, and then we're going to see what happens. You gotta hit him with the. What's wild though is you can literally just use Fuck. the cruise bubble too. I know, but I want to play the game as it's intended, John. Okay, well, fuck me, I guess. It almost behooves you to not, though. Behooves me. <laughs> I don't know if I'm using that word right. You definitely aren't. Well, did, did, does this shit feel behooving to you? Yeah, it feels behooving. I got I got behooved. Mm -hmm. Fuck. Oh. Dude. Why did do the camera like that? Uh, I don't know. It could. Dude, come go, on. Go, go. Are you for fucking serious, dude? Oh, no. It's fine. It's not hard to dodge. It's just annoying. It's just annoying because he does that shit fucking forever. Okay. Get his ass. And then he moves over a little bit to the side. Dude, I mean, like, he's shit like made. that. It's he's shit like made. He is bitch made. It's just Plankton's shit like that. a bitch and he made him, so he's bitch made. And he made him. I think he made that robot, right? No, dude. That's the whole point. The, the robots became too smart and they... They, like, took over. Oh. It's, like, very much a 2023 tale in that regard. <laughs> <laughs> or a 1984 tale in many or ways. Or a 19... Holy shit, January 1984. Mm-hmm. Am I... Am I an idiot? It must be. No. You're smart. They also don't friend. give you any, like... Like, undies, dude. Yeah, man. They're, they're pretty unforgiving in this shit. Yeah, dude. When you, when you no undies it. for the fucking charters. True. What if SpongeBob shards? He just loses an underwear. Ah. <gasps> horse shit, dude. What a load of horse piss, for real. Wait. And then it does this shit. Wait, 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 wait. There's no. You're at the beginning again. I know. It's a lo it's a load of crap, dude. So there's no checkpoints. No checkpoints. No fucking undies. And you get fucking enemy spam for the entire level. Oh my god. I'm dead. Wait. It oh, that fucking him. went through him, dude. Motherfucker, bro. You don't deserve half the shit this game throws at you, man. You don't really deserve don't. it, bro. Don't let that game treat you like that, man. I really should, like, unionize against this shit. I'll end the Let's Play right now. <laughs> we don't gotta finish this fucking game for that. Honestly, dude. <laughs> That'd be fucking wild. <laughs> we just... I'm dead. Rage so hard. That'll be me, IRL, for real. True. Fuck off. Okay, okay. Bam! I got it. I got it on memory, bro. He's it's got it on memory. On memory. And that's on memory. Oh my god. If you're I this think if you're goober. really risky, you can jump up and hit him with the fucking spatula and then get back, like You probably could if you were a, like a way better player than I am. I mean for fucking real. Alright, let's go. Oh that's no. such a far jump. Bitch moves away too. Did you see that? Yeah. Let me let me uh, dude, I'm 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 at the ready, bro. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I beat this level so many times as a kid. You stay on lock, alright? I'll st I'll I'll be on I'll be on standby in case you need me. I'll be your understudy. Yeah, unlike Lin Manuel Miranda. <laughs> if I can prove that I <laughs> Are we like certified despite both of us loving Lin Manuel Miranda, by the way? Yeah. Like I think we're just memeing on him too hard. He's gonna find this and be like He's gonna hurt. find this and be like I'm not gonna show up on the show. <laughs> Or he's gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> he lies. I grab he my lies. things. John and Addison. 
they're getting DMCA'd. <laughs> <laughs> For the perfect impression, they're going to be like, how did they replicate my voice? They must have used AI. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I think we're really good at that. <laughs> ha! You don't even know what you're asking me to confess. Oh my god, and my laugh was too fucking loud. I clipped the mic again. <laughs> you're, okay, you're good. You're, good. Jeez, you're gonna listen back to this. You're gonna be like, how come half the audio cut out? I'm gonna have the audio just. <laughs> yeah, because I got. <laughs> I don't have to tell you anything at all, unless. Oh, dude, I was so scared. If I can prove that I. Never. Never touch my balls, would you? <laughs> Have you seen that version? No. No, someone just, <laughs> someone just did a really bad voiceover over just that part where he's like, if I can prove that I never touch my balls. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking uh, YouTube poop version of Hamilton. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That shit would be right up your alley, dude. Am I making it? You I'm sure have. there's a Hamilton YouTube poop somewhere. Uh, I mean, see what fucking happens, dude? It, fucking, it like, doesn't want you to use the fucking bowling ball, truly. It really like doesn't. It, it, it puts it there, but it doesn't want you to use it. And that's just that's just some trickery that fucking Plankton would pull, to be honest with you. Oh, my God. I'm Nos, doesn't, don't, don't care that you took a hit. doesn't matter. Honestly, yeah. Benefit, bro. Benefit. Eliza. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really good musical. You see there's a Roblox... Hamilton I gacha did. game. Yeah, where you can unlock like George Washington and shit. You can dude. get a fucking SSR uh, Elizabeth Schuyler. Eliz SSR <laughs> Elizabeth Schuyler. Is that her name? Yeah, I think so. The Schuyler sisters, That's Angelica, that. Peggy, <laughs> no, There's no Elizabeth. Who's fucking Elizabeth? It's fucking Angel Angelica Schuyler. Angelica, Peggy, and say. fucking Eliza. 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 Oh my god. <laughs> you must have clipped it, bro. <laughs> All right, right. He's moving to the He's right. Moving to the I right. fucking got you the have read, the exact, dude. Like, fucking, the exact fucking Pico pixel, bro. Pico you know the pixel. No, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, you know, like uh, it's the smallest, like a Pico meter. It's the smallest unit of measurement. You're actually wrong. It's a plank length. A plank length. Yeah, that's true. I think you can roll a bo a bowling ball through that shit. Well, no. that doesn't work, dog. Okay, I lied to you. It's all good. All right, please don't die, bro. Please fucking don't die. I'm gonna like. If you Dude, want me to do this part, I can, bro. You're gonna have to take your. You need, yeah. You need to kill plankton on each, at each one. Okay, now go, go, go. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. You can fucking do it, friend. Have you ever played Tie the Tasmanian Tiger? No, I think we talked about obscure 3D platformers. I haven't played. Yeah, I don't really love it. Um, I nope. think he's gonna. Yeah, yeah. I think he's gonna attack you. Oh God, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it, friend. You can do it to right? the to the right. Yo, I, I didn't it's dedicate. Okay. Oh. I didn't dedicate. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, you had so. I feel like you could have thrown another one out. I it's, probably could have. I felt like I had so much time, shit. but then there's a really long warm up animation. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, just dude, just, are you for fucking real? Uh, I gotta actually aim it. It's like yeah, playing yeah. baseball. You, Set yeah, your you, feet and you aim. You have to be like dude. facing the direction that he's okay. gonna be, basically. All right, he's got it. Yeah, yeah. Let him. Yeah, let him move a little bit. Let him cook. There you go. There you go. Now, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, oh my god. Boom! Boom, bitch, boom. Direct hit, fucker. Alright. Alright, I got three undies left. I think that's the last... I think that's the last guy, too. It's gotta be. Alright, I'm not gonna go. You're not gonna greed for him? I'm not gonna greed. It's, like, not oh. worth it. I learned my lesson through ADC like, yeah, yeah, yeah. mentality. Let's fuck it. Oh, could you imagine if you just went through that shit and hit him anyway? Are you for fucking... Uh, I can't believe... I definitely went through him there, right? Yeah, like you you were either or you were a plank's length away. I know? was a plank's length away. Okay. 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 You could do it. You could do it. This one's like nearly a straight shot. Oh! I'm kind of hot with it, dude. Oh my I'm kind of hot. And we almost unionized and ended the whole freaking we playthrough. <laughs> we did almost unionize for a higher pay <laughs> and fairer benefits. We want fucking dental, YouTube. And SpongeBob and SpongeBob. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Those big fucking man arms, dude. <laughs> you don't like his arms? No. He worked for those shits, okay? No, the fuck he did? He's got the anchor arms. Oh, those shits fucking start farting, too. Oh, yeah, there's the fart. They look fucking dis This game is kind of disgusting. Yeah, it's very A nightmare fuel. Yeah. Like, they knew they were making some nightmares. It's like the, the shading on the character, or lack thereof, on the characters. Yeah. yeah they Sandy look looks really weird in this game. Because she, like, just isn't shaded at all. Yep. No outline, no, like... 
She's scary. Well, she's got that that dome on her head, you know. Oh, she got that dome on she, her. She, she, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you said it. Yeah, I got you, dude. Sandy I'm fucking head? plankton. Oh, two fucking planktons. If um, um, all right. If I could prove that I never <laughs> broke the law, would you ever tell another plankton that you saw? What you saw? No one else in the room when it happened. Is that a yes? Is that a yes? Um, <laughs> yes. Erm. Um, <laughs> yes. <sighs> Man. What a good ass fucking musical, dude! I'm gonna listen to it on the way home. Now. Good ass musical. Check out Hamilton. I'm, it's a little underground. I don't know if everyone's heard about it, but yeah, it's check out Hamilton, good. guys. Um, and uh, you know, it's kind of nice of us to, you know, as, as such a large uh, platform to promote like like smaller creators and stuff. Yeah, we really try our best. Yeah, yeah. there's this new thing called Broadway. Um, <laughs> it's pretty underground. <laughs> it's pretty. You don't know about it yet, but but you will soon. I was um I was getting tired of that cutscene. They don't have subtitles in this game, so I can fucking hear it anyways. Yeah, we got the we got the sound a little low, but oh, we can still done? hear the sound. Yeah, yeah, you beat the game. You freaking did it, buddy! I'm so happy, Heavy Iron, dude. Heavy Iron Studios. Great job, Heavy and Iron. I thought it was THQ also, or maybe um just... THQ is the producer, I believe, or the pu like okay. the, the publishing company. But I'm pretty sure Heavy Iron are the developers. This is an okay ending part. I kind of wish that they gave you like a million shiny objects instead of like three lined up in like a, a row here like a yeah i think my issue is you have to go around this entire level and it's like not the most fun to yeah if you if you counted how many they probably give you less shiny objects than that place on top of the fucking goon that i was farming really like probably right like where where's all the fucking shiny they give there's you gotta be like singular like shiny a objects. bunch like a bunch of like purples or whatever it's a little silly the issue is that you have to play in ball form the entire time and it makes it like fucking impossible to get if I can prove that I never turn into a ball, would you <laughs> SpongeBob's balls. If, if I can prove that I that I went inside a ball, that I turned into a ball, would you promise not? To... No Tom else. Kenny has SpongeBob, dude. <laughs> Up and coming actor Tom Kenny. <laughs> yeah, for real. I hope he does great things. I hope he gets the chance to play SpongeBob again. He did a really great job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I heard they just, uh, I heard that he wrote the character and then they just kind of, you know, he cast himself as it. With no understudy, right? Yep, yep, yep. I don't know. Should we read, let, let me, before we end this fucking episode, let me, let me read the story. Let me read how, how history, how history hi has its eyes. On, all right. Uh, yeah, honestly, who will be the one to tell your story? It's fucking Addison from Addison and John. How, why is Lynn Manuel, why is Lynn Manuel Miranda famous is the top search. I don't, I mean, uh, I, I guess that's a, that's a decent question if you don't know who that is. Because he's a good writer. Like, he's a really good, like, songwriter. Right. Why, did, or let me, hold on. Why, why did Lynn cast himself as Hamilton? Let's find out. The decision was part of his artistic vision for the production. Uh, Lin Manuel Miranda's portrayal of Alexander that. Hamilton received critical acclaim and played a significant role. You can't, you can't doubt though. You can't say that he didn't do a good job in that role. Though. I'm not gonna say he didn't do a good job. I'm just saying it's a different. I just, I think it's a little disingenuous. That's all. I and I love him. I love the man. I think he can do whatever the hell he wants. I mean, you think that? I don't. Whatever. Mm. You're entitled to your own opinion. I might think that opinion is a dumbass one, but you're I entitled here's, to it. Here's what I think: when, <laughs> when you, when you have a vision for something, like it comes from your experiences. I feel like a lot of the themes, even though it's based on historical events, with some things changed around, of course. Like some of those things are, are you know, they're exacerbated. No, no. I just, I just mean when, when, when you write something, you're writing from your own experiences. I'm sure, like. Not not only was Hamilton just like a retelling of events in a certain way, but it was uh, a very personal thing for Hamilton also. I feel like that's that's something that a lot of like people that don't write or aren't like creatives don't, I guess, think about sometimes. Because they're like, oh, why why is the story so personal about this thing? What does this have yeah. to do with the story? It's like, no, that's a part of like this person's... What the fuck is this area? This is the police station. You've is never this, been in here? What the fuck? Is there anything in here? Yeah, they have a database on all the enemies. So they profile all of them. Great. They, they racially profile all the enemies. Yeah. Great. Great. Cool. There's even... Great yeah. way to end the Let's Play. Great. <laughs> Bye, everyone. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> all right.